British summer. As the heat wave hits, the British public are making the most of it while it's still here. Here's Carol buying an ice cream from a local vendor, playing games at the fair, and frolicking about in the sun. But Carol has forgotten that jewelry maker celebrates Christmas in July, a chance for customers to get their supplies in ready for their Christmas designs and gifts. So Carol can say goodbye to that ice cream and hello to that Christmas jumper as we present Christmas in July. Oh, Carol, you scamp. Jewelry makers, this Wednesday at 10 a.m. to celebrate Christmas in July, I get to bring you a very, very special gemstone. I get to bring you Sakota Emerald. Now look, I've worked with this gemstone since about 2006, and it has always been one of the most prolific and sought after emeralds from the Bahia state in Brazil. Because originally in Brazil, up until the 1980s, the Carniba mine was the mine that everybody utilized, that everybody wanted to get their hands on. But move back 12 years, and this discovery at the Sakota mine was groundbreaking. And this Wednesday at 10 a.m., I get to bring it back for you guys for one special show, one special hour, unbelievable prices, beautiful greens, and most importantly, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to give you the finest quality that we can bring. We wish you a merry. Oh, oh. Christmas. What do you mean? Why'd you say it like that? You weren't used to your Christmas t shirt. Yeah, do you want to do it again? Okay. Right. <clears throat> Goodness sake. We <laughs> wish you a merry Christmas. Yes. Yes. It's all right. That's it's only, a bit better. It's only 38 degrees <laughs> today, isn't it? <laughs> did you all sleep well? <sighs> did, you, did everybody sleep well? No, none of us did, but don't worry. It's cooling down. Thank goodness. <laughs> thank goodness. If there's a scene, I think it's um, Julia Roberts in some film, I can't remember which one it is, where she's literally stood in front of a fan doing this, oscillating with yeah, it. Following it around. That was me yesterday, <laughs> literally. Tom, Tom came into the kitchen, he was like, Elle, why are you stood there in your vest and pants? I was like, not a word. <laughs> not a word. Yes, I am walking around the house in my vest and pants, and I don't care. <laughs> I do not care. <laughs> oh, Ooh. stay indoors if you can, lovely jewellery makers. Yes. It is, oh. Do you know, I was sweating getting ready for work this morning. I know, morning. it's awful, isn't it? <laughs> it's, we've got one Bam good it. fan and one not very good fan in our house. So, Lo had the good fan. Yeah, oh, good, well done. Yeah. Well done. Just, you just, just like, you <gasps> just sweated. Yes. Yeah, it's all yeah. Right. Oh. Do you know, I, I knew that this, this heat wave was coming and, and the girls, uh, my girls' bedrooms get ridiculously hot. Um, they're the hottest rooms in the house, without doubt. And I ordered these little mini um, air conditioning units. Yes, yeah. Yeah, 50 quid well spent. Literally, they haven't arrived, have they? Oh, they're, no. They're arriving tomorrow. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. Apparently, there's going to be another heat wave. So there we are. You'll there, be prepared then. then. Um, but we're, oh, I tell you what. It's going to be absolutely glorious today, not just in terms of the weather, but also, also the show. Not only because we've this gorgeous bombshell. Only you can rock a Christmas T-shirt. <laughs> not at all. You do. You do. You. Ah, oh, thanks. I like Thank the old you. knotted. I and I've tried to make it cool. I have tried to, but yeah, I've, I've given up. A no, bit fair bit. play. You look lovely. Thanks. Fair play. I didn't even try. Didn't even try, like I said, I had the email from Chloe Jones. Can you wear your Christmas jumper? No, no, I can't. Um, anyway, back to the show. What have we got for you today? Can we start by talking about your kits? I know, I know. But it's, 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 both, it's both hours, isn't it? It's, they are... Well, I, I, I haven't I've even seen loved, the other one. I've loved doing these. Uh, this is a... Uh, you know, it's... Um, uh, a, just where you can just experiment so much. It's just lots and lots of different looks, and it was, it was really you lovely to have You must have been some. a very good girl to be given one of those bangles. Oh, thank you, Elle. I am always a very, very, very good girl. Yes. But how, how lovely. How lovely. So, yeah, the, the copper and the, and the silver. <gasps> <laughs> 
<laughs> and so, yeah, so that's the 12 o'clock one, rain, I think, isn't they're, it? They're absolutely awesome. Can I just give you, our lovely viewers a bit of a heads up? We are going to bring you that natural nephrite bangle individually. Yeah. And I don't think you've ever heard me say this, but don't buy it. Do not buy it. Because you might as well get the kit. That you will lose out if you buy the bangle on its own. You're better off getting the I mean, kit. it's... it's, it's it's stunning, isn't it? Nine o'clock, they, they're coming Oh, were they out. nine o'clock? Nine o'clock. Oh, OK. So, are we playing the bangle individually? Don't buy it. Buy the kit. That's what I'm just going to say. OK. OK? Yeah, awesome. Absolutely awesome. Um, loads of gorgeous sterling silver goodies. Of course, we've got Claire McDonald, so we're bound to. We've also got, as your deal of the day, one of your favourites, <clears> one of my favourites, I think, uh, uh, globally, since its discovery in 1987. It's younger than me. Um, Angelite. Is that? I didn't know it was only that. Um, yeah, that young. discovered in Peru that. in 1987. Wow. Dan, when were you born? 97. Ni oh, okay. 97? 97. I <laughs> okay, so it's 10 years older than you. Wow. Angelite. So, in terms of gems, is it the same? I tell you who it is the same age as. Director Adam. <laughs> you were born in 87. <laughs> were you? What? 87. Were you born in 87, Ross? Oh, when were you born? 1990. Oh. No. 70, uh... 70. Callum, oh. when were you born? 2000. Oh, 2000. no. <laughs> I'm sorry, I still think of the year 2000 as like five years ago. I, 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 you know, I was literally partying hard. Seventies are the best. Is the best decade, isn't it? Yeah, the 70s, yeah, yeah. We're 70, 70 yeah. Seventies. Um, <laughs> but you know what they say? You're as old as the right. Um, <laughs> right then. Yeah, you've got Angelite as a deal of the day. Look what Anne and Sue have made. This is absolutely beautiful. Oh, beautiful. Yeah. Absolutely stunning, and that's totally and utterly natural. I mean, not a single knot, it's literally just stranded on, that's and it's gorgeous. utter perfection. And then cast your eyes, as you can see, just to its right. Look at those amazing pearls. Well, they're coming up within this hour. Um, madness deal on those, absolute madness. And if you love the little pearl embellishment at the bottom, and I think Anne and Sue actually said, when you've got a class that's as beautiful as this, why mm. does it have to be a class? Yeah. Um, <clears throat> so they've actually used it as almost a decoration that's included in today's show <coughs> we uh, might well have a gemstone launch today as well and i say that uh, uh, you know cautiously because i've never there are lots of different varieties of chalcedony mm. out there i think we all know that don't we lots of different varieties of chalcedony but have you ever ever seen apple green chalcedony and it's rivers of all, it almost looks like chrysoprase running through. That's completely and utterly natural. That is coming up as part of a showcase in the 11 o'clock hour. That is lovely, isn't, isn't it? it? And beautiful? it goes beautifully with the angel eye as well. Yeah, and the pearls. Yes, yeah. Really amazing. Yeah. And your nephrite. Yes. Oh, yeah, all those lovely tones together. That's nice. Stunner of a show. Yes, it is. Stunner of a I'm show. I'm just looking at all of these as well. I, know. I haven't seen them. I know, wonderful. absolutely awesome. You've got little, I don't know if you can see these, but you've got little holly leaves. Little holly leaves in sterling silver. Just over here, you've got some mistletoe. How beautiful! So you can start your Christmas makes as well, or you might turn them into something else. That might be a little moustache. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if I can. Hang on. Don't worry, this is a studio sample. No one's going to get this one. We could solder on the little. Um... <laughs> That's it. Hang on. Oh no, hang on. There you go. <laughs> I can't be careful, it's quite sharp. <laughs> you can do the demo then. <laughs> what up? His, his moustache was far bigger than that. 
Um, we've got Edison Bills coming up today as well. We're going to do a massive clear out, uh, closeout deal, sorry, um, on also the most amazing pearls, which I have to show you in the Sienna box just here. This has never, ever, ever been lower than £999, which, let's be honest, is a considered purchase, isn't it? Let's be honest. However, today we are going to break a massive, massive barrier. We propositioned our sales manager, Wayne, just be we caught him. You know when he was in that holiday mode? You know, he's in Dubai now isn't he literally sunning himself loving life as Charlie Barron would say um yeah literally in Dubai um so we kind of got him got 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 hold of Wayne at the right moment and said what's the chances Wayne that we do a closeout deal and he ummed and ahed for a little bit Roscoe didn't he and then he agreed. So we are going to do a closeout deal on this last in chance, uh, last in chance, last chance saloon. Um, let me open it up because honestly, these oh. pearls are some of, some of the finest oh, pearls look. you have ever, ever, ever seen here at George <clears throat> Maker. All oh. naturally metallic Edison pearls. Oops. Um, and they are massive. Probably the biggest that we have within our vault. Um, I'm going to say wow. they're absolutely huge. They've closed previously at 999. It's a lot of money. It is, there's no doubt. But um, what you're getting, that's still an amazing deal. Today, we're taking it significantly lower. So make sure you're with me for that opportunity as well. Now, um, so yeah, gemstone launches, angelite, beautiful sterling silver components, mm. amazing nephrite, Claire McDonald's, Wall of Fame, up next. <laughs> Starting us off this morning is Jackie Davis. Good morning to you, Jackie. Oh, these are pretty. Oh, they're very delicate, aren't they? Aren't Lovely. they? Yeah. Very pretty. Hi, all at Jewelry Maker. Here's my entry for this week's WAF. It's a pair of sterling silver earrings with morganite and peridot. Oh. All products are from JM. I hope you like them. We love them, Jackie. Lovely wrap loops, Jackie. Perfect wrap loops. Yeah. I really aspire to wrap loops that tidy. My oh. nose is just a bit wonky. <laughs> just a bit. And I love that almost cherry blossom yeah, colour. Yes, gorgeous. Number 59 is from Trisha. Hello to you, Trisha Bell. Oh, lovely. Um, beautiful oh, colours. Spot a chain mail, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, that's uh, nice. Dear jewellery maker, please find and attach my entry for this week's Wall of Fame, a chain mail bracelet with magnesite squares. I hope you like it. We love it. Yeah, and gorgeous, I particularly Trisha. like the choice of the trio of colours. Yeah, yeah, you mix metals. Nice. Really nice. Number 60 is Sarah Jones. Oh, good. Look wow. At that. That's amazing. Hello, Sarah. She says, hi, please find attached my entry to this week's Wall of Fame. I love making wirework trees. And this is my latest uh, make using bronze wire and chain, all from Jewelry Maker. I love watching the shows for all the wonderful inspiration. Sarah, talking about inspiration, I've never mm. seen a tree like mm. that before. Um, it's really unique, isn't it? That's a, that's a work of art. So that's beautiful. Isn't it? Yeah. That, is, that belongs yeah. in a gallery. Yeah. It kind of reminds me a bit of a, we uh, of a willow, willow tree. Yeah. yeah, but yeah. also it's got that kind of quite a haunting vibe yes. about it. Yeah. Love that. Very well atmosphere. done. I'm going to pass these ones <clears> over to <throat> Okay, here we go. And so we've got number 61, and this is from Abby. Beautiful. Oh, that's lovely. Lovely wire work. Good morning, jewellery maker. Please see this cuff bangle. Going through my sketchbook, I found the notes from a Laura binding demonstration and made this with silver plated wire and red gemstones. It was fun to do and is comfortable to wear. I hope you like it. All components are from Jewelry Maker and good luck to all the waffers. Thanks as ever, JM. Even in a heat wave, you give us reason to carry on. Keep cool and stay safe. Oh, that's lovely, Abby. That's a really nice message. Beautiful. Good luck. Lovely Love work. Uh, I think this is Sinead. Sinead. Sinead Hilliard. Wow. Wow, that's very, that's beautiful, isn't it? Dear JM, uh, I haven't sent in any pictures for ages. I haven't had chance to make much for a while. However, I was recently attending a wedding and I didn't have something nice for my hair. It was going to be too warm for hats. I decided to make something using pearls from my stash and remembered that I also had some coral rounds hidden away for a special occasion. The coral rounds match my dress perfectly and as you can see, I've used them with the pearls to make this hair comb. All gemstones and wire from JM. Good luck to everyone in this week's draw. And that's Sinead. Amazing. That's gorgeous. Great that you can do Beautiful. that. Beautiful, yeah. I hope it's a nice wedding. You can make it yourself. Yeah. And we've got uh, 63, and this is Alwyn. That is, a, that is nice, isn't it? Look at Beautiful. that. Beautiful. Gorgeous, sweet. Uh, hello all, this week's entry to the Wall of Fame is a Larimar and Sterling Silver Suite. Everything is from Jewelry Maker. 
Really enjoyed the programmes this week and thanks for the entertainment and demos. Good luck to everyone who enters and take care in this heat. And that's from Olwyn. Well, you take care as well, Olwyn, and good luck. That's lovely. Amazing makes good luck, Beautiful. everybody. Beautiful, yeah. Um, so that happens on, uh, well, tomorrow morning. Literally tomorrow morning with lovely Carol. Oh, yes. I don't think it will be Carol, though, will it, tomorrow? Is it not? No, I think she's on holiday. Is she on her holly bob? She is. Yeah, she oh, is. OK. There you is. go. There yeah. you go. Well, either way, your draw is happening. Yeah, tomorrow. good luck. So good luck, everyone. Now, should we get cracking? Yeah. Shall we? Should we do some closeout on Argentium? Ooh. Starting with the mistletoe. That's the one I put, <laughs> That's the one I put here, isn't it? So it's, it's, it's all this. Yeah, this. Gosh, that's a lot, isn't it? So there's your mistletoes. Or, yeah, like, or sycamores. You know, do you remember, did you used to do that as a kid? Yeah. You spin them around? Yeah. And for the berries, you've got your beautiful half-drilled pearls, little button pearls that you can see just there. How sweet is that? Um, when it comes to your... Uh, to your um, Mistletoe, you've got two which are actually drilled through the centre. We'll have demos on this, just have a little look online. Then you're getting a good, what, two inches, if you like, of your Argentium uh, um, 935 silver and your Argentium chain. Look at the weight that you've got in that Argentium chain. Um, it's a huge kit. So the purest of all silver, the beauty of Argentium, for those of you that don't know. Gosh, we're already at 22.99. That's mega. What's that red? Is that how it is now? Have I missed that? Is that a Christmas? I think it's a Christmas. Oh, Christmas vibe. Yeah, right, Christmas okay. Vibes, okay. Yeah. Okay. Hang on a second. That's already surely a close. That's a brilliant. Deal. That's a great price for that chain. Look at that chain. Exactly. That's the price it's closed previously. But that's not a closeout price, though, apparently, Ross says. Really? Um, like you, Claire, I think that's a mega deal on the, on the Argentium chain. Definitely. The beauty of Argentium, for those people who have never heard of it before, it's 935, so it's purer than your 925 sterling silver. It's anti-tarnish, mm -hmm. it's hypoallergenic, so um, if ever you've worn mm -hmm. sterling silver, maybe it's actually discoloured, maybe onto your skin. You don't find that with Argentium because it is, it's, it's 935. Um, now, Elizabeth is obviously the, uh, is the specialist in this, mm. but um, purer than what you get with 925. And you will never, ever, ever need to polish it, which is absolutely amazing. £16.99. But the clock's ticking away. Stop it. How many do we have of these then? Sorry, Claire. It's all right. Over 100. What a way to start the show. That's incredible. Because don't forget as well with your Argentium, <clears throat> is that the, the, the way it's been, um, how clever it is that it's been um, constructed is, so you're, you're, you, you fuse it together, so you heat it. So you it, don't solder. So you don't need solder. You need their, their flux. Um, and you have your charcoal block, which gets, it gets hotter. And then that fuses. So, I mean, even if you made yourself a, a, a stacker ring, with, a, with a, a pearl stacker <clears throat> in and then use it, you know, th there is so much you can do with that. Absolutely. They don't have to be mistletoe, do they? No. You could no. use them, you could piece them together. Are you ready for this though, Claire? I don't think I am because I think the, that, that, these are incredible prices. The next price is still not what you're going to pay for this amazing kit. You know, what an opportunity to get involved in Argentium. If you've never done Argentium before, I did the first show here at Jewelry Maker and I loved it. You, you become, so excited. It is, it? isn't it? Yeah. Because I, I, I'm still quite frightened of soldering. I don't know why I still imagine literally flash dance. I, I know it's not like that. I do know that. That's the good bit. Yeah, yeah. I still <laughs> imagine that scene. But with Argentium, it's far less scary, isn't it? Yes. I yeah, know that yeah. you're, you're... And there are lots and lots and lots of demos. And uh, so go online, Jewelry yeah. Maker, and look at Argentium as well, that you know, tell you how to, um, how yeah, to work Yeah, go on their website. But it's really good that you've got... So you've got some preform, the, 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 you've got the, the leaves there, haven't you? You've got the, the pearls that are really lovely. And then you've got that, that round wire, that's nice structural wire. But that chain, I can't get over that, that At chain. £14.75, and we're not even stopping here. I think I know... What, what are you doing, Ross? Yes! Honestly, I would have expected this kit to be 30, 40 pounds, and yeah. that would have been yeah. mega. That would have been a mega deal. Today, for the chain on its own, you'll never need to polish that chain. 12 pounds and 49 pence. That's amazing. It is amazing. Argentium 
I mean, if, it also, it has this beautiful brightness. It's far brighter than 925 mm. sterling silver. I mean, look, look, you can see there against my skin. Far, far, far brighter. Look, for the chain on its own, £12.49. I've gone all high-pitched and squeaky. It deserves, it's deserving of high-pitched and squeaky, though, because that is, that's incredible. That Isn't is an it? absolutely incredible deal, yeah. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. Plus, it's hypoallergenic. Sterling silver. Some people can't wear sterling silver, um, whereas they won't have any issues when it comes to Argentium. Five and a half grams across this entire um, this entire kit. Should have been £22.99. You know how good this deal is. That's why the phone lines and the web and the app have gone completely nuts. Good morning, everybody. Pauline, Wenda. Hello to you, Gwyneth. Hello to you, Jenny, Patricia, Jean, Carol, uh, Wendy, London, Helen, Iris, Susan, Sam. Andy, hello to you, Alan, Marie, uh, Pauline, you've got yours, Teresa, Caroline, uh, Penny, I can see you there, Karen, I can't keep up, I generally can't keep up, we had just over Oh, morning days. everyone, that's lovely, isn't it? What a way to start the day, and if you love this... We're going to be bringing you even more Argentium closeout deals. That doesn't mean we're stopping doing Argentium, of course. It just might mean they've reconfigured kits. And it's Christmas in July. Shall we do that one that one so this little shifteroo includes two jump uh, four jump rings four jump rings that you could literally connect together in argentium then you've got two rods of pure argentium 935 they're about an inch just over an inch i'd say you have another one of your beautiful argentium chains so you, I'm thinking Mobius. You're probably thinking of something way more imaginative than me because that's, that's, that's you. <laughs> You're, I think that's what the design... Was it? Was it, not, was it a Mobius? Shall we take this to a single-figure price tag? Oh, yes. Or ha, please tell me this quantity then, Roscoe. 111. What an, all I want to say is what, there has never been a better opportunity, in my opinion, for you to have a go at Argentium. At these prices, definitely, definitely. You know, you need very little tools to do argentium. You just covered it. You need your charcoal blocks. Yeah, your you torch, flux, the flux. Yeah, a bit of their pickle. Yeah, yeah, and um, yeah, a torch. Yeah. That's it. That's it. Yeah, that's yeah. all you need. So no, no solder. What you're looking for is you're looking to get that good. In the same way as when you are soldering, you get a good, good join, and you can heat it up and anneal it. So anneal it first, let it cool down, then it becomes a lot more malleable, and then it just fuses together. So, I mean, I would almost look at this. Yes, there are designs with this. Um, this, to me, would be a bit of a stash builder as well. Again, that, that great, that, that chain. For, for £9.99, yeah, that's, that's 9 brilliant. £9.99. Yeah. We've said it already, but for the chain on its own, that's absolutely Or you could, do, you could do a couple of, um, you know, stacker rings there where you've got the, the jump rings as, as the centre. Nice. Bales as well. So much potential. Like you said, it's a great little stash, mm. uh, yeah. stash builder. Loads yeah. of you there, four grams. I don't think you can get nine two five sterling silver for that price tag. For yeah, that I mean, look weight. at the chain. Look at the yeah. you know the the quality of the chain. You can really see that yes. brightness, can't yeah. you? Yeah, yeah. Really appreciate that brightness. Good morning, everyone. Lots of lovely viewers getting involved. Aren't you glad you tuned in bright and early? Listen, it is uncomfortably hot. Would we all agree? I've I've spoken to a few of my friends who are loving it, and they were like, "L, when you're on holiday, you don't complain." That's very different. <laughs> it's very, very different. I'm not doing housework. I'm not wearing clothes. Well, I am wearing some form of clothes, like a swimsuit. There's a pool usually metres away. It's very different when you're on holiday, don't you think? Or is it me just whinging? Mm. I'm probably just whinging. Mm. You whinging? No, no, I know what you mean. It's, it does feel like it's different when you're on holiday. Although I did think yesterday was not a British heat, was it? It was a, no, it almost was, like a Spanish was, heat. Yes. It was very dry. Yes, it um, was. Which I do prefer. Yeah. Um, OK, right, let's... Let's do the holly, the holly, the ivy. <laughs> like that. <clears throat> la, 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 la. Should we do what? Under ten pounds. <laughs> <laughs> if I sing again, uh, Adam's going to take my mic out. <laughs> the holly, the <laughs> ivy. Did he take my mic out? I don't think so. No, I don't think so. He's either. gone very quiet though. Yes. Um, under ten pounds. Look for your beautiful holly with your little gemstone berries as well. Ah, and you're getting your shepherd hooks. 
So what, these just crying out to be a perfect pair of earrings, aren't they? They are, yeah, yeah. Look at that, 9 99 that's a solid piece, a solid piece. You could almost uh, um, reconfigure that to something. I'm, I, I don't know, I'm visualising something under the sea. I think that could be almost oh, like Oh, uh, all right, okay, yeah. Like uh, some kind of shell or yes. an anemone. Yeah, 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 no, a nice shell. So you could do the, uh, almost like the spiral, couldn't you, over the, um, if you've got some of the wire and then just put the, a spiral over it. Yeah. Yeah. Like um, what they're called? Is it a conch shell? A conch, yes. Yeah. Nice little conch shell. Yeah. We went to we went to uh, um, Chessington. Oh, this is obviously the inspiration. Um, these are the actual holly uh, the holly earrings. I'll show you a photograph in just a moment. Um, so literally one berry. Oh, and that's what the wire's for as well. If you look at this photo, can we show that photograph? There we go. Um, so literally just the wire running through the centre gives you the definition of the leaves. But you can reconfigure that. Well done. Now let's do a robin. A robin. Oh, look. I wondered. Oh. Currently, he's not looking very happy. But when you put him together. Oh. Oh, he's beautiful. Oh, I see. So that's. That's. Yeah. And that's then his... that, they, you do like the. Yes. And then there's the wire underneath, isn't it? And then that's his little wing. Where? That way. There we go. That way. If I, am I holding him in the right way? Let's... Yeah. Then, then that becomes his belly. Yeah. Yeah. And then and that then becomes his, his little wing. Yeah. Right. And you get that beautiful chain. How amazing is this? The little and it a is little almost birdie. three dimensional. We're saying we're saying Holly. Um, sorry, we're saying a, a, a Robin, but that could be any bird. If it you could be any bird. TV. Yeah. Nine ninety nine. How amazing! What an incredible deal! Close out deals on your Argentium. Make sure you check out your baskets. I, I, I literally, I think we all know that's a mega deal, especially for the purest form of silver that I, I think is on the market. I think silver clay might be slightly higher. Actually, is it slightly marginally I feel higher? Like, yes, I don't know. Marginally. Actual, but yeah. Um, but this, like I said, very. It, it, it was a revolution, really, when Argentium think, was. Is it, is it the Germain? I was geranium, going to say yes. geranium, and it's not. It's it? the germanium. Germanium, that, yeah, germanium that white it. gives it that, that yeah. gives it that brightness. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. Well done, everyone. Nine ninety nine. Karen Jean, hello to you. Uh, Mariella, now what a pretty name. Hello to you, Susan, Lynn, London, Christine. Hello to you, Wenda. Hello to you, new customer, Lynn. What a great per first purchase. And if you look back on our YouTube channel, you'll find all the demonstrations for Argentium, of course. Um, we do quite frequent Argentium shows. Well done, everyone. Congratulations. Do stay away you are should we do some more mega close out deals oh there's some lovely little pearls just there that need to go over there uh let's do what sorry uh aha gorgeous dan's here thank you gorgeous dan here we go gorgeous Whoa. dan gorgeous dan <laughs> ross just said he sounds like a what like a 1930s <laughs> boxer <laughs> Back at you. These are beautiful because it's not like an usual macrame braid. It's almost uh, um, circular, isn't it? And then you've got the decorations. You've got the jump rings already there. Literally, just you just choose your choose your adornment, Claire. Yeah, because I'm just looking. So I've done with one of the. Um, uh, I use my second sample because, I, you know, when you have a kit and it's lovely and you just want to carry on and on and on. So that's one of the signet rings that we've got coming up. Oh. But if you don't solder it like a signet ring, it's a really lovely... Um, it gives you just enough, if you don't cut it down, um, to, to make... Wrist. Yeah, yeah, it's like a lovely connector. What a nice idea. So you, you could do something like that with those if you didn't want to, um, you know, if you wanted, like, a fabric at the back. What a gorgeous idea. You get five of these lovely bracelets across, the, uh, across five different colours, basically. Um, and they work with your connectors. They work with, for example, your angel light or maybe... I don't know. Let me just grab oh, one. Oh, that would be not That's perfect, isn't it? Look at that. Look, just one. Just one in the centre. How beautiful oh, that, that colour's is. perfect. Isn't it? Now, nice. are you happy at 29 99 considering you're getting five of your macrame braids? That's £6 each. No way near. No way near. How many have I got left? 14 of these left within the vault. So, close-out deal. Things like pearls, you could do like an inch of pearls. You can use mm. um, your silver clays. I've got, I mean, there's, uh, these literally will accommodate all mediums, won't they? Got some nice... Um 
strands there as well that would look with nice colours, haven't you? That, yeah, they're going to go with that. Strands. That's why the, that selection of colours is really good, isn't it? Because they're going to complement all the gemstones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All of these look lovely with pearls, wouldn't they? All of these you could use, uh, could use with the angelite. Yeah. All of these you could use with your strands. Um, Fourteen pounds and ninety-nine pence. Close out deal. We've only got fourteen of them left. So wait, that's working out at three pound each. Three pounds per braid, and it's all complete. You know, it's not. It's not worth you making your own at that price tag, is it? No, it's the time involved, isn't it? But and they're just there, and then you can concentrate on the nice bit of what you know, the decorative bit that you're going to. The put decorative in bit. The deco in and the I wouldn't get. There's no way I, I would have that. Not, well, me personally, I would never have that kind of consistency. There'd be some no, go tension wrong around. Yes, yeah. Um, of course, yeah. slider not meaning that they are adjustable. Great gifts, absolutely amazing gifts. Three pounds each in your closeout deal. But be warned, there were only fourteen, so you do need to check out your baskets. Uh, Irene, Debbie, Barbara, uh, uh, Eileen, sorry, Carol, Valerie, Catherine. Stay where you are on those phone lines. The final few of those, aren't they lovely? Um, okay, let's do. The most amazing Neon Appetite nugget. It was these I was looking at. I, I knew. Did you? Yeah, I knew. I sensed that. <laughs> yeah, it's the colour just jumps out at you, doesn't it? That's wonderful. Yes, yeah. Yeah, that's nice. Just put a little section of them. Oh, it's going to yeah. pop, isn't it? Yeah. What's the average carrot weight of Neon Appetite? Pardon? Yes, Adam. He knows. 0.15. No, Ross, no. 0.15 is the average carrot weight of Neon Appetite. It forms almost granularly. So to be able to get Neon Appetite individually of these sizes, totaling 320 carats is absolutely massive. Um, the Madagascan deposit, which is where you're, you're sourcing yours from right now, um, is, well, famous for this, the quality, the vivacity, the energy, that idyllic, vibrant blue of course neon appetite needs to live up to that title it needs to have that presence that that vibe that intensity there's a 60 second clock ticking away before us claire wow angus how many do we have there are 30 of these in the vaults head up heads up we're gonna take oh imagine these in the mala They'd be lovely. I was just thinking, thinking I'd maybe put a few, you know, in the lovely pearl necklace yeah, nice. there. So it just, it would just give it a very, very different look, wouldn't it? Which shows how versatile and beautiful and clever pearls are. You can put them with lots and lots of different sorts of. Claire. Oh. Oh. We're going to take ten pounds off that price tag. Yep, I said it. We're going to take ten pounds off that price tag. Well, in that case, then you, you'd be multi buying, wouldn't you? And uh, uh, yeah, texture, colour, yeah. twisting them, and these are coming up. By the way, these gorgeous pearls, the ones that I launched the other day, but still the silver spacers. And uh, this would be amazing with your deal of the day, your angelite. Ten pounds coming off that price tag, jewellery makers, for the final thirty. Um, there we go. I've literally just. I, I should. I should wait until Ross's clock has finished ticking away, but no. It was all a little bit delayed. That's because the system didn't want to go to 4 99 That's why. 4 99 Don't do it. 0.15. My average current weight. <laughs> Ross, no. <gasps> oh, but look at how many. Look how many people you're making happy right mm. now today. Yeah. I adore Neon Appetite. And, yeah. and listen, if I had the time, then I would absolutely go into the fact that it's written about everywhere at the moment. It's turning heads, it's similarity to mm. your Paraba tourmalines. It's just like, be like a lovely, nice, stretchy bracelet. It would look gorgeous. Rosary linked. Yes, yeah, yeah. So much you can do. And, and it's that shape and the colour as well, isn't it? Lots and lots of lovely techniques. In a, in a necklace as well. You yeah, know, crochet really... ones, you know, like those oh, illusion ones too. Nice. That would be good. A bit of Morganite in there, maybe? Oh. Oh, yeah. yeah, nice. We had some Morganite yesterday, which Did is quite you? a nice treat. We don't often see it. Mm. Loving that. Well, it's going to sell out very quickly. Well done and a very good morning to you all. Isn't it wonderful to have everyone's coming? Yeah, I hope right everyone's all right. There's lots of people, aren't yeah, there? Yeah, I hope you are all okay. Yeah, Do nice to see you yourselves. all. Um, literally, you know when you go on holiday and you set foot off the plane and it literally, boof, hits you, hits you. 
It was like that this morning opening mm. my front door. So, yeah, stay inside if you can. Shall we do another one of those mega deals? Do you want another one? Says, does she actually say that? Because you always talk about Davina McCall. Does she say that? Does she actually say that? Do you want another one? Okay. Sorry, I was looking at the wrong camera then. Just sniggering into your Sorry. cup of tea. <laughs> Davina McCall D, apparently that's... A... <laughs> Do you want another one? I, d I don't even know what I'm repeating, so she, I don't know what context she says this. Is it, oh, is it Big Brother? Evictions? Oh, okay. I don't remember her saying it, though. Well, look Did how you... long ago that is. Look, let's show everybody out. Do you want another one? <laughs> is it another what? Another what? Oh, under £5 deal? I most oh, certainly yeah, go on, do. Then. Yes, please. Yes, please. Uh, in your Amazonite, no less. Oh, screaming wow. to me to be a mala mala necklace. Yeah. And, and Again, I yes. love Amazonite with pearls. Yes, yeah. And I'd be using these ones as well because they'd be lovely in the tassel, wouldn't they? Yeah. Oh, look at that, Claire. I, do you know what? Actually, as well, with everything that you've got there, yeah. haven't you? Yes, yeah. Oh, which shape are you going to go for? Yeah. <gasps> dreamy kit. Oh, that's lovely. Is that like... Yeah. A, it is dreamy, isn't it? A dreamy kit. It is, isn't it? Literally have the... Oh, all three of those gemstones. Do you want another one? Yes, please. I don't, that's, she doesn't talk like that, oh. though, does she, Davina McCall? Um, regardless, regardless, it is going under £5. Amazonite, um, very popular gemstone again. You see it in Monica Veneda. You see it at, at lots of the big design houses. If you go onto the Monica Veneda website, they do a really lovely, a very beautiful uh, write-up about this gemstone. And they actually credit it with the fact that it was Amazonite that started at their passion of gemstones. So how amazing is that? Mm. It's got this wonderful tropical vibe. Contrary to the name, it's not actually found along the Amazon, um, the Amazon River. Um, this is a gemstone found in a few different locations around the world, but a member of the Feldspar family, all with really beautiful pastel palette. £3.99. How many do we have, Roscoe? 30 and how often do you see Amazonite with these darker colours and the caramel Because you could, tones? you could um, work with that strand, couldn't you? And then just just with the, the tones, so you're going sort of like maybe from your, um, the darks into the lights or, or, or reverse. That would look Love good it. too. Isn't it pretty? Classic six mil, so mm. workable. Mm. So, so workable. And maybe gents as well. Yeah, yeah, Tom would wear this. Yeah. I think He'd wear that, this. Um, that might be quite nice too. Or then you mix it with something like uh, really, really feminine, which is that beautiful class that you, you know, the box class that you've yes. got there. Because, you, you, you know, I think that would look lovely with it too. Oh, it totally would. I agree. And I think the darker colours within this strand also make it, you know, slightly less feminine, don't they? Yes. Um, yeah. Make, yeah. It, make it, I'm addicted to Neon Appetite. Me too, Marie. Yeah. I absolutely love Neon Appetite. It's a head turner, isn't it? I always think it's one of those gemstones that um, people will come over and ask you about. Literally, they'll be like, oh, I love this. And they'll ask you about Neon Appetite. Um, this, I mean, it's just got this soft subtlety, I mm. think, with, with, with yeah. Amazonite. This class was coming up a little bit later on. It's Grab lovely. it whilst you can. Jewelry makers at £3.99. Really works with pearls. Um, but at the same time, because you've got some of these other natural colours that form in this gemstone, it's going to complement lots, isn't it, within your stash? Um, under £5 and then some. Hello, Elizabeth. Hello to you, Lincolnshire. Jacqueline, Yvonne, Iris, Debbie. Hello to you, London, Gabrielle. Not Nottingham, uh, Nottingham, hello to you, Patricia, Jean, Karen, uh, Marie Claire, Christina. Uh, hiya, Joe. Hi, ladies. How to keep cool? Aid shower, aid shower, towel for uh, modest in the, in the bedroom whilst damp <laughs> turban um, on full blast. Damp air. Am I reading that? Hang on. Damp air, dry and gloomy. I did hear about the damp towel. And I've also heard that if you put like a, a slightly a cool flannel over a fan, that oh, helps. Oh, okay. Towel in the freezer. Towel in the freezer. In the fr uh, Adam oh, gosh, did that last yeah. night. I, I can't get in my freezer. No, I was to <laughs> say that must be a very well organised freezer. Mine's jam back with food that probably hasn't yeah. been the light of day for years. <laughs> years and years. And ice cubes for <laughs> gin and tonic. Cubes. Exactly. <laughs> you like that? 
keeping cool gin and tonic. Um, I'll keep the ice cubes. Um, okay, let's bring you. Oh, I love it. Absolutely beautiful. And again, it's going to work with all your gemstones today. Thank you, Joe, for the tip. Yes. Thank you, Joe. Literally, just this was me last night, honestly, because Tom slept in the other room with Tiggy last night because it's a lot cooler. In the end, we took her out of her bedroom. Um, Willow was fine. She was literally just starfish. When I went in. And I did exactly the same. <gasps> It wasn't pretty. But no, no nights like last night are nights where you think, oh, I'm ever so glad that I'm like, <laughs> I sleep on my own. It's probably, yeah, not, not the... Imagine, I just imagine <laughs> Tom walked in, my, my eyes! <laughs> Under five pounds already! <laughs> Dad's my wife, everybody. Can you... <laughs> Four ninety nine only. How beautiful is this going to look with your deal of the day, the Amber's night? How beautiful is it going to oh, look with your with amazing the pearls? pearls? Yes. The clock is ticking. What are you doing, Roscoe? He's going lower. He says, and he just doesn't care. He just does not care. See how lovely Ooh. is that? Very, very, very different, um, isn't it? The, it's a the, contemporary the twist, yes. isn't it? Yeah. The rutile makes it modern. Yes. Yeah. It really does, but it works beautifully. And I would definitely include the one with the stars. Oh, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because mm. uh, you've got that kind of almost sci-fi. Bringing this bit more of the silver in as well, isn't it? Oh, it's yeah, stunning. Lovely. Absolutely stunning. Um, it's going under five pounds, and we already are under five pounds. All of these items that I'm reaching for are included in today's show, of course. You know, when you used to go to your school discos, did your DJ ever say, uh, play this? Can you play something a bit more modern? He always used to put that little sting in between the tracks when he was going to what? put something which is clearly oh. modern. Oh, what is that? Is that a phrase? Is it? Yeah, he used to think is it was it? really funny. <laughs> and then when it stepped into the slow dance, uh, slow dance songs, he used to be like, "It's time to get close and feel the lumpy bits." And I always <laughs> used to go. <laughs> it wasn't primary school. <laughs> no. Well, yeah, school, but high, high, high school. And I used to go. <laughs> 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 Adam, uh, yeah, uh, like Ross, he's, he'd get really bashful and shy because he does get really shy and bashful in those kind of conversations. Adam's like this. <laughs> <laughs> he did. What do you think? Look back though. It was inappropriate, really, wasn't it? Yes, very. That sounds very, yeah. very inappropriate. Yeah, but there we yeah. go. <laughs> But yeah, all of a sudden, oh no, it's that awkward time. Two pounds and 99 pence only. Hello, Barbara. Hello to Anthony and Kay getting four of these. We don't often see root out courts. No, do we, we don't. We don't. And that's a nice long strand as well. It, it is. I like the fact that it's in its gorgeous, uh, faceted by Mother Nature in the nuggets. Yes. How, how she yeah. intended it to be. Um, root out courts, you have, of course, these lovely. Uh, I'm literally crying. <laughs> Um, <laughs> Thinking about Adam at the oh, Adam at the school <laughs> dance. I was, I, we've got into watching Stranger Things now, and it was that, um, it was the, the school disco. It's, it, Tom and I were literally laughing, creasing, laughing at the way they, these kids dance. Their first school dance. Oh, I'd run off you. and go to the toilet or yeah, for too. a drink at that point. I me too. Yeah, I didn't um, like right then, like let's remember pearls are. Are we doing them now? Should we do the clasp? Now, a while ago, um, a few of our customers were requesting from our buying team more clasps, and it was actually something they were in the pipe. It was in the pipeline already, um, <clears throat> but not just any clasp, not just your bolt rings, not just your lobster claws, not just your toggles. And there's nothing wrong with any of those, of course, but you wanted your luxury class. And if anybody was to uh, literally request luxury class, I immediately think of your box class mm. because they are the class that tends to, um, well, they've been around for generations, of course, and they are incredibly secure. The whole, I mean, you're a silversmith, Claire, to actually make something like this. Yeah, it's, and, it, and I think I've said to you before that it, it is an exercise that you would do because you've got to tick so many boxes, haven't you? Everything has to fit together. It has to look really beautiful. Yeah. 
um, you know, you need it to be lovely and secure because obviously whatever you're going to put on on there, that's what's holding it together. Well, it can hold weight, can't it? Yes, box glass. yes. And if you imagine secure. like a doorstop with sterling silver, so you press it down and click it in, that's how your box clasp actually works. But this is even beyond that because it's also giving you the opportunity to multi-row. Oh, look at that. That's lovely, isn't it? Isn't so it nice. You don't have to multi-row, of course. If you just want to do a single strand, you can. Um, but it is giving you that opportunity. Now, I'm just going to prop this up towards you for a second. That's a genuine cultured pearl. Stay there. Go on. OK, don't stay there then. Um, <clears throat> and I'm just going to reach across to our lovely Anna and Sue's fabulous creation. And they said, I think it was on their Facebook page, they said, when you have a class as beautiful as this, it doesn't have to be a class. You can actually use it as use it as a feature and that's exactly what they have done right now and i totally agree with that look it's holding the actual uh, the tassel and then literally beading directly up from uh, from the box clasp itself how gorgeous is that it's that attention to detail you know you you spend we've i've said this so many times but you spend hours creating this beautiful jewelry you don't just want to oh, okay i just stick a just stick a bog standard clasp on the end of it mm. you want something that completes it's that cherry on the proverbial cake but also have peace of mind knowing that it is going to secure securely hold your finished piece of jewelry um i know i reference it all the time whenever i'm talking about bolt ring clasp but if you watch antiques roadshow and you've ever seen and Antiques Roadshow uh, sort of vintage necklaces or antique necklaces, chances are that they will actually have a box clasp mm. on there. Yeah. Um, because it's historic, but also it's really secure. So they last the test of time. Now, how many do I have of these available? 80. Do you know how many were originally made? 400. So these have flown. It's one of the most popular clasps that we have launched here at Jewelry Maker. You've got 2.93 grams of sterling silver. All that wonderful craftsmanship, all of that beautiful, almost like a, a Macintosh, isn't it? Mm. Almost got the Macintosh um, embellishments and a cultured pearl. For the final 80, we're going to take it to an early bird price tag. I'd stock up on these because it's definitely something that you're going to use, not just with pearls. You'll use this with maybe multi-layered chains. You'll use this as all your other gemstones with your sea beads. I think that's the wonderful thing, and especially having the pearl, it, it will go with other, anything, yeah. all gemstones you've got in your, in your stash, isn't it? You that can see so why nice. it's one of our most popular class that we've commissioned. Yeah. yeah but I think definitely. it's probably going to close out today. Yesterday, we were showing you multi-layered strands of pearls, weren't we? <clears throat> we were showing you uh, um, uh, Jackie Kennedy. We were showing uh, Rihanna, all wearing uh, Angelina Jolie, mm. all wearing multi-layered pearl necklaces. It doesn't have to be pearls, of course. How do you think they were complete? More than likely on a clasp like this. Mm. More than likely. It's secure and it's strong. And it's simple to thread onto. And it's because of the, the design of it, you know, you've got you've got a bigger surface area there, haven't you? So, so it's chances are it's going to be decorative, which means it, it is an, an integral part of the of your, you know, your piece of jewellery. Absolutely. Now, imagine imagine gorgeous Angelina Jolie, this necklace. Imagine if you were looking at, that, you know, at the finishing, the clasp itself. It is going to be something flat because mm. that's why mm. it's late. Look here yeah. on Catherine High Heigl. Um, that is a flat clasp. Yeah. To keep it lay in position perfectly. Look at all. I mean, look at that. I don't think there's a clasp on that. I think it's uh, like our endless. Rihanna, beautiful. Uh, she's wearing a cardigan for goodness' sake. It's all about. I mean, look at that. Yeah. It gives you that opportunity to wear the layers and layers of pearls. But just here, you can see it's kind of like a doorstop, as you can see just there. You literally post it in. You'll have. Fun. It'll be much easier for you because you'll have purchase, and literally. Just click it into place. Job done. 14 pounds and 99 pence. We are down from 80 to 49 this morning. In a minute, we're gonna take it under 10 pounds. Bought two of these, they're super. Thank you, Alison. They are, aren't they? You can see, you can feel the quality mm. of them. 
the final 49. Um, and you know what, Alison, under £10, we might as well stock up on them because they are a necessity. But for those of you that do special commissions, you're going to, you, you know, when you go and see your customers, maybe brides for their future weddings or bridal, for gala it? dinners yeah. or whichever, yeah. anniversary pieces, you can say, well, I can do that class. But if you want for an additional, I don't know, however much, um, I can put this clasp on there. And chances are people will go for this. Yes. Chances are. Yeah, yeah. I would choose this yeah, over a lobster claw. 21 seconds. I've said it. It's going under £10. They will come back. We will, I should imagine, recommission these. I think box class should absolutely be part of our essentials collection, shouldn't they? They haven't been in the past, but I think they should be part of our essentials collections. Like gold. I'm really championing that. Yeah, that would be nice, wouldn't it? Watch this space. Oh. Watch this space. Caroline's nervous about doing Have you worked class. your magic, have you? Well, yeah, with exciting. Scott, not so much with Caroline. Scott's, Scott's on my side. Caroline's a little bit more nervous about it. 9 99 That's incredible, isn't it? It is incredible. Mm. That craft yeah, is yeah, work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You've, you've made one of these. Yeah, and it's, it's a tough, you know, it's a tough... Um, because, like I say, everything has to fit together. Um, but yeah, that, I mean, you can you can picture it, can't you? I mean, so just you know, sort of sat there beautifully, it'd be, it'd be lovely. And I think I think you could probably, depending on like the size of the pearls or whichever gemstone. Don't forget, you can you know, looking at those loops there, you you'd probably be able to get a couple of jump rings or your wire guardians yeah. in there in, e in each one. So it's not just your you're not just looking at a two. No, it, um, could, it could be a four. It could be yeah. You can yeah. absolutely layer yeah. up on this one, or just do one. Or you do your one, and then if I've ever done one like that, so it doesn't just look like it's empty. Um, just add in like a little wrap, you know, wrap loop of, um, you know, uh, the corresponding gemstone. So maybe oh, one, nice. one pearl. Like a little there. bubble star yeah, cluster. Yeah, That yeah. would be lovely. Just so that I just, you know, it just finishes it off. So it balances out. Yeah. They're going to sell out today for sure. Of course, yeah, the box clasp, I think it is something that should be part of our essentials it's collection. Stunning. They are stunning, aren't they? Really mm. lovely. Let me just show you, even on the reverse, and excuse my, my fingerprints. Let me just turn that over. You can see the 925 stamp there. All that precious metal. It's a big amount of precious metal, isn't it? Um, all that, plus your genuine gemstone pearl, £9.99. pence. Loads and loads and loads of you there. If you love pearls, by the way, we've got some mega pearl deals coming up today. Edison pearls, um, one, of our, uh, one of our finest pearls. Are you all right? Oh, sorry, I was dancing. Who are you dancing to? Uh, Adam was seeing 21 seconds to go. Oh, OK. Sorry. <laughs> you got 21 seconds to go. That one. Yeah. I mean, I mean, I mean, that's the only line I can say from that song. <laughs> yeah, I'm mate. I know what it is. Um, you know, oh, go see me on a video. No, no, or something like that. I don't know. Nine, ninety, pardon? I know the song, but I don't know the words. Don't know the words. Uh, 9.99, well done. Check out those baskets. There's so many of you there. It's going to be another busy, busy, busy morning. This with your angel light, your deal of the oh, day. Oh, gosh, yes. Oh. Yeah, that's perfect. In fact, yeah. and we were talking about graduations, weren't we? Well, that's, so if that's, you wanted yeah. to... If you wanted to create... Sorry, Ross, one sec. If you wanted to create that graduation with your deal of the day, mm. ooh, that would be perfect, wouldn't it? And then you have your box clasp at the top. Obviously not it, so it goes that little bit further. Maybe put a few pearls in there as well. Nice. <gasps> if you make that piece of jewellery, will you, will, you, will you give me a shout? Because I'll buy it off you. That sounds amazing. Mm. Um, anyway, coming up, they're coming up as your deal of the day at 10 o'clock today. Now, this will melt the phone lines. And uh, <clears throat> not only are we, bring, are we bringing you beautiful co uh, quality cultured pearls, the gemstone, which is... It's massive at the moment. I know it always has been historically, um, you know, literally for centuries. But have you noticed uh, in, it's actually quite uh, a fashion forward symbol at the moment, mm -hmm. not just for ladies jewellery, as we just saw Rihanna just then, but also for gents. Gents are rocking the pearls at the moment, which I love. Um, you've got uh, Pharrell just here on this photograph, I can see. Um, yeah, I know he looks amazing. Pharrell's in his, no, I, th I think he's in his 50s. Oh, is he? So he's 49, Pharrell. Gosh, looking amazing, isn't he? He is. And then you've got uh, Redditch-born Harry Styles. I love Harry Styles. I used to work with his mum. Did you? Yeah. She's beautiful. Very beautiful. How lovely. I know. I used to work with his mum. Yeah. And then you've got um, ASAP Rocky, whoever he is, sorry. Married to Rihanna. 
No. Is he married to Rihanna, is he? You know I, a, didn't, I didn't know. Do you know um, she's a billionaire now? Yeah, it's incredible. A billionaire. Yeah. Blimey. Good for her. Like, good it's for amazing, her, yeah. absolutely. So it is a gemstone, which is, would we all agree, historical, but also very on trend at the moment. Now, let's bring it back to our, our, our jewellery maker uh, um, pieces. You know, you take inspiration from all these designs and all of these celebrities. How can we make a strand of pearls better? This is something that our team are always striving to do. Make an opportunity better, more exciting, maybe uh, not just in price, but also in the design. Well, I'll tell you, we bring you pearls with sterling silver. Not just any sterling silver, sterling silver star spaces. I launched this alongside Wayne not so long ago and literally hundreds flew. 80 are left. That's, that's so nice, isn't it? It's, it's perfection. You yeah. don't need to do anything yeah. to it, do you? Yeah. It's, look, let me just show you, you've got pearls this side. I'm just holding it where the star spaces are. You've got one, two, three, four, five star spaces. And then you've got all of these beautiful pearls. You could literally just restrand that, mm. couldn't you? Think yeah. about it this way, and I'm trying desperately to remember what we took it to, but I know it was mega because it was, you know, Wayne was in the hot. I don't remember, Ross, no. So try and think about um, how much you would pay for the sterling silver spacer beads on their own, and then how much you would pay for the pearls on their own. And then just consider that. Because they're fancy spaces as well, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, it's mean, not just a yeah, bead. Yeah. Not just a we bead. love beads, but they're not just, are they? They are. No. They're no. great. Imagine now if you're able to, multi-buying on this and creating, with that class that you've just seen, like a multi-layered star and pearl mm. necklace, maybe a little bit like Rihanna's, maybe a little bit like that. How incredible that would be. This strand with sterling silver stars... Five to six millimetre genuine cultured pearls goes under ten pounds. No. Mm -hmm. Under ten pounds. You'd pay that for the spaces, wouldn't you? Yes, that, really? Yeah. That's why hundreds of these sold on the original launch, which was only what, last weekend, was it, Ross? It wasn't long ago. When was it? Last weekend that I actually looked? Last Saturday. There we go. Um, yeah, we're taking it under £10 for the final 80 of these available. Get that clasp if you want just to finish it off. Maybe multi-layer. I've got five left of those. So I, everything that you see on the board right now, you can get for less than £20 this morning. It's, it's amazing, isn't it? And if you think, I mean, I know you, 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 you pay a premium, don't you, for bridal jewellery, but that is absolutely worthy of... You know, a yeah. bridal necklace, isn't it? Totally. Stars, hearts, flowers, the most yeah. popular yeah. symbols yeah. in jewellery. Precious very, very metal and brilliant. cultured pearls. That would be massive if it was purely about the pearls. But it's not. You've actually got five beautiful sterling silver star spacer beads as well. Make sure you check out those baskets, everybody. We had just 80 of these left. They were only launched last Saturday, and I think we're going to close them out this morning as well. The perfect opportunity for you to do that multi-layer. And it's designs like that. Like I, I, do, I love um, Christmas designs, that, but I, I like it if, if it's like a star, something like that. Because, yes, it can be Christmassy, can't it? But it's also... Every day. It, yeah, absolutely. And so something like that. It could be a Christmas jewellery. But yeah, I mean, I, I, I would wear that. It's, it's almost because it's like crosses over, doesn't it, in that um, into um, constellations and things which are so, so on trend. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Uh, and I read an article about that, Claire. It's nice. Uh, hang on, what are we looking at? Not the same. Not the same. Sorry, sorry. Um, here we go. Uh, yeah, it, it's, it can, I read an article about, about uh, celestial jewellery and it, yeah. apparently it's, it, it, it's created a, a, a big buzz once again because of pandemic and mm. it's all, you know, wanting all under one starry yes, sky yeah. and hopes and dreams and those yeah. kind of things. Hello, Sarah Jane. Hi, all. Um, I got two of these last time they were on. They're lovely. My two girls. Uh, for my two girls. Love you both. We love you too. Yeah. We love you lovely. too. And I think, Sarah, we saw your piece of jewellery earlier on, didn't we? I think we did. It, uh, I think so, in the Wall did of Fame. Did we? Have... I don't, we definitely had a Sarah. Yes, we did have a Sarah. Sarah Jones. Oh, no. Does, uh, that could be some, another Sarah. Oh, lucky people. girls as well. Yeah, amazing. They're beautiful. Make sure you check out, though, because that might well be its last airing. Right. Should we do more pearls? Yeah. Love it. Absolutely love it. I've shown you PowerPoints in the past. 
and I don't know if Ross, you can find it, where there's literally lots of different beautiful ladies wearing layers and layers and layers and layers of pearls. Because one thing, and I asked the question on social media the other day when uh, it was last weekend, um, I had my mother-in-law's birthday party. So she came off air, shot home, quick change, out I went. And I asked the question on Instagram, can you wear too many pearls? Because if the answer is yes, then I definitely was wearing too many, but I personally don't think you can. Pearls are on every single high-end jewellers, be them modern, be them your more traditional, and they will conform to whatever occasion. I mean, take a little look at this. Mm. It's maybe sort of like quite uh, country casual chic with what looks like a leather jacket, really lovely, um, or something very formal like this with a bone china. Or maybe something like this, very tailored, but casually worn, wrapped around the wrist. The, I personally don't think you can wear too many pearls. No, no. Needless to say, by the way, Jan Dwyer and Susie both said, absolutely not. <laughs> they both said that. Now, gorgeous double strand opportunity of genuine cultured pearls. It's it's madness how low we're taking these two. No, they're not faux, they're not plastic, they're not glass, they're not simulated, they're not even shell pearl. These are genuine cultured pearls that have literally formed within those mollusks, farmed within the fresh water. You've got that pure innocent, that classic pearl white colour. Um, start dialing. If you're a pearl lover, it's still to this day the gemstone that I buy the most. I buy mm. the most pearls. Um, and my staff order anyway from jewellery maker above any other gemstone because the quality that we offer and the deals that we offer i think are second to none at 39.99 that's working out at 20 pounds each we're no way near no way near how about you know, cast your eyes around the studio and you'll find pearls everywhere mm. absolutely yeah. everywhere this is the kind of opportunity where you can really indulge. You know, maybe um, you can go, you can go for the long ropes, like Chanel once said, literally casually thrown over over the shoulder. You can go for the Holly Go Lightly, couldn't you? That wonderful multi-layer. There's another. There we go. Uh, if you cast your eyes literally around the studio, you will find mm. pearls everywhere. We're nowhere near. We're going to half that price, and then I'm going to say we're still not done. That means they're going less than ten pounds each for genuine culture pearls. Because I was looking at the um, the little, lovely little bracelets as well. Because mm -hmm. that might that's a nice size as well for oh perfect for the, for the bracelets. bracelets too, isn't it? It's a yeah. nice, absolutely perfect. Can you see that just at the top? The bracelets, the bracelets, just up there. Perfect. Yes, and that's using, mm. what, just a handful of those yep. pearls? We're going even lower. Stock up your stashes. You know, bridal commissions, absolutely. Pearls are always, uh, you know, classed very much appropriate for your weddings. But all occasions, as we just showed you a few moments ago, less than £10, that's where we already are. And we're going even lower. So if you love the idea of creating maybe, well, this, this is what Anne and Sue have done. Using this double, str uh, this, this double strand opportunity, they've literally just alternated them with some Mayuki beads. Look how gorgeous that is. That looks really nice, doesn't it? With the angel like I was just thinking, there. yes, the, um, the, the, the photo that's down there, we'll see, maybe see that in a minute, but yeah. then you could put the angel light in rather than the larger pearls. That would look lovely. Oh, yeah. The one wrapped around her yes, wrist. Yeah, that yeah. looks stunning. Yeah. Fourteen ninety nine, Claire. Brilliant. Next time you next time you walk past a jeweler's, doesn't have to be the most luxurious. I just next time you work walk past, I don't know, Ernest Jones or something like that, or Samuels, chances are they'll have pearls. Can you buy a pair of pearl earrings, two pearls for fourteen ninety nine? Can you buy a strand of necklace, uh, a stranded necklace, single stranded necklace for seven pound fifty? No. I don't think you'd get a bracelet. And even maybe sometimes in glass pearls, you know, from un you're talking like high street, you know, mm -hmm. next Marks and Spencers, that type that have do have nice jewellery, you know, collections. I don't think you'd get that for no. one bracelet for I was looking at Zara. I, I was looking at Zara last night. I'm a big fan of yeah, Zara. Yeah, yeah, lovely. And they do yeah. some really lovely costume jewellery yeah. in there. They do. In the sale, in the they're still expensive and yeah. they're plastic pearls. Yeah. 
And, and listen, I, I'll be honest, I've bought them in the past because I've liked a specific design. You're getting genuine culture pearls, times two in a strand, mm. £7.50 each or £14.99. Do make sure you check out your baskets, everybody. It's all because it's Christmas in July. Remember, we've got competitions. Remember, and I haven't mentioned this, not yet. Uh, remember, with your purchase today, if you shop with us today, you get a free gift. How awesome is that? A free gift just because you're shopping. So you're getting, you're getting involved on this amazing deal. Look, free gift. Get a free mystery strand when you buy anything during our seven days um, of Christmas in July week. There we go. So if you're shopping as part of the Christmas in July week, you will get a free gift from us and there's going to be competitions as well running today um so make the most of that yesterday we credited someone's account with 25 jewelry maker pounds um awesome 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 well done now coming up after the break it's it this is huge yeah this is absolutely huge and i'm going to say something to you the first auction i bring you on the back of the break uh, <laughs> it goes against every single being within me to say this, but I'm going to say it. Don't buy it. There we go. Don't buy the next auction. Are you all right? Um, yeah. Buy the second. There's a reason why I'm saying that, and you'll see why after this. <laughs> jewelry maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. summer. As the heat wave hits, the British public are making the most of it while it's still here. Here's Carol buying an ice cream from a local vendor, playing games at the fair, and frolicking about in the sun. But Carol has forgotten that Jewelry Maker celebrates Christmas in July, a chance for customers to get their supplies in ready for their Christmas designs and gifts. So Carol can take a bite of that ice cream and hello to that Christmas jumper as we present Christmas in July. Oh, Carol, you scamp. Here at Jewelry Maker, we're always looking ways to make your shopping experience better. That's why on certain items, we've got split pay, where you can spread the cost over two, three, or four months at no extra cost to you. So you can buy your way with split pay. Jewelry Makers, this Wednesday at 10 a.m. to celebrate Christmas in July, I get to bring you a very, very special gemstone. I get to bring you Sakota 
emerald. Now look, I've worked with this gemstone since about 2006, and it has always been one of the most prolific and sought after emeralds from the Bahia state in Brazil. Because originally in Brazil, up until the 1980s, the Carniba mine was the mine that everybody utilized, that everybody wanted to get their hands on. But move back 12 years, and this discovery at the Sakota mine was groundbreaking. And this Wednesday at 10 a.m., I get to bring it back for you guys for one special show, one special hour, unbelievable prices, beautiful greens, and most importantly, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to give you the finest quality that we can bring. Welcome, this, this, Okay, I'm, I'm being very unconventional today, but um, if, you, if we put our collector's hats on, it says one purchase that you make today, it's got to be Claire's kit. I, it, as a collector, that's how I think. Not the first auction. Don't buy that. When have I ever said that to you before? Don't buy the auction that I'm about to talk about. Buy the second. And you'll understand why in a few moments' time. Um, because our gem experts have actually been on your screens talking about this opportunity. Talking about jade, and remember jade, there's two varieties of jade. You have your jadeite and you have your nephrite. In China, though, they don't really differentiate. As long as it is one of those two, they are incredibly valuable. In fact, the, the actual record for the most expensive piece sold at auction, I think we've got a photograph of that somewhere, Ross, haven't we, is actually a carved white nephrite. And what you'll see with this photograph is, of course, it's, it's an ancient carving and it's very intricate and whatnot, but what you'll notice is it's actually not a pure white. It's almost creamy white. Um, whereas your nephrite that you're about to get, your jade bangle, is completely ice white clean. No, it's not dyed. No, it's not bleached. This is totally and utterly natural. And I've kind of got my serious head on right now because this is... If you were to speak to the lovely Susie, for example, anybody who... We're still new to understanding this gemstone here in the West. We are. There's no denying it. Literally, you've got Sotheby's themselves, who, who their, their own professional of jade is somebody that has lived alongside jade throughout uh, their family. You know, they're not, they're not British. They are of... Chinese descent, because they actually understand this gemstone. We're very new to the party in the West um, about this gemstone, or learning about this gemstone. But we have learned about it, and the West does want it, which makes sourcing this gemstone altogether even more challenging globally. You know the Hong Kong fair was cancelled. Now, Whilst that is, of course, a real shame, certainly for the gemstone traders, because they do approximately 90% of their business at the Hong Kong Trade Fair. There are ways of them, obviously, uh, still making their income. And those ways are basically, and I kid you not, Gemporia. Because make no doubt about it, the reason why we have any variety of jade here at Jewelry Maker here at Gemporia is because the Hong Kong Trade Fair was closed, was cancelled, not just this year, the year before and the year before that. That's the only reason you ha we have it. Um, we are talking about one of the world's most valuable commodities, one of the world's rarest gemstones that exists, one of the world's most historic. And you can, I mean, I've read an article once upon a time, you know, when we talk about jewellery and gemstones, and it said, you know, many people will imagine the biggest diamonds, sapphires, rubies and emeralds. 
which will, of course, set you back, can set you back thousands, if not tens of thousands. But what about the gemstones, which can be the price of a house or a luxury car? Unfathomable reality, in all honesty, when it comes to natural jade, and that's what you're getting. But let's dive deeper into nephrite, because I know you do like to differentiate between the two. And although, here we go, Although the Chinese nephrite prices received little attention for many decades, again, that's because nephrite, jadeite, they come under the jade umbrella. It makes no difference to, uh, to, 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 in China. Uh, since the rise of China, uh, China's economy in the 1990s, the original jade, they say original jade, and that's because nephrite is the original jade. It's older than jadeite, um, has appreciated tremendously. As of 2014, the world auction record for jade is held not by Burmese jadeite. Even though jadeite technically is rarer, is rarer, nephrite is older. The record is held by Chinese nephrite. Would you like to see the piece? Here it is. This large white imperial nephrite carving Look at, uh, that's so many digits, I don't even know where to begin. $18 million. Close to 19 in actual fact. Wow. But do you notice, it's a fabulous carving, it's absolutely beautiful, but do you notice how it's not pure white? They call it white, and it's imperial, mm. meaning it's totally natural, which is exactly what you're about to see in your bangle. But it's not a pure white, is it? It's about the rarity of that type A gemstone and, of course, the intricacy of the carving. We're about to give you an opportunity, and as I said, as a collector, we put our collector's hats on right now. We must never, ever, ever lose sight of, lose sight of how incredible this, auction, this opportunity is. I've, I've worked in gemstones since I was 20, 20 years old, 23 years in the business. I've never seen jadeite opportunities like the, like the ones we're having right now. And that's not an exaggeration. I've told you about that carving that was in the jewelers that I once worked at, literally situated next to the Piaget and the Rolex jewelry. There was one carving that going back 23 years was two and a half thousand pounds. It's not a bangle though. Bangles are more expensive historically because of the waste they have to find a boulder. Jade forms in boulders, and they never know exactly what colour you're going to get. The majority, if it is, it tends to be, it's very rare. Please don't think I'm being blasé, but you're more likely going to get the green colour, not necessarily the imperial green, but like an apple blossom green colour than you are any of the fancy colours. Fancy colours are your reds, your blacks, your whites, your lavenders, your pinks, your blues. Look at, look at this, that's pure white jade. Mm -hmm. Pure white jade. It's amazing, isn't it? 18th century carving. Here's another piece. 81,000 US dollars that sold for. Yeah, ouch. There's that house that I was just talking about. Pale greenish white. Do you think they're clutching at the white just there? <laughs> especially the one on the far left. Beautiful carving, isn't it? 86,500, 170,000. Look at the prices. Green-ish white. Do you think they're clutching on the white just there? Grey and white, yeah, I think we can agree with that. $37,000. White jade. Look at the prices that this... Very gemstone commands. And what many people are actually predicting will overtake the price of imperial jade. But let's go back to talking about why, why the bangle, of all, whatever colour, regardless of the colour, whether, whether it's black, whether it's white, whether it's, uh, whether it's imperial, whether it's whichever, the bangle really is that piece that in Chinese history is the pinnacle. Look at this. This is, this is literally Sotheby's. There's the expert that we were just talking about with a bangle. 
This year, despite the turmoil of the market across the board, Sotheby's Imperial Green Jade pieces fetched a total of 243 million Hong Kong dollars. That equates to 31 US uh, dollars, 31 uh, million, sorry, US dollars. That's a, an increase of 727,000%, uh, sorry, over the previous years, which shows a burge I can't say that word, what is it? Burgeoning. Burgeoning interest amongst collectors. So with everything that the world has gone through since 2019, one thing for sure that has not been affected is jade. Its appreciation continues to rise. But the pinnacle, the pinnacle is the bangle. Because remember, go back to the boulder. Remember, where do you fancy colours notoriously form? They don't form in the heart. They form around in the skin of the boulder. So to make a natural white jade bangle like this is, is almost impossible. And to have that pure colour. Plus, you're basically removing a huge carat weight. Literally, Everything I in the center. thought about that. Everything that, yeah, in the nice center. Yeah. They can't yeah. salvage it. Yeah. That gets wasted. So a bangle is like the ultimate symbol of prosperity. I know, I know it sounds almost vulgar to talk about the money, but it is. There's also a lot of history and sentiment attached to it, but it is the pinnacle of prosperity. Now, I'm going to say it again. The first auction I'm about to bring you, don't buy. Don't buy it. I don't want you to buy it. And you'll understand why on the second. It comes, as you would expect, and I'm going to hold this exactly the same way that, that uh, the jade expert that you saw pictured. Look, look at this. This photograph is absolutely mind-boggling because jade act forms in boulders literally in boulders and the core is where you get more often than not your sort of uh, your your greeny colors not not inevitably but more often it's the green the red is representing where your fancy jade forms so it's like a skin of an apple if you bite into an apple hard, yeah, hardly anything is it you get wafer amounts mm. of the fancy jade so to be able to get an entire pure white bangle is absolutely incredible. Remember, the only reason we are getting these opportunities, never lose sight of how special this is. Yes, you're watching a shopping TV channel and we have a laugh and a joke every, every single day. But this would have been sold at Hong Kong had it not have been cancelled. I've brought this to air. Is that right? Oh, don't buy this first auction. If you want, if, you, if you're looking for a pure type A natural jade bangle in white colour, it does not get any purer than this. Can you find any, any, any fusions of other colour, which wouldn't hinder the value, to be honest, but that is ice white mm. through and through mm. and by the way five thousand pounds is not a big ask this probably would be the price that it would be if it was at the hong kong trade fair it's not where we're stopping that's not what we're about here at jewelry maker this is this is ultimate legacy because without sounding derogatory to these other gemstones a decolourless, an eternally flawless diamond is 10 to the penny in comparison to this. A uh, Paraba tourmaline. A Brazilian Paraba tourmaline is 10 to the penny in comparison. An indicolite, 10 to the penny. Grand digerite even. They pale into the background. Alexandrite in terms of the rarity as what I am holding right now. The fact that we are at three figures 
is truly, truly unbelievable. And that is not your prize. We're going to do it though next. If you are looking, I buy, I buy gemstones and jewellery not, not just because I love them. I buy them because I know that my girls are never going to be able to purchase this. And that I can say that with complete confidence. They will never be able to buy a type A jade bangle. They won't. Highly, highly unlikely. If I was a betting person, that is exactly what I would bet on. I can buy this. You can buy this today. And furthermore, we can buy it at an achievable price tag. What was that? Sorry, Ross. £399. And £80 on split pay. Any other day of the week, I would 100% be saying to you, do it, buy it, buy it, buy it, buy it. And if you do want to buy the bangle on its own, that's fine. That's absolutely fine. Today's a little bit different, though. It is a little bit different because I'm going to say to those of you that have it in your baskets... If you would like to add sterling silver, tube settings, and some amazing tourmalines, then buy the second auction. This is still incredible. It really is. We could add zeros to that price tag and it would still be an absolutely incredible deal. It really, really would. This kit is coming up next. There are 70 opportunities here, which is absolutely unbelievable. For white type A certified natural jade. Certified. And by the way, it's, it, it, it's, it's one of those, it doesn't matter, you've heard Dave say about this, it doesn't matter about the carat weight. It's the kind of piece of jewelry, by the way, if you were to put it on, and I personally wouldn't, this would be under lock and key. I always say, I always advocate, wear your jewellery. I agree with that. But this is something that I would probably put in the safe and never take out. Maybe revisit it at later years. Maybe if I want to accumulate some money. You don't just get the natural type A pure white jade bangle in this opportunity. This is why I say, it. wait for the second auction because you're also going to get some of the most beautiful, round, brilliant cut tourmalines. Look at those colours. You've got an indicolite in there. You've got beautiful pinks. You've got some your wonderful green tourmaline. You've got a sheet of solid 925 sterling silver. And you have your tube sets. This is, like I said, if you, would, if you, get, if you make one purchase today... This is the one. Mm. It's a magical kit, isn't it? It's amazing. It is an absolutely incredible opportunity. Even if you've got no intention of actually using, turning or making the piece of jewellery. If you just want to get involved for the jade bangle, that's fine. Use the sterling silver and the tourmaline elsewhere. Yeah, yeah. There is 70 of these available. If you make one purchase, this I'm going to say this even as far as, if you make one pur purchase today or even this week, look at that, that's insane. That Look at how, how pure the, yeah. that colour is. Yeah. In fact, has anyone got a mobile phone on them handy right now? Because, well, how do we grade jade? Whilst the clock's ticking away, we grade jade not in the four Cs, not the same way as your diamonds and your, and your other coloured gemstones. It's all about colour. Well, pure white jade, you've just seen the price. Five seconds before we open the graphics, this is your moment to get involved. We talk about the, tr we actually talk about the texture and we talk about the translucency. The auction is Open jewelry makers, thank you, Dan. He knows what I'm going to do. Nephrite natural jade bangle in a kit. I never thought that would happen. And we're going to bring it to you at an uber, uber competitive price. Look at that level of translucency. Ice, that's ice jade. Ice jade. Look at that quality. If I follow the light round, if I can all the way 
completely pure, natural type A jade. Why did I say, probably for the first time ever in my presenting career, don't buy that last auction? Don't buy it. Because I think we're going we're gonna to give you an opportunity on the second auction. On the second auction, you might as well get involved with that opportunity. If you're not a silversmith, don't worry. Don't worry about it. Maybe that's something that you might, you might take on board a bit later on. We're under £1,000. You've got beautiful quality tourmalines. You've got a huge amount of sterling silver and you've got your tube sets, but it is all about the jade bangle. It's all. Been beautifully carved as well, isn't it? It's the quality of the jade. Yeah. I mean, it, I mean it, it's probably the most tactile piece of jewellery I think I've ever... Ever, ever. Uh, yeah, worn, felt. It's, it's just... Do you know, it's, you know, I, again, one of my PowerPoint presentations over the years, I can't remember exactly which one it is, it talks about the, the, you know, the top 10 rarest gemstones in the world. And it was a particularly jewel, it was a jeweler house, jewelry house that spoke about, you know, some people dream about the best diamonds and rubies and sapphires and emeralds. The reality is this is significantly more valuable than any of those, any of those gemstones, even of their finest grade. To be at three figures is utterly, utterly awesome. But today, I'm going to promise this kit for under £500. Use your split pay. It's 0% interest. You might as well. If you want to pay for it outright, amazing. Yes, you can do that, of course. But it's interest, 0% over four months. Four monthly payments of £124.75, pence, if that was your price. The reason why we said the first auction is amazing, don't buy that one though, buy the second, because you're getting this type A jade, certified natural type A jade, and everything else, 160 carats, solid jade all of this is wasted yeah all of that is wasted so making it one of the most expensive pieces of jewelry that any person could actually own because of the waste look at sotheby's look at bonhams look at all of those big auction houses if they have ever brought jade bangles to air what regardless of the color they will be astronomically priced and there'll be one available in a minute's time, we're going to take this entire kit, even lower, once in a lifetime opportunity. I don't know about you, like I, I've said this so many times, across many different gemstones, but it's never been more applicable than right here and right now. I buy gemstones because, of course, I love them, but also because I know my girls will never get the opportunity to purchase mm. white jade. Mm. I can say that with almost complete conviction and confidence. Out of the 70 that we had available, 30 have got, 32 have gone. And I'm still not stopping. We are going even lower. I get that this is a considered purchase. But imagine, fast forward, Claire, that really suits you as well. Fast forward, you know, I don't know, a year, two years, when we cannot get hold of natural type A jade bangles, which will happen, by the way, and we look back at the fact that we are op offering this under £500. If we, didn't get, if we don't get involved, myself included in this conversation, if we don't get involved, I'm going to kick myself. I'm going to be absolutely gutted that I let that window of opportunity pass me by. Today, if this is the first purchase of the day, fantastic. Or your only purchase of the day, fantastic. If it's your only purchase of the week, amazing. You're getting everything that's on the board here for £399. You can get hold of this. That's the price of the bangle and you're getting everything else for free. Completely and utterly certified type A. Na the, see the N in the graphics there? That stands for natural, not bleached, not polymer impregnated. This isn't type B or C. This is totally natural jadeite of one of the rarest colours, and you can get it home today for less than £100. We'll never get that opportunity no, again, Claire. it's exquisite, isn't it? 
I, I, you must have thought that all your Christmases had come at once. <laughs> I did think, oh, is this right? Oh. Yes. Yeah, it is. It's... Richard Wise, who, if you like, is... Well, he's the ultimate. He's the, he's, the, he's, he's the ultimate person that anybody who studies gemstones would look to. He's, we were all, by the way, all of your presenters were given a, a book when we were studying uh, with the GIA, The Secrets of the Gem Trade. Richard Wise is the pinnacle figure, if you like, in, 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 in accordance to the GIA. And he wrote about jade. In modern connoisseurship, <clears throat> a jadeite jade cabochon of pure white hue with a fine texture and a moderate translucency, well, I've just shown you the translucency, would be the finest of its type. It doesn't mention green. It doesn't mention any other color. He talks about white. white yeah. On examining jades, there we go, not just jadeite, jades, one should regard those white in color as the best. That's not... He was talking about cabochons, by the way. You're getting an entire solid bangle. Pure white, natural jade. Hello, Carol. I have the bangle. Wear it almost every day. The value that kit uh, of that kit is amazing. I totally, totally it's agree. A, I, I don't know if Carol agrees, but it does make you... It, you know when jewellery sort of like just makes you, I don't know... Stand a bit taller. Yeah, just it, it, you can... It's a, yeah, it's a, it's a really... Yeah, it's an incredible piece of jewellery. It is amazing. Mm. It is amazing. Hello, Gloria. Oh, I've wanted one of these. I'm getting mine. Well done, Gloria. I can see you there, Gloria. It's absolutely beautiful, isn't oh, it? I love it, Gloria. And you will never get a deal like this again. And, and that might sound very final and very, very blunt, but that's the reality of it. The only reason that we have this, this opportunity right here, right now, today, is because the Hong Kong Trade Fair is closed. They're not doing it again. They're under quarantine once again. So, of course, uh, Dave and Jake and, of course, other members of the buying team had every intention of going over to the Hong Kong trade fair. They would never, never have attempted to buy this over there because it would have been, it would have been priced out. But with that cancellation, they get a few phone calls and we bought as much as we possibly could. We are passing on the saving. Know that that is not the value. That is not the value of your bangle. Amazing. Now, Claire, like I said, you must have thought that all your Christmases have come at once. Now there's 21 left of this uh, of this uh, of this opportunity. I refuse to call it a kit. <laughs> Do you know what? I, I understand it is. I understand it's a high price point, but it's also an, a major opportunity, a major opportunity. And I just I look at this and think, I don't know about you, Claire. Fast forward to when I'm I don't know, in my older years. And I think back to jewelry maker and some of the pieces that I've bought, and I think, oh, I had the chance to buy white jade. Didn't take it. And I see the prices like that. We knew was, that's information at our fingertips. It's there all over the web. We know the value of this gemstone. But it is, it's a memorable piece of jewelry. Oh my it? goodness. A, yeah, it really is. It really is. Well done, everybody. Well done. Limited quantity now on the kit. Make sure you do check them out. Um, a, a massive heartfelt congratulations. Now, Claire. Okay. What are you going to do? So I'm going to show you if you um, if you do want to work and you can either work in the same way with the, uh, the sterling silver sheet or the uh, so you could you could maybe have a practice with the, the copper sheet first. But it's the same sort of principles if you want to, there's to make kit, that. Because there's another kit, isn't there? There's another kit coming up. Not with yes. jade, though. Yeah, no, not not with the jade. But it's a, so same same principles as, as as both of these. So what I've done is, is um, essentially like if you've ever seen you know um, like um, an ear cuff. Uh, type design but it goes around um, ah, okay because obviously you've got that complete bangle so if I sort of like show you all the way around you can see so it's like a almost like a um, like a tag or that ear cuff going around and there's lots and lots you can do obviously lots and lots of different designs um, so this one I've incorporated a bit of granulation and then the um, the tube set tourmaline on there and you'll have you know the different the different colors that you'll get within your tourmaline but I've opted to have those um, just like that, that uh, the green, greeny colours on there. So the other thing that I've used as well is, um, so yeah, you can see that. So we've got the, um, the granulation um, and the tube setting on that one. 
so the um with the with this design um because you know if you get that and there's quite a lot of silver in there so you'll mm. have more than enough to um to make the two you can see so i've actually used a little bit of the liver of sulfur on there and then i've used um an engraving tool and going because you know there's sort of yes to have it as christmas designs but i didn't want anything that was going to be too you know we're talking about like stars and christmas designs i didn't want anything that was going to be too twee if you like yeah yeah um for something that i think is probably you know one of the most elegant pieces of jewelry i've worked with which is you know is a bangle so i've tried to like think about um so you know if you're thinking about Christmas jumpers, knits, yarns, things like that. So just having ba basic patterns. I'm really sorry. This um, you haven't traveled. I am. Actually. Yeah, yeah. So um, so I've just taken patterns. So if you are working on um on your copper or your silver um sheet and working with the tool that I'm going to work with. So I've kept it as um as patterns. Um, so this tool, I've not worked with this tool before. It's really, really, really good. It is um, coming up, but let's give you an eye on the graphic. Yes, it's really, really good fun. So my starting point is going to be, um, so if, it, if you've got your, your silver sheet, I would use, because of the thickness of the silver, I would use your, um, your saw and your blades for that. But if you get the copper, which is nicer, if, I'd always say something like this, maybe think about doing a prototype as well, just so that when you actually go and start working on your um, silver, you, you've sort of, you've been there once you know exactly mm. what, what you're doing. Um, so what I'm going to, um, what I am going to do, I'm just going to leave this. Is that all right? If you, no will problem. you give me a... Yeah. Um, no yeah. problem. I can so, keep, you, I can keep you, you in the loop. Thank you. <laughs> so I'm about to throw it across the, across the <laughs> studio. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to... Um, show you how uh, you can use the tool and you can use things like if you've got maybe um, so I've used some some of Lola's stickers things like that um, uh, and you can get diff different effects so my starting point is I want to make that cuff and you can exactly the same way you can use uh, these these um, uh, you can use these techniques to make cuffs as well so ear cuffs too so I'm going to start off and I'm just going to cut sections uh, of this. So what I did, I'd measured, um, if you get a piece of string or a little piece of wire and, and you measure around. So I think, you know, some of them will be different, um, might be different diameters. Uh, and certainly the, the agate one is, is slightly different as well. So maybe get a little bit of string, cotton or wire and just get yourself a, a rough measurement of going around. And that then, you can then translate that uh, and measure out the pieces that you... Um, uh, that you're going to work with on the flat. So uh, my starting point would be you could you can if you want to uh, you can uh, use your marker and get and uh, measure out. So I'm just going to cut sections of this. So I've got my got my snips here and I'm going to go all the way and I can get a couple out of that at least. So I'm going to go again. I'm going to go across. So again, because we've cut, cut the metal, so what we'd be doing is you would take the time, sand these down, file them down, file down the corners, um, because obviously everything is going to be, you know, you're going to have this, so that it's coming um, uh, next to your skin. It's going to move around a little bit, so you've got the two options there, you know, so you have, you've got the nice noise as well of the two together, uh, but also you want to make sure that, that that bit's quite quite neat as well, and we're going we're gonna to squeeze it around, um, but, you know, you want to make sure that like whenever you cut any metal that you're really going in tidying at the corners do it with your nail nail buffer things like that um so if i just show you so i'm going to work emery boards files like that and just really take the time um like that so i've got a couple of different ways so if i show you if i actually bring this one in and then you can see the different um Oh, look the at different that. sorts this that coming you can up as go. Well. Yeah, so this is just you know because you've got um, so this is working with the the tool that you've got. This is the um, texturing here, so we'll do that with the hammer as well. This is working with my riveting hammer. So this is ah. working um, with like so the stickers and the liver of sulphur. Are you clever? And then with the uh, engraving tool. So can you see you, you've got so many different? So I wouldn't actually say you know that. You've got you've got motifs here, but what I didn't want to do, I didn't want to have it too Christmassy twee type thing because I think it's a really elegant piece of jewellery. Mm. So uh, what I've done is I've um, 
I've got my copper that's like this. So we started off and you've got this lovely, lovely polished sheet. So like with the copper, the silver, there's lots you can do with it. So polishing it up or you can um, use your tool as well to almost give like that textured uh, matte look. That's really, really on trend. Or use both, you know, and have a, have a contrast. You can use the, the tool to, um, you know, uh, work in and, and engrave like that. So if I show you, we'll have the first one. And I'll just, so if we look at, let's do, uh, let's do this one here, because that's a really, really easy one to, to do. Chris, a yes. sorry, a couple of people have asked about the internal diameter of the jade bangle. Um, it's, what did you say? 57 to 60 millimetres. So in centimetres... So you've got to remember if you put your hand lights, they are meant to be snug because you obviously don't want this to fall over, uh, fall over the top of your hand. So, and I mean, I, I, I know everyone's different, but I actually do. I have smaller wrists, but massive hands. No, <laughs> you don't have massive hands, but I do have quite big hands going across. So, so yeah. about, about six centimetres. And yeah. what you obviously need to measure is sort of this part, this part of your hand when you're actually making that kind of shape. Does that make sense? Yeah, because then you're sort so of so that like, kind of yeah. shape. Um, and there is still a little bit of give. If you're looking about it in inches, it's about two. And it's out, that sounds really small, doesn't it? But actually, when it's on, no, no, uh, yeah. So let's say between uh, fifty-seven, uh, five point seven to six centimeters. But that's the part that you need to consider the thickness between the thumb and here. If you are one of those that want to wear it, to be honest, I don't care about that. I have eleven left. I don't care about that. This is the kind of piece of jewelry that I personally would put in uh, put in the in, in the safe um, for future years. Uh, I mean, but you'll want to wear it though. I mean, you will want to wear it. It is beautiful, and I know I can almost hear I can almost hear Susie screaming yes. at TV right now yeah. to say exactly yeah. the same. Um, and many people with jade bangles as well. In China, they don't mention the carrot weight. They don't mention the carrot weight. They don't mention the measurements or anything like that. It's about the jade bangle. But if they are on the smaller size, then they obviously put them on, on when they're younger and they grow with it. So how amazing is that? Yeah. Amazing. We've got 11 left. 11 It's a really left. special piece of jewellery. Such... It? Well, it's the circle of heaven. Yeah. It's the pinnacle. Yeah. It is literally the pinnacle. I'm sorry to interrupt you. No, no, no. No, that's fine. So yeah, have um, you used your 30-day money-back guarantee? Amazing. Absolutely amazing. So I'll show you some different uh, different techniques here. Um, so let's have a look at the first. Let's get some texture on, on some of these. Okay, so if, I've, I've, if we'll, we'll see with both. So the other, if you can see that it looks a little bit darker, so I've used your liver of sulfur. Liver of sulfur is really, really great... Um, great for colouring. Again, it's going to give you that oxidising of, um, of the metal. So you can see it gives it that dark tone compared to the, um, that polished tone. Now, if you add in that darker tone, that's it. just like in a line drawing, um, it means that you can see different um, uh, things stand out. Um, so you've got, the, you've got the contrast. So I can't recommend that liver of sulphur is, you'll get a little, a little, little bottle and that will last you uh, it's stinky. It's it's really smelly. It's really brilliant, and yeah. that will last you for such a long time. Years in there. It's absolutely that's the brilliant stuff. That's literally the the, the, the the well. Look, you've got the code just there on the bottle. Six pound ninety nine gets you that whole bottle. Yeah, it's so so good, so good. It smells like boiled eggs. Yeah, it's a really good, and it'll go through go through the instructions. It's a really lovely process, but. The difference that you will get if you, you can make two pieces that are identical, have one in the liver of sulphur and just check about gemstones that you can put in there. Um, it will look totally, totally mm. different. So let's have a let's have a little look at some of the um, some of the bits on here and then I can show you work, working with the tool. Um, so I've got that lovely piece of, of copper. Now, if we if, if you can have a little look at the edges here, you can see if I work my way along. I am going to flare out those a little bit to give that. So let's have a look at some of the differences on here. So you can see how that's going to work now. So if you look at, if you look at where um, we've gone along the edge, now I would go then back over with that nail file there, but that's going to then give me, so if I went all the way around, so you can see if you have a look at this one here, that's actually 
that one. Oh, yeah. But you can see, so with the liver of sulphur, and then we're going to buff it it's off. It's like a giraffe print. It looks good, doesn't it? But it's because it's, it's, the liver of sulphur is just going to sit into, into these sections here. So that's, that's that one. And that's with that part of your, um, of your hammer. OK, mm -hmm. so if we have a look at another one of the other techniques, so if we look at this one here, so it's a bit like cross hatching. So, again, thinking about if you know if you're if you're into sketching or drawing, how you'd use your cro cross hatching to um, you know, add some depth, give it uh, some shading. So we'll have a little look at that as well. So if I pop that one down there. So again, so I'm going to work my way along. So with my riveting hammer here. Can you see where my coffee cup has been on my um, steel block? Oh, it shows that it's well loved. Multi-use. Multi so let's have a look and let's take, let's, if we take a little bit of this off, let's see how this goes in here. And you can get these blocks, by the way, uh, you always say about cheap, you know, pound shops and things like yeah. that. Can you see in there how that's then? Ooh. So you've got the texture and you've and you've got the shading, which is a really nice, nice effect as well. So then if I move on to something like, so if I show you this, so this one here, if we look at the next one, which is that one there. So we've got what you know, very, very, very precise uh, hearts. Uh, and they can be any shape you want. So again, if you go into and have a look at um, stickers are really good with this. So if I pop that there, so what I've done, I've just got some, um, got some stickers. Uh, well, my mum had actually got these stickers uh, for me and Lola. Um, but So any stickers that you've got, so you pop your stickers on, put it into your, um, your liver of sulphur, and then I'm gonna, just going to just take these off. Just really carefully see how sticky they are, because I had, did put these on yesterday. And let's reveal that. So I'm trying to scratch the metal. And we can see how beautifully this then comes off. So to seal anything, you can use those waxes. You can use like your Renaissance wax will just will seal and pop that in. So you can see how that's going to come up. So just take your time, peel these off. So you, and you can do both ways. And what's a really nice look, if you don't want to use your liver of sulphur, have a take this one off so yeah you can see there we are we've got that one there so yeah now this is I, it, this is so clever so so clever this little tool oh we've put the graphics on your screens the portable engraver pen it's really good so when it when it um when it arrives you just you put a oh, couple of there. um oh i like your earrings thanks um yeah you can see so you pop your batteries in and all you're going to do, you just turn, turn it on and then we can, start, we can start playing with it. This has never been on our screens before. It's a premiere. Is it? Yeah. I haven't had it before. It's so good. Isn't it good? Yeah. I like the fact that it's not scary looking either. You know, it's literally no, it's battery it's operated. Fun, it? Yeah. yeah. Um, away you get 3 99 Claire. How much? 3 99 No, is it? Yeah. How oh, many, that's how many really have good. How many Roscoe? How many have we got? Uh, only 30. So can I write with this? Yeah, so that's what I've done. Um, can I have a go? Yeah, of course you can. Do you want to watch the edges? OK, don't drill the table. There you are, do you want to I know, this is always... On that? This is always worry, isn't it? <laughs> oh, of course, now you can't see Claire, can you? Sorry. Um, what shall I do? I would start it and then, um, yeah, start it and then put it, make, make contact, yeah. Oh, you... Oh. But you've got more than enough copper to have a have a play about. Yeah. It's good, isn't it? That's really good. Oh, you're going freehand. Look at me. Oh, it looks like someone's here. It's meant to be a heart. It was meant to be. Oh, you, uh, wow. Isn't it good? Isn't it's it sold good? Out. Amazing. Sorry. Oh, enjoy that, everyone. Yeah. That so you can see it. that. So that's a little. That's a little bit of. Um, um, the white jade bangle kit, by the way, we're in single figure quantities on that now. So good luck. Do check them out. You've written with your tool. So make sure you check out on that kit. Once in a lifetime opportunity to get hold of that single figure quantities. What have you written? <laughs> <laughs> 
I oh, put Merry Christmas. Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. This is like Kerry Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> oh, who's Kerry? So... <laughs> who's Kerry? <laughs> oh, uh, right. What was I you doing? Okay. No, I didn't. I didn't. <laughs> no, I didn't. So what I'm going to do with this, so maybe if you, if you did, if you're lucky enough to get the tool and you want to have a uh, have a go with it. <laughs> So oh, I'm like just going to put a bit of some sticker on here. Where, where do you get all these stickers, Claire? Because you have the most amazing <gasps> I stickers. I think, um, so I steal a lot from my children over the years. <laughs> <laughs> from my mum. But you can get these, again, like uh, little, you know, pan shops and things. Oh, and okay. Crafty places, yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> yes, all right, thank you, Adam, yeah. <laughs> But with like kids national geographic or something on it i got and then i had a big lola didn't it in her yeah writing <laughs> <laughs> maybe it was that that gave it away um so what you can do this is a nice way to just maybe start if you um if you haven't uh you know if you don't want to go like l did straight away freehand you know if you're sort of going in Ah, that's a good idea. So this, I just, uh, this I found sort of built my confidence a bit of, of getting used to the tool going against the... <gasps> and so you're following round. Have you come up with a really good idea? Oh, we're on the overhead, Claire, and we can oh, sorry. look at that. Can you see how that's, that's going to... Do you know what that reminds me of? You know those foil things you used to do as a kid where you scrape the foil off? Yes, and they're so exciting, aren't they? Yeah. But I mean, I'm doing full, you know, if you, you can do like that cross hatching again, we talked about, you know, you'll get different, different looks like that. So, so you're going to, you're going to prep all of that of whatever design, uh, obviously you want. And then it's a case of, so you then go back in prep, prep the, um, obviously you're going to prep your, the edges, you know, spend a lot more time than I have of, of like uh, filing it down or, um, you know, with your emery boards, polishing it if, if you want to. Then what we're going to do is, so if I start to follow this around. Oh, it's like a lovely, it's a, it's a really different, uh, almost like charm bracelet. Yeah. And there's nothing, you know, you, you could, you could put, uh, uh, you know, do your, um, uh, you know, with your hole punch if you've got one, there's nothing to stop you. And then you could have a... So all I'm going to do with this, I'm just going to fold round on one side. So can you see there? So I followed the followed the curve, and I am going to get rid of some of this 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 excess here, and I'm really pushing against. We're side. putting the graphics onto the screen for this kit now, Claire. There are just to give you a heads up, there are only twenty five. Oh, is there? Oh, it's, it's lovely. It's, it's yeah, is, and, and you know, it's it's a solid, genuine gemstone bangle. Yes, it's gorgeous. Yeah, yes, our gate is 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 more plentiful, obviously, than uh, than jade, <clears throat> um, and the price will obviously reflect that. It is gorgeous, and I love the fact that you've got the we've got the copper sheet with this one. It works really well, doesn't it? Well, it's so really, you, what really you're trimming well. this down? To all I'm going to, yeah, sorry, all I'm going to do is just trim that, trim that down. You would then, you know, again, make sure that your edges, because that's going to go next to your skin, so you'd spend the time filing it around, and then I'm going to go and push. So I can already see I need to trim that off slightly, pushing it so it's quite tight. Two different looks, isn't it? You can have it so it, one, you know, if you're pushing really firmly against the um, mm. the bangle itself. Um, it's not going to move very much or you have it and I, I do like the um, you know make sure that you, you like I say you fold it off so it's not going to scratch the, the stone too much I'm going to trim that down now while I can still access it really easily let's slide that round and again I'm going to push, push that. That like that. so look nice don't they all, all together yeah. almost like a different take on a um, on a charm bracelet Look at that, and then you've got your agate and, you know, nothing, peeping through. Yeah, and if you've got the tool and you, you know, have a practice and you're happy to do, you know, there's nothing to stop you personalising it. It's nice. Love that. Nice Absolutely look, love that. Seventy nine ninety nine. There are only a handful of these. Here's your bangle. Comes boxed as well, much like your uh, your your jade. With agates, of course, it it, it, it it sort of really holds on to some beautiful dye, um, which then highlights the areas of opacity and translucency. Not just getting that though, um, you're also getting um, four by four inches of uh, your copper sheet, which is 0.32 millimeters in its thickness. So. Hey. <laughs> 
<laughs> that was a terrible fee, wasn't it? Uh, Thirty-nine pounds and ninety-nine pence. Only. How lovely! I mean, that's I mean, that's a massive carrot weight again, isn't it? Yeah, I don't think I think until you wear the, you don't actually. It's I, I, it's like nothing else. It is. Yeah. It's a real yeah. Like I say, it's a memorable piece of jewellery. And really lovely and cool. Both of them. There are only 25. I mean, you could literally just do that, couldn't you? Yeah, it's gorgeous. Just wear it yeah, it's a beautiful, yeah. Beautiful now, piece. I totally get that the Jade Kit is, it was a considered price point. And we want you still to be able to get involved with Claire's amazing kits. So we're going to take it even lower. Oh. That's a huge amount of, of, of agate. It is, yeah. I don't recall ever having agate bangles before. This may well be the first time, says Ross. We're going lower than already what it seems like an amazing deal. What a, what a gift that Lovely, is. Lovely, isn't it? Look at the markings in there, how that, that dye has picked them out, hasn't it? Yeah, beautiful, deep ultraviolet and again, that, It's like that galaxy look, isn't it? You know, yes. when you're talking about that, like celestial types, it's that, it's got that. Well, yeah, is it a nebula? Neb yes. I can see that, totally see that. It's a beautiful, genuine gemstone. Always one of our firm favourites here at Jewelry Maker, particularly now because we can do designs like Claire has just shown you. Um, be quick though, because like I said, 25 is not a massive, uh, a massive quantity. You won't believe this, Jewelry Makers. Yeah, 399 for that beautiful jade, uh, the Empress White Jade. It is a considered price point, not comparably though for what you have just got. 29.99 to get hold of your agate again it's a more it's a more abundant gemstone it is still a gemstone though of course and to be able to get hold of this car this carrot weight of gemstone in a beautiful carved bangle how amazing loving that cumbria city of bristol beverly nicolette gloucestershire christine you've done it well done sit back and enjoy um it's it's a brand new it's never been brought to air previously we've we're over allocated on this opportunity so again first come first serve um, uh, 49 of you have it in your baskets for the final, well, we're less than 10, single figures. Anne, well done. Uh, Beverly, well done to you. New customer, well done to you. Lynn, Janice, new customer. Cardiff, Christine, Helen, Audrey, and Janice. Amazing, amazing. Now, we have single figure quantities left of that beautiful um, Empress White Jade the first kit but it's worth me actually recapping it for you all i get there the, you know it's a considered purchase uh, what i don't know if you were if, if you and i were to go to sotheby's imagine this for a second and there'll be literally one jade bangle one jade bangle christie's here we go they don't use imperial jade they don't use any other color they use white jade white jade on the photograph which by the way is not as white as the jade that you're getting today. You know, there'll be one jade bangle and there will be collectors from all around the world who will either be uh, uh, sort of there in person, they'll be dialing in, they'll, be, they'll have other people there for them. You know, that's the kind of wealth. Um, but they'll be battling over one jade bangle. What was my point in this story? Um, we've actually, to, to say that we actually had 70 is epic. And that is only because the Hong Kong fair did not happen this year. Take advantage whilst we can. That's what I was going to say. If we went to Sotheby's or Christie's, do you think we could say, I'll tell you what, I'll pay you 100 quid. I'll take it home for a bit and see if I love it. If I don't, then I'm going to send it back to you. 30 days, is that okay? Is that okay, Mr. Sotheby's? Mr. Sotheby's, is that, is that all right? No, I don't know any other any other jewellery house that would ever even entertain that idea. And yet here we are doing exactly that. Exactly that. You can get the bangle on its own, but you're actually better off getting Claire's kit today. £399 or £99.75 on your 0% interest split pay that's made over four months. I have literally single figure quantities and I still have people with it in their baskets. Cumbria, new customer, Nicola, Carolyn, Nicola, Amanda, Christina, another Carol, London. We've got multi buyers on this opportunity. More than likely, those multi buyers will be jewelry houses. I speak to a few of them on a regular basis. I know of one 
one that shops with us quite regularly, particularly with our jade, um, that is on Hat and Garden. And they'll buy it, literally it'll be straight, it'll be in the shop window in, within a week. It'll be in the shop window. Do you think it's going to be in the shop window at 399? Categorically, no way. Um, okay, now I've just got one of the most amazing tools put in front of me, Claire. It's exciting, isn't it? You love a Dremel, don't you? I do. What's a Dremel all about? I think the Dremel is, um, I'd known about Dremel before um, uh, Jewelry Maker, but then that brilliant day when we went to go and see them. That was fun. Wasn't it was it? so, yeah, and yeah. you know, that they are the quality of the Dremel tools are it's it's so good and they're so well researched, uh, thought Gosh. about the support you'll get on the on the tools as well it is is really really good and they are just yeah you've got you've got a constant uh, there's a there's a the, the, you can literally message them can't mm. you direct yes yeah um, if you've got any the, questions and, and what I do really like in any of the um, uh, instructions so you might be that I've had to set things up it, everything is done it's very very well thought out yeah. Uh, and they make it as, as simple as possible. Um, it's just, and they're really, really good quality uh -huh. tools. So I can see that goes on there. It's like yeah, a little... so I didn't get this. I didn't get That's this like one. A little looks, I won't push it, it in, really but it does good. click in. I think you must have like um, a couple of different heads as well on there. Yeah. Oh, okay. So is that something that, oh, okay. Perfect. So it sits on your workstation yeah. just like that. And then like, and then you've got all your little, um, all the little bits on oh, there. Oh, that's where you, you put all these bits? Yeah. Oh, clear. See how well thought out all that is? Isn't it just, that's classic Dremel, isn't it? Seems classic Dremel. Organized put your rouge. Well. Put your rouge in there, and then you've got these bits around here for your. Oh, look! Rouge, yeah. That's for polishing rouge, isn't it? Yeah. Claire? So you can get that. So with the nice with the mops that you've got there. With your mops? Um, you can have, uh, you, yeah, nice high shines. Be perfect for your, Look your at that. silver. So now this is great for what? Why would I? Why would I use this? Well, I'm just tool? looking at first. I thought it was just an engraver, but obviously, as I'm talking about the polishing mops, that's and gonna, that's rouge, gonna, isn't it? Yeah, and so you know, so when I talked about, um, so you know, where I talked about uh, doing the edges of the um, of the metal, so you, mm. you just buff that down because you've got a little sanding sanding wheel there, little uh, grit there. Yeah. You've got uh, what looks like is that? Um, I think you've got a yeah. So that you've got a different um, uh, different sizes for the heads. And it's all handheld. Got really lightweight. Yeah, three different sorts of um, engraving heads. So you could have different different textures. You've so got the, a burr there. There are different types of Dremels, aren't there? Um, if you've ever been into B and Q, for example, you will find Dremels because this is not just something for your jewellery making. This will absolutely. By the way, when I walked home with a Dremel and I got it to sand down the banisters. Basically, my husband got really excited about mm, it. He was like, because yeah. this is like a, it's a power tool effectively, isn't it? Um, and you can use it in so many walks of life. Uh, but the stylo is much more intricate, isn't it? And much with, more precise. And if you look, you're, you know, you'd be holding it like a pen. Yeah. It's so much it's more like, lightweight. Yeah, in a way of, um, you know, when you have the, um, oh, what's it called? You know, the flex shaft, that type of, um, that type of effect, isn't it? So you've got, it's, a, it's precision, which is, I guess if you're, you know, if you want to do something like writing names or uh, intricate designs, that's what you want, isn't it? Yeah. You don't want to be having something big and clunky that you've got to... No, or heavy, because yeah. obviously that's going to make it uh, more difficult for you to work with. Now, we've got 50 of these available. And we're going to do it in one price crash. We've, you've met Andy. Andy's been on our shows. Um, he literally had his hands full when we all went down. Literally uh, bombarded him at a Dremel training <laughs> uh, training day. I, I think he said, "Gosh, I've never. I, I don't think I've ever worked so hard." Um, now we're going to do this in one incredible price crash. There's 50 available. It comes with everything that you see: the stand, the mops, the rouge. Screwdriver, what do you call that? Uh, spanner. spanner, not screwdriver. <laughs> and you'll get instructions as well. They'll be really, really yes. clear. Yeah. Sorry, I'm not. As yeah. you can tell, as you can tell, I don't do much of the uh, the, the, the power tools in our house. What? No Good. way! Is yeah, that forty nine ninety nine? No way! My my Dremel was about three hundred quid, and I couldn't buy it from here. At Jewelry Maker, because we'd run out. It wasn't long after we started selling the Dremel and we'd we'd sold out. So I had to buy mm. mine from the, the, the DIY shop. Mine was about £300. Not exactly the same tool, but I'd probably use it in the same way. Yeah, yeah. You still only pay one potion packaging, remember? And split oh. pay as well. 
brilliant. Way, yes. Yeah. Dremel is like, it's, 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 I don't know, the Ferrari of Yeah, well, of it's, tools, part, of, it's it? part of the Bosch uh, group, yeah. isn't it? Um, yeah. So, yeah, Worcester Bosch. So, yeah, it's really, they are, that's very, very good. Remember... Your free gifts as well for Christmas in the uh, Christmas in the July. Um, if you're shopping as part of Christmas in July week, you will be receive a free gift, and we're going to be giving away uh, some jewelry maker money as well today. Oh, Merry Christmas! Get a free mystery strand when you buy anything during our seven days of Christmas. How awesome is that? How, this is not just jewellery making. This is something that is going to come, you know, really uh, cover a lot of hobbies, crafts, needs. You know, if you want to sharpen the blades on your lawnmower, you can use your Dremel. Oh, I need to do that. Yeah. Yeah. You can sharpen things like, I mean, be careful, obviously, knives. I bought mine, like I said, literally to sand the banisters down because I got, literally, I was like thir third spindle in. I was like, this, this life is too short for this. <laughs> Life is far too short for me to sand in the little nooks and crannies. Got hold of a Dremel. Honestly, it flew through. Flew through it. Life Brilliant. is too short for some, for, for some jobs. Uh, hiya, Liz. Hello, darling. Morning, JM team. Met Andy on a Zoom demo um, on how to use the Dremel. What a nice man and a great yeah. teacher. He is a lovely man. He is really, really nice. Do you know what, Liz, is, as well? Yeah. You should have seen... He was, like a, he was like a deer in the headlights when we turned up at, at Worcester Bosch, though, because... Poor bloke, yeah. Can you remember? You're chuckling because the poor bloke did literally look like that. Yeah. And at the end, you were like, oh, we, we're going now, Andy. And he was like, good. <laughs> good. Because we were literally like down. a group of children. Uh, hello to you, Wendy. Morning. A lot of people use a Dremel to trim their dog's nails. Genius. Oh, I might have a go with that. I uh, used it to smooth my uh, parents' beak after trimming it. Careful, it gets hot. Ah. Yeah, I guess you would be. I'd be nervous of doing that but myself. But that's how you just reduce, I guess, Wendy as well, does that redu really reduce the, um, the speed? And anything like that, you're not, you know, if you've got like lots of friction, you know, you're not going to just keep hold it on, hold it on, hot. No, because it would get hot, hot, wouldn't yeah. it? It would get hot. I'm, I can't, I'm gobsmacked by that price tag. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. It's nice to have um, tools again, isn't it? What Dremel is like affordable. It, yeah, yeah. Right. Now, the Nephrite is it's just about available. There are a lot of you with it. Herefordshire, Cumbria, uh, Cumbria, new customer, Norfolk, Devon, Surrey, West Midlands, Cornwall and Oxfordshire. I can still see you with it in your basket. There are six left. We are over allocated. I've got two very special auctions to bring you um we're going to do it just before the break to be on the back of claire's amazing kits because ah oh, this isn't just any nephrite though this is this is how exclusive these are do you remember that email ross he knows what i'm thinking because oh this Remember what we were talking about when it comes to jade in China, they don't really, they don't differentiate between nephrite and jadeite. They call this the original jade because this is older than jadeite. And most of those carvings of antiquity will not have been jade. Many of them will have been this gemstone. And Ross and I, some months ago, a couple of months ago, were actually prepping for a show with one of these strands from this very parcel. And Dave Troth walked past one of our gem experts and he said, literally stopped in his tracks. Um, I'd gone at this point, hadn't I? So this, I'd actually gone. He stopped in his tracks. And then we came in the following day to this email. And I'm sharing with you the email, which went, came direct, as you can see, I love, to Ross and myself. Guys, I've just seen the strand for tomorrow's birthday deal. This is a new mine of Burmese nephrite. Originally, this was being sold as jadeite because it is so translucent. Nephrite sometimes is more opaque than jadeite. Essentially, this is the original jade from a new mine. And I need to point out, this is obviously still ethically sourced um, prior, when, when nephrite and, and jadeite was accessible. I've just looked through all of them you've got spinach green color and it's natural. 
Spinach green to nephrite is what imperial green is to jadeite. We could never dream of bringing you imperial jade, and I don't know if we'll have the chance to get this grade again. Please let the audience know. This is what he was talking about. Now, I have literally two strands. Two strands. Firstly, in one of those strands, it's not 38 centimetres, it's 100 centimetres. Oh, my gosh. I thought it was... Um, I thought that was two. No. So imagine that oh, in the marlin. So that, that, yeah, that means so that, like, the necklace is on the end. That's yeah, yeah, that yeah. type of... I mean, look at that. Wow. Yeah, that, you really can see long that spinach line. green colour from yeah. there, can't you? And I'm going to wrap it around the back of my hand because it's also graduated. Totally natural. This is way more than a parcel that you are sourcing right now. These go from three to six millimetres and they are natural in their colour. Those of you, again, collector's hats on, the original jade in the, the most exemplary colour. I have 14 available. That's it. That is it. We had strands, endless strands like this yesterday. Tanzanite, ruby. I get that. That's possible. But to get nephrite jade, that is astonishingly rare. Remember 730, uh, 730, what was it, 7%? The increase this year over last year for this very gemstone. It is hugely, hugely in demand. There are 14 available. That's it. The original jade. There are 11 of these remaining. 10 getting snapped up by collectors. Nine. Well done. Well done, well done. This year, despite the turmoil of the market across the board, Sotheby's Imperial Green Jade pieces fetched a total of 243 Hong, uh, million Hong Kong dollars. That's 31.3 million USA dollars, an increase of 727% compared to the previous year, which shows no uh, burgeoning interest... Uh, shows, sorry, shows a, a burgeoning burgeoning interest amongst collectors. Uh, collectors. Can't, I'll put my teeth in in a second. Today, you can get that spinach green colour, the original jade. Oh, I knew you were going to do that. Oh, look at that. We thought... Many people thought this was jade out because of the translucency. We know that with nephrite... We know that with nephrite, it is, we should expect it to have more opacity. Look at the white carving that I showed you a few moments ago. Did it have any translucency? Very, very little translucency. Jadeite normally ha is the one which has the, 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 the translucency. So here it is. Do you notice? Whereas your nephrite today, natural in colour has translucency, that is incredibly exciting. Nobody is going to pay £500. Nobody. Do you own J uh, the original Jade? No. No, nor me. I'd love to. That's a gorgeous strand, isn't it? It is beautiful. It's imperial Jade colour, isn't it? It is that imperial Jade colour. Today... Wow. Oh, I can't say that out loud. Uh, less than a pound per carat for the original jade. Certified as well, natural. Please do, if you are one of the lucky collectors, do get hold of your certificate of authenticity. Remember, um, so here is the email that Ross 
Um, uh, the, 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 sorry, Ross, I'm, th I'm, I'm, I'm keeping you on your toes here, aren't I? That Ross and I received on the back of this very parcel. Guys, just seen your strand for tomorrow's birthday deal. Uh, this is new mi a new mine of Burmese nephrite. Originally, this was being sold as jadeite because it is so translucent. Essentially, this is the original jade. I've uh, just looked uh, through them all. You've got spinach green and it's natural. Spinach green to nephrite is what impedes Imperial green is to jadeite. We will never bring you imperial jadeite. Never, never, ever, ever, ever. Never have I been more confident in saying that statement, um, as, as does Dave. And we don't think we'll get this chance ever again. There's seven of them left. Well done, Anne, Leslie, Alison, Gloucestershire. We've got Amy, Jennifer, new customer, Sandra, Sue, Nicola, Carola, Leslie, Hertfordshire, Penny, Sarah, Wendy, Janice, new customer wanting two. Claire, as you can see, more names than I actually have available. So it's going to be allocated on a first come, first serve. Nicola in Norfolk, I can see you there. You have to check them out. I'll wait with you. You can get it home today. The original jade, the oldest jade. People always think, that jadeite is older it's not nephrite was the original sandra well done to you pushing us down to the final six you know many of those wonderful uh, wonderful carvings that you see at the likes of sotheby's and certainly the one that i've just shown you were not jadeite they were nephrite jade but they don't differentiate over in china jade is jade it's all about the colour, it's all about the translucency, which you have an amazing translucency, and it's all about the texture. Four of these are left. Well done to you, Kim. 22 of you on the web have it in your basket for the final three. The final three. Yeah, it. Uh, I mean, Sarah, you want three. I can see people want it with threes and twos. Look, this is what Imperial Jade looks like. We know we'll never bring it to air. We, know, we, we, we can't afford to buy it. We cannot afford to buy it. You're getting natural nephrite jade in that spinach green colour, which is the equivalent, for £37.49 on slip pay. The final one. The final one. Amazing. I'm going to leave it with you because I have one more strand. Oh, I've just had an idea. Now... There's the same quantity, 14 available. Look at that, Claire. This is gorgeous, isn't it? Would you, are you thinking of putting... You know what I'm thinking, don't you? Mm. 250 carats on this metre. On this one, 36 centimetre, mm. but there's 300 carats, because they are in... Oh, look at this colour. It's, it's this just mm. yeah. dotted. Look at that colour. It's natural, totally and utterly natural. You know, these should be treated. If we were to pop this next door, if, we were, if I was to, you know, literally knock on the door of our, studio, uh, our sister studio and say, would you like some original jade in spinach green colour in finished pieces of jewellery, they would literally fall over themselves to get hold of it. Because... That is like imperial jade. We seem to, you know, imperial, imperial, imperial. And yes, it is still the most expensive. It is still the most expensive, but they do believe the next couple of years is going to be rivaled um, by the white colours that we saw a few moments ago. Spinach is the equivalent in the original jade. These are huge. There are about 50 solitaires. You know we had the. Do you know we had those pearls earlier on? Can you imagine these with pearls inside? Mm. I do think that they, that they go beautifully though, don't they? In the the rounds and then those means, wheels. Oh yeah, the wheels that's what through. I would do. Just yeah. Use them sparingly, just a couple of yeah. markers. Yeah. Oh my goodness, that is the future Sotheby's pieces. Immediately we are down to twelve opportunities. That's a bigger carrot weight, averaging significantly larger carat weight individually. Look at that, look at that. Look at that quality. Look at that translucency. Oh my word. The first price crash is not what you are going to say, uh, you're gonna pay. We just have to make it, uh, start chipping our way towards this deal. 
under £100. But it's bigger. There's more carat weights. And they're rarer because they're bigger individual stones. Imagine that together. Mm. Imagine those together. Oh, my goodness me. It doesn't get... Linda, well done. Uh, morning, ladies and crew. I've just received my nephrite wheels. They are beautiful and big. Yeah, they are big, aren't they? Yeah, thank you. You're very welcome, my lovely. They are in... And they, do you know what? That colour, we're looking at it. You know, I'm almost doing it disservice right now because we're looking at it here in the studio. When you take... When you take jade... And please be mindful as well. I've stopped myself mid-sentence. Mindful. I get Every time I talk about jade, I will have an email or a message on my Facebook page saying, oh, you can buy jade for, for, for a fiver from such and such a place. It won't be jade. It won't be type A jade. It will be more than likely a much more... It might be a gemstone, but it won't be type A jade. They even use resin sometimes, and we'll just describe it as that. I know. We certify it. This is natural type A jade. What is that price? Oh, dear. Oh, oh dear. <laughs> oh, no, no. They're <laughs> massive. Linda said it. They're big, aren't they? 50 yeah. pounds, Claire. Yeah. And, I mean, we, we'd been talking about using, um, using them with the other strand, but, I mean, you could with those because of the, the shape and the size as well and what the, what the gemstone is. I mean, you could have one, couldn't you, you know, uh, wrap loop either side and just nice. you know, we do reels of chain or even cut so if you've got existing chain. Yeah. Have one of those in the centre of a necklace. Uh, 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 yeah. The last two. This is how quickly this one's flown out the door. Oh, what? We, uh, did, we, did we miss a digit? You can get both of these. 550 carats of spinach green jade, natural, for how much, sorry? Of course, less than 200 pounds. Get that piece insured. It's a, it's a good idea. There's one left of the rounds. One left of the rounds. Um, okay, coming up straight after the break, we have some absolutely beautiful angel eye. Look at this. I mean, let's bring that over because, Claire, that's absolutely amazing. It is. It? It's lovely. Anne and Sue have done it again. Yeah. I mean, I'm sure they wouldn't mind me saying. Super simple. It's basically restranding. Um, if you love this design and you want to make this design, just stay with me because we're going to bring you those opportunities literally after the break. Um, and don't forget, 11 o'clock... Possibly a new gemstone launch in your um, in your green chalcedony and close out deal on pearls. Those mega, mega, mega pearls. The ones that have previously been on air at £999. Um, we begged and pleaded, um, begged and pleaded uh, uh, with Wayne before he went off on his jolly holidays um, to do a one time deal. We got, we got permission, so that's coming up. All the Angel Light is going on pre-order right now, so you can have a little look on the website or chat to our call centre. Everybody will get that deal of the day price tag. We'll be back after this. jewellery maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewellery Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page, Jewelry Maker. 
Happy to help. The Great British Summer. As the heat wave hits, the British public are making the most of it. Why it's still here? Here's Carol buying an ice cream from a local vendor, playing games at the fair, and frolicking about in the sun. But Carol has forgotten that Jewelry Maker celebrates Christmas in July, a chance for customers to get their supplies in ready for their Christmas designs and gifts. So Carol can take a bite of that ice cream and hello to that Christmas jumper as we present. Christmas in July. Oh, Carol, you scamp. Here at Jewelry Maker, we're always looking ways to make your shopping experience better. That's why on certain items, we've got split pay, where you can spread the cost over two, three, or four months at no extra cost to you. So you can buy your way with split pay. Jewelry Makers, this Wednesday at 10 a.m. to celebrate Christmas in July, I get to bring you a very, very special gemstone. I get to bring you Sakota Emerald. Now look, I've worked with this gemstone since about 2006, and it has always been one of the most prolific and sought after emeralds from the Bahia state in Brazil. Because originally in Brazil, up until the 1980s, the Carniba mine was the mine that everybody utilized, that everybody wanted to get their hands on. But move back 12 years, and this discovery at the Sakota mine was groundbreaking. And this Wednesday at 10 a.m., I get to bring it back for you guys for one special show, one special hour, unbelievable prices, beautiful greens, and most importantly, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to give you the finest quality that we can bring. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Stay interactive with Jewelry Maker by texting the studio during our live hours of 8 till 5. Start your message with JM Studio and send it to 78070. Jewelry Maker, create, wear, share. Here at Jewelry Maker, we're always looking ways to make your shopping experience better. That's why on certain items, we've got split pay, where you can spread the cost over two, three, or four months at no extra cost to you. So you can buy your way with split pay. Welcome back, lovely jewelry makers. Always a firm favourite. Hiya! <laughs> Hiya! I'm not saying that. Adam's was like, he went, what do you want me to say? Hey, girl, hey, girlfriend. Oh, hi, girl. Do people talk like that? Oh, do they? Okay. Hi, girl. What about the boys? Um, hi boys! <laughs> now that just sounds like I'm flirting. <laughs> Norway's a firm favourite is Angelite. Mm. Um, and we've, every day to school day, you've just learned that this is actually uh, uh, one of our I, I one of the baby gemstones. Yeah. Well, we say that, it's actually taken millions of years to form. Millions. Consider this for a second. So, Tanzanite formed 585 million years ago. 585 million years. And yet we discovered it in the 1960s. So we think we know this planet. We think we do. We're that, we're that, we're that arrogant as a, as, as a species, I suppose, to think we know the planet. But there's still it's so exciting much. exciting to think that, isn't it? Like what's we just yet not to even be. talk about the sea. Yeah. We know nothing about the sea. Yeah. 
I don't want to know about the sea. <laughs> Frightened it. Um, but yeah, this is a gemstone that took millions of years to form. And I've cherry picked a few words from different articles. This is actually again from the Gemporia Library, and these are Steve Bennett's words. Um, just a couple of paragraphs talking about angelite. Now, and he says, recently, I received a very excited phone call from a good friend of mine who was in Peru. What are you doing in Peru? I asked him. I thought he must be on holiday as there is very little uh, gem mining in the country. It turned out that one of his friends had just discovered a small deposit of a gemstone uh, and had called him for his opinion. What had been discovered was a gemstone known as angelite, which is a delicious lilac pale blue gem variety of anhydrite, a gem formed from the compression of celestite over a period of millions of years. So named for its angelic appearance, anhydrite can be found in white, grey, blue, pink and red, but only the lilac coloured variety is known as angelite. Despite the common occurrence of anhydrite, good quality specimens are extremely rare. So it is, uh, um, sorry, it is also a fairly new gemstone, having only been discovered in 1987. That's so exciting. Yeah. Mm, it is uh, amazing. Yeah. Um, angelite is a type of what we call gypsum. And we'll read some more about that moving forward. Um, meaning, and it basically means it's complete, that it's without water completely. Uh, that's, no. Here we go. Angelite, also known as anhydrite or angel stone, is a glacial blue or lilac blue stone, uh, soft stone that has a white center and snow white flecks with occasional brown or rusty inclusions. A relatively recent discovery, as we've just read, in the, in the mineral and gem world, angelite was discovered in 1987 in Peru, um, and anhydrite comes from the Greek uh, from the Greek anhydrous, meaning without water, a reference to angelite being um, a gypsum that has completely lost all hydration, becoming a stone that is without water. So this is a gemstone which you should, by the way, recommendation, never submerge water in water. In water. Um, a little bit like your opals, do avoid that because it is without water, it will almost absorb it all. So try and avoid um, submerging angelite in uh, water. Let's move on though. Because as the, with a name like Angelite, as you can imagine, it is very poignant in uh, the metaphysical world. Now, I, I, I should obviously say that this is beliefs. If this is something that you're interested, fabulous. If not, also fabulous. Angelite is thought to improve spirit, spirituality and spiritual awareness uh, with a peaceful energy that is calming and soothing. Many believe it promotes communication and self-expression while uh, dispelling fear, anger and anxiety. I think those words, firstly, you said you said the word calming. It's got mm. this wonderful ser serenity, mm. this aura, this tranquility that even if you don't go for the whole metaphysical side of things, you can't deny that it has that appearance about it. Yeah, so it's colours have the, an effect on you, don't they? Yeah. yeah that is, yeah. And you can see that angel effect. connection, yeah. can't you? Because it is almost, if we think of the heavens above, most of us will imagine this kind of blue, yeah. won't we? Um, so you can totally get why many people have those beliefs. It's also, um, astrologically speaking, uh, cro closely related to Aquarius, if you are, if that's your, uh, if that's your yeah, star. That's I really like it then, yeah. Are you Aquarius? Yeah, I am, there we yeah. Go. Um, because of its blue colour, angel eye is associated with the throat, the sh uh, third eye and the crown chakra. So lots of people use this um, in your sort of crystal healing and your chakra style jewellery. Um, but it is a gemstone um, which, again, it's just, it's almost poetic. And I, th this, I just love the words mm. and it really does describe angelite. The angelite crystal is a lullaby of light uh, and love and leaping to higher, higher consciousness. This is one of those stones that simply oozes spirituality and healing with shades of soft, as soft as angel wings or the pale dawn sky streaked with a thousand promises. Oh. The angelite stone brings its blue color, its ethereal energy and its message from the other side straight to your heart. Don't oh, that's beautiful. It's, yeah. it's stunning. Yeah. Whoever wrote that, by the way, beautiful mm. 
literally beautiful and we envisage what I'm looking at right now mm. but this is a gemstone which is absolutely adored loved in jewelry you can find it online and, and what I did learn quite quickly is it tends to be quite expensive look how look how pretty that is mm. so simple so simple it is a gemstone that you shouldn't really overcomplicate. i don't think because and that's only my personal preference because it has that soft serenity it's it's happy to be that you know not that ostentatious showy gemstone maybe like your diamonds it is that soft serene humble gem hmm. what about this piece isn't that beautiful do you see the similarities? I'm looking at the components as well. We, we've done a lot of bits like that, haven't we? Very, very similar. Yeah. I have to say I actually prefer Anne and Sue's, of course. Or maybe something like this. That's literally just on a stretchy bracelet. Mm. Big stones though they are, they're 12 mil. Well, guess what? We have 12 mil too. You have the opportunity as your deal of the day to get hold of the graduation. Now, if you want to shop ahead to guarantee your size, I would 100% uh, recommend that. Six mil already is flying out the door. Um, oh, thank goodness. We do have a bigger quantity of the six mil, but, but it will still probably sell out. Remember, we've got closeout deals on those absolutely awesome, um, awesome pearls coming up a little bit later on. I'm going to start with these statement 12 mils. I mean, look at that against the skin. Mm. I, I love that. I love, you know, this, I get it. You wouldn't be, I wouldn't personally wear them around the wrist, but around the neck, that's gorgeous, mm. Claire, isn't it? It is. I, like, look at that colour. Remember the blue, no russet tones. You don't want any of those sort of brown or reddish inclusions within. Ideally, you want your angelite to have that wonderful purity. Already people dialing through. A newcomer, a baby, comparably um, to uh, many other gemstones that are out there. We spoke, you've just spoken about nephrite jade. For thousands of years we've known that gemstone. We've known this one. For how long is it? How old are you, Adam? 34. 34 years. That's how long we've enjoyed this gemstone. It formed millions of years ago. It's newer than it's newer mm. than tanzanite. And it's got a really, really unique presence about it. Yes, it has, yeah. Many people yeah. believe that Angelite keeps you connected to your lost loved ones. It has that angelic appearance and you can see those sentiments can't you there are less than 100 available in the 12 mil so this is actually one of the most limited beautiful soft natural delicate color remember four strands of angelite whenever i bring them to air they sell out always 12 millimeter size 39.99 and for such a, it's such a uniform, isn't it? It's a, I do like that there's no, that it's not about tones, is it, in this? It's all about that, just that purity of that colour. That body colour. Yeah, yeah, it? yeah. It, it, yeah, you're right. You don't get secondary hues in this, do no, you? No, it's it about... It's all about that and it, and, and, it's, and it's enough, isn't it? It's more, you know, it's yeah. just that, that colour is, is perfect and it, like, it, it speaks to you, doesn't it? It's a, totally agree. Should we read that paragraph again? Yeah, the, it's almost like, it's like poetry, isn't it? The angelite crystal is a lullaby of light and love and leaping to higher consciousness. This is one of those stones that simply oozes spirituality and healing with shades as soft as angel wings or the palm, uh, sorry, the pale dawn sky streaked with a thousand promises. The angelite stone brings its blue color, its ethereal energy, and its message from the other side straight to your heart. Mm. I just love it. Mm. But every single one of those words rings true, doesn't it? When you look at this beautiful mm. gem. Starting with the 12 mil, we're not even stopping at 39 pounds and 99 pence. Remember, I mean, all the pearls that you have within my stash, I love angelite and pearls together. Yes, yeah. These are the perfect gurus to your markers or tops of tassels 
or knotted, simply knotted in the most amazing 12 mil statement necklace. They're huge. And I don't recall ever actually doing Angelite in 12 mil sizes before. We've got the 10, we've got the eight, we've got the six. You can shop ahead and pre-order on those as so many of you are. Immediately, immediately, um, a good percentage of the quantity is gone. Yeah. You're looking at just shy of 14 carats of angelite per solitaire, because there's approximately 25 on this strand. 14 carats of angelite. And you know, looking at that, like I, I'm like you, I don't know that I would have had that, that size of the bracelet, but I do like that design. Yeah. And it's got, it got little stars on it, hasn't it? Like the, the pearl strand yeah. that you, you know, and the, or like so we had put, earlier on. Yeah, so maybe the, the, if you've got that strand, maybe think about putting putting them together. We're at a pound a cat. No, we're less than a pound per carat. Twenty four nine. You know, remember, Ross, this has a knock on effect. I've still got the tel ten mil. I've still got the eight mil. I've still got the six mil. Look how perfectly colour matched mm, they are. They are, aren't they? Yeah. It, uh, so many of you there, maybe you're thinking about, I want to get the different sizes, maybe I, you want to mm. recreate mm. Um, Anne and Sue's amazing, uh, amazing necklace. That was your price tag, completely unplanned. But Ross says, I can see the demand. We're going to take it under £20 for you today. Yes, that does have implications on the 10, the 8 and the 6. I want to sell them all out today. This is a gemstone that absolutely does not belong in a vault, does it? This belongs to be uh, yeah, on your wrist, around your neckline. Um, and it is that wonderful conversation starter. Steve Bennett's, uh, Steve Bennett's wife, this is a firm favourite of hers. She used to love it. used to always include it in the Sarah Bennett collection, um, which Consequently, um, uh, Angelite, very similar to when she was a, she was a pop star, very similar to mm. her, uh, her, her actual stage name. Oh, is it? Angel. Ah. Angel, one of her, um, her favourites. And you can see why it's just beautiful. It's summery, it's calming, it's tranquil, it's natural, and it's going under £20. Under £20. Starting with the 12 mils, you can get the other sizes. You can actually shop ahead on those as well. Are you ready? Completely unplanned. It was not meant to go under £20, but we can see the demand. One of the things that Ross has at his fingertips, so you can literally see how many of you are there on the phone lines, on the web, etc., etc. Um, and <laughs> he has what? <laughs> well, your sex appeal at his fingertips. Of course he does. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. Look at him. <laughs> He's the most magnetic. Uh, um, but also, but also, yeah, you can gauge when you want a slightly better deal. Well, if we can deliver, that's exactly what we will do. And that's precisely the only reason why you're going, oh, we're under 10, uh, 20 pounds. Uh, maybe because then you're going to get the other sizes also. Remember though, we only had a double figure quantity of the 12 mil. They're one of the biggest sizes I think I've ever even seen in Angelite, to be truthful. Imagine one of these at the top of a, I'm just going to borrow Anne and Sue's. Imagine one 12 mil at the top mm, of yeah. one of those lovely yeah, tassels. Would, yeah. It's the perfect tassel top, isn't it? Yeah, it is. The perfect tassel top. Look how beautiful. You could be making this lovely jewellery. Look how gorgeous mm. that is. And that, that's, that is, it's about that, that graduation of size, isn't it? And that incredible just continuity of colour. No, you know, it's lovely. It's gorgeous, mm. absolutely beautiful, and, and really simple to construct as well, isn't it? So simple. Right, we're going to... we're gonna. The 8 and the 6 are flying, by the way, on pre-orders. Let's do the 10. Let's do the 10 mil. Oh, do you want to... You, Thank you. you. I wanted to... Yeah, because there is... It's a lovely, isn't it? It's a great... Yeah, you do... You it's very gravitate different. towards it, yeah. don't you? Let's do the 10 mil now. Which is a big size. It's a really, really big size. So you can still get hold of the 12 mil, but they are getting quite limited now. Let's move into the 10, which I think is the highest size that we've done of Angelite before. I don't remember ever doing 12 mils previously. 
this entire parcel, this entire parcel all has that quality of colour. And within the PowerPoint, if we can just go back to that, where it talks about the colour. Can I do that? Uh, let's have a look. There we go. Angelite, also known as anhydrite or angel stone, is a glacial blue or lilac blue colour, soft stone that has a, a white centre and snow white flecks with the occasional brown or rusty inclusions. Ideally, you don't want those inclusions. Do you see any? In fact, in fact, you know what? Look at the article that I'm reading. Look at the top of the screen. Now compare it to yours. It's a country mile better. Because mm. I can see cracks in those angel lights mm. on that article. You can see the flex very obviously. This is far superior quali uh, uh, quant uh, quality. We are not stopping at 1999, although that is exactly precisely where we should have been. Well done to all of those, uh, those of you that have got yours and confirmed. You can shop ahead on your eight, you can shop ahead on your six, and believe me, those two strands are absolutely skyrocketing out. 16 pounds and 99 pence. For the 10 mil, 250 carats. You can get Angelite from different locations around the world since its discovery over uh, in Peru. Um, it is very rare, and it's probably one of the newest gemstones, certainly up there, um, one of the newest gemstones uh, to the gem world itself. You can see that sentiment. You can see the emotions. You can see the feelings that really are attached to this gemstone. Like I said, I can't talk about thousands of years of history when it comes to Angelite. Mm. I can talk about how it's formed. But I can't talk about, you know, um, um, its use maybe with different uh, different cultures because quite literally they didn't know it existed. £16.99 only for your 10 mils. We're about to step towards your eight and your six. Be warned, they are flying out the door. Um, there is a reason for that. Um, they're very versatile. Now, of the eight that which we had 100, 42 have gone on pre-order even without knowing the price. Should we do it now? Let's do it now. Eight millimeter rounds. And if you look at Anne and Sue's Marla necklace, they start with the eight. <coughs> Excuse me, they start with the eight mil and then they step into the six mil. And Anne and Sue have found some four mil, I think. Don't know where they, yeah. But looking at it, like, like the silver, because, you know, you talk about like glacial and glacial blue, but then seeing it next to your, um, the gold of your, uh, you know, your ring, how lovely does it look with that as Looks, well? Yeah, you're it's right. A, and, you know, it's a, it's, a, it's a clever blue like that, isn't it, that it goes with both. Do you know, we haven't seen daylight yet, have we, Claire, this morning? We haven't seen, because no. you know, we get here very, very early in the morning, obviously. So, but when we come off air and obviously we open the doors to the studios and you look outside, this is how I envisage the, the, the sky mm. to look like right mm. now. It is, this is how I envisage, in, in the middle of a heat wave, this is how I picture yeah. the sky above yeah. to look. Yeah. And this is totally natural. We're bringing you the eight mil. You know we're not stopping there, don't you? You know we're not stopping there. We had, oh, we had just under 100, I beg your pardon. But remember, big quantity of these, over half the stock has already been shopped ahead and snapped up on pre-orders, I don't blame you. Nobody is paying £24.99. 60 have gone, 40 remain. It's first come, first serve. Remember the prices that we've brought you thus far. Hiya, Jill. Morning, ladies. Ooh, the angel light would look amazing with white jade and ghost onyx. Mm. Oh. Yeah, it does have that. I love that flip, idea. Yeah. I love that idea, Jill. Please make that piece of jewellery. Send it into the Wall of Fame. Mm. I'm useless at maths. 1999. What did we do then for the 10 mil? I'm trying to just do... So I can get so far... These three, just under 52 pounds. 
that's a huge carrot weight mm -hmm. of top quality angelite. If you don't want to get the larger sizes, we're bringing you right now the eight, and then we're going to step into the six. Six, we do have a bigger quantity, thank goodness. Look at that. That, that, again, that article that I was showing you, which is literally from, it's yeah. a gem specialist. That, that information that says Angelite History is a gem specialist website. Look at the quality of the Angelite that's pictured. Can you see a big whopping crack through one of yeah, them? Yeah, yeah. Yeah? Because you remember, it's quite a dry gemstone, so it can, uh, um, you know, we should expect there to be ti uh, tiny little flecks. Look at the quality that you're getting from us. It's an incredible glow, isn't it? It's, it really is. Magical. Yeah, it is. Ethereal. Yes, yeah. yeah. Ethereal, 14 pounds and 99 pence. I totally understand why many people believe that this has got spiritual connections. Yeah, many people believe it. that metaphysical connections. Um, and you know what? Even if that isn't your bag, I think most of you can go, yeah, I get it. Mm. I, get, I get why. I get why. Even if you don't believe in it, you, you probably understand why they yeah. would feel yeah. that way. There are less than 20 remaining in the 8 mil. In the 6 mil, I had 300. Do you want to know how many have gone? 97 on pre-order. What is it about a 6 mil, Claire? It's a, it's a great size, isn't it? It's a size that, you know, you just... You either can use it on its own or you can group it together. Um, it can either look very, very delicate or it, it still has impact, doesn't it? It's just a good, it's a good size. I need to turn this round, actually, because they're not six mils. One sec. Sorry, that's my bad. I'll do this. Let's do it that way. Because... That's six mil. They are so wearable, aren't mm. they? Yeah. Yeah, they are. So, so, oh, the colour. It's literally textbook. Better than textbook, as we've yes. discussed. Yes, it is, isn't it? Yeah. That colour is totally and utterly natural. We have 300 of these available. 101 have gone already on your web, uh, on, on pre-order. Um, they're going to sell out. You can do so much with it. You can literally knot it, stretchy bracelets, beady beads, loom. Yeah, beady beads would be really nice. Or just, you know, you have that. And, and then maybe if, you've got, um, maybe if you've got a particular pearl that you really like, you know, and you have that, you could rosary link as well, couldn't you? Oh, it's nice gorgeous. sterling silver wire. It's, it's stunning. It's, it's just stunning. That's mm, the, you yeah. know, we've got so many different descriptions of gemstones, haven't we? You know, you look at pearls and you think, oh, timeless. You like look at, uh, I don't know, diamonds and they're, you know, sort of, I don't know, there's different, certain gems are pretty, certain gemstones are feminine. This is stunning, isn't mm. it? It is absolutely stunning. The blue is just going to match every single skin tone. Um, you can see those wonderful, soft, calming light beliefs attached to the gemstone. We're going to do it in one price crash because quite literally it may well sell out if, if, if we hesitate. The phone lines have gone nuts. All 300. If you want to multi-buy, you absolutely can. Natural Angelite, only discovered in 1987. What's that? Goodness me, that's low. That's so low, $12.99. Mm -hmm. And I always get this as well. Ah, oh, you know what the price is going to be. And you know, sometimes I love people message us saying, ah, oh, because you prepped for the show. Yes, I do. But can you just confirm, Claire, that that is not what it says on my sheet? No, it's, it's not. It's not what it says on my sheet. No. We took the first round lower. Which means it tends to have, which well, doesn't have to, but it's had a knock-on effect. We almost think, all oh, right, they've all got to go lower than now. Half the stock has gone. Shall we? Have we ever done Angelite under ten pounds before? Have we? Well, we don't see it very often, so I doubt it very much. No. It's not. It's not a stone that you see every. You know. Certainly don't see it every week, do you? No. Are we gonna take are we gonna should we take it under ten pounds? Let's do it. Six mil rounds. 
We're going to give you 60 seconds to get yourself warmed up, ready to pounce on your angel out because they will and they are absolutely flying out. The, the phone lines, I've already got a triple row of names. We've already got people looking at quantities, twos, threes, fours. I don't blame you. I don't blame you at all. Makers bought three. Anne's bought four. Aberdeenshire's bought two. Hereford, uh, sorry, Hertfordshire's bought four. Hampshire's bought two. Devon's just got two. You see how quickly this quantity flies out the door. Carol, you've just got two. Pauline's got two. Worcestershire, you've got two. Monmouthshire, you've got two. Hello to you, Debs. Um, got mine. Uh, my second daughter was born in 1987. Oh, so a perfect present for her. Aww. Debs. Ah, it's a perfect gemstone. That is. That's a really nice idea. Ah. Oh. Director Adam saying all the best people were born in 1987, by the way. <laughs> Assuming that's when he was born. No, I beg to, give, to differ. Beg to differ. No, no, sorry, Debs. No, your daughter probably is the best. <laughs> just not Adam. <laughs> <laughs> Literally just get myself out of that hole. One second. <laughs> out of that hole. Uh... <laughs> check out, check out, check out. There was literally 300 of these. Look at the call screens. You've gone nuts for it. Yeah, everyone loves it, don't they? Of course, we I'm know scared. it. I'm just going to have a look at this because I was thinking with some spaces you've got. Oh, they jump rings. See, something like that, that's where that size comes in beautifully. Where are you off to? I was just got, wanted to get this because you could just pop in, couldn't you? Oh, this is on pre-order and it's also going to a close-out deal, Claire. They're and just popping those, in, you know, in between. Or, uh, you know, we're talking about the sizes, just one on, on a hoop mm, as well. Lovely. You know, that you'd still get all that impact. But yeah, just, just a, maybe a stretchy bracelet and you could just pop your... Pop your lovely um, spacer jump rings in between. That would look really nice. That are coming up. That mm. are coming up. Yeah. There's a closeout deal that you can also pre-order. I haven't shown those earrings that I was wearing just a few moments ago. I mean, these are very fabulous, aren't they? Very, very fabulous. They're actually bangles that um, Anne and Sue have actually customised into mega hoops. Mega hoops. Look at those. They're amazing, aren't they? And they're definitely head turners, and that's using a couple of the graduations, maybe something just a little bit more subtle. You've got those. They're lovely. They're lovely. Uh, $9.99 only for the 6 mil. It is always... Can we show the call screen? It is always, always one of your favourite gemstones. Um, mm. Look at the volumes of names. And I've got people yeah. with sixes in their basket. Um, fours, oh, eight. Stephen's just got eight. Well done to you. Sandra, you've got two. Pamela, you've got two. Hertfordshire's got four. Glamorgan's got two. London's got... Two. It, 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 it's guaranteed to be a sellout. Guaranteed to be an on-screen sellout. And you literally fall off the bottom of the screens as well. Um, how many have we got? Stock update? Oh, morning, Bernadette. Hello, Bernadette. We're 85. 85 of these are left. And we're massively over allocated. Now, if you're, can you see that line on the right hand side of the screen? If you see your name on that side of the, uh, of the screen, you need to make me to check them out. Um, because 87 and you are one of those people that ha hasn't made the confirmations yet, it'll be allocated on a first come, first serve basis. Um, oh, she has lots luck. of multi bidders, aren't there? On yeah, the there's four, a maker six, wanting six, yeah. Barbara wants four. If it's sat in your basket, it's not guaranteed, mm. uh, guaranteed to you. Um, amazing, amazing, amazing. Now, I have one more angel light opportunity to bring you. Because not only can you mix with the different sizes, you can work with different shapes. Mm. I didn't know, did I know? I don't remember. Did I know? I don't know if I did. What? What did? What? <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember doing angel light and satellites. Did you know? No, it's usually rounds, isn't it? Did you know? I don't. Will you consider? Angelite is a tricky stone to cut. So to then cut it into a satellite bead, I don't know, that's why I questioned it. I'm not, I might be wrong, I might be wrong, but I don't remember doing angelite in satellite beads. Because it's nice to see it like that, that faceting, isn't it? It gives it a, a slight, you know, a, a slightly different look compared to the, the plain rounds. It's absolutely beautiful, isn't it? 
Because the, the faceting then, the way that catches the light, that does give you like a different tone almost, doesn't it? Because you've got, you've got the flashes of the light coming off the facets. Just to show you the consistency of quality as well. Mm. Put the entire parcel together for the quality of that angel light. Beautiful. How many do I have of these? 60 available. We're going to do it in one price crash. I don't remember ever doing or bringing angelite in satellite beads. They are stunning, aren't they? I have to say, this is driving my OCD absolutely nuts. <laughs> <laughs> this. Do, you, do you need to restrand it? <laughs> oh, that's, that's driving me nuts. <laughs> but don't worry. <laughs> Studio sample. Are you all right? <laughs> I'm just literally <laughs> quivering under the desk. Nine ninety nine. Nine. You like stuff like that? It drives me crazy. Oh, Adam. It drives me absolutely crazy. I couldn't put up with that. I couldn't put up with that. That would literally. Be, I'd have to. If that. If that arrived at my doorstep, delighted with the angel light, but it would be destranded yes, immediately. Yeah. Immediately. Under ten pounds only for your beautiful angel light. I know. I get it. I get it. Life is too short and all of that. My husband rolls his eyes at me all the time, but that drives me nuts. Elaine, Virginia. Hello to you, Derbyshire, Hertfordshire, Lincolnshire, Yvette, Joyce, Cheryl. Uh, it's like wonky oh, towels. Lovely. It's like wonky, wonky towels. I hate wonky towels. Oh, uh, I'll wait till the girls get older then. Oh, I get it now. Wonky towels on the towel rail. Yeah, drives me crazy. Uh, Joyce, Cheryl, Louise, hello to you. Virginia, Hertfordshire, Susan, loads of multipliers. We only had 60. I've got one more angelite to squeeze in this amazing showcase. <gasps> oh, my gosh. You're going to love this, aren't you? Oh my gosh. Ooh. <gasps> the biggest carrot weight of angelite that we've had all day. Individ they are whoppers. There are 70 of these available. Oh, look, Claire. Yes. Are you thinking? Yeah, I'm thinking we've got gallery war at the, at the weekend, haven't we? That's, these are. <gasps> They're massive. Oh, that's amazing. All completely and utterly natural. Look at the that's quality so of the size unusual, of those. so unusual, isn't it? So, so unusual. Perfectly smooth quality. Remember, it's that beautiful, very distinctive blue, less white flakes. I mean, you will see that patterning within, of course. It's totally natural. It's the last of our angelites. Always one of our favourite gemstones. It's a little, it, you know, it's a, it, it's a baby in the gemstone world. 1987, discovered in Peru. The biggest carrot weight that we have across the entire strand. You don't have to, whilst these are drilled, you don't have to use that drill hole, do you? No, no. That's what I mean. So you, you could use, I mean, maybe beading techniques as well, um, your gallery wire, wire work, prong set them, bezel set them. I can also see, so have you ever seen, you know, on like, like so larger, where you've got a big surface area like that, um, gem, where people paint onto gemstones, so they might paint little scenes. Um, I'm seeing, you know, like angel wings and, and, and things like that on those, because, you, you know, if you've got a very, very fine paintbrush, you do some beautiful... Um, what about beautiful with your Dremel? On there. Uh, in, yeah, engraving them. Your Dremel tool. Yeah. Your, your, your I bet, yes, you I bet that would be really good. But because this is a slightly softer stone. Yeah. You might be able to, using that new tool that we've yeah. got, 399. Yeah. Have a go. Have, how amazing would that be? Do you That'd like be a really, guardian yeah. angel? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Masterclass, 39.99. Should we take it under 20 pounds? We only, we only had 70. And it's that blank canvas, isn't it? Mm. It's that perfect. You could put names in there. I don't. I don't know. Little clouds. You, you know, cloud oh, might be a, quite a I nice. Um, you know, if you're going to do that engraving. Some people you do realise might be looking at screen saying, "Goodness me, you can't drill angelite. It's perfect as it is." And I would agree. It is beautiful as it is. It's just we're yeah. always thinking outside the box, aren't we, Claire? Yeah, and uh, you know, there's not there's not rules, is there? What one person thinks is it's each white, to white two. Should we take it under twenty? Let's do it. Love, love, love these. 
I almost need to pass this to you, Claire, for Saturday. Mm. Is it Saturday or Sunday? Saturday, I think. I think I'm Saturday. Amazing. Yes. That's a, I've, never, I've never seen that. It's wonderful. No, they're, they're huge. Uh, we had slider bracelets earlier on. You could literally just put the one on mm. there. And mm. you can do a little poetic story to go alongside it. Nice. Should we read it again? Shall we? Or it could be the tops of tassels. Remember, yeah. it's just an alternative to your, um, to, uh, to your rounds. Because um, I just think, I don't know, steal these words if you like not my words they're not this is off another website but i'm just i appreciate how how beautifully poetic it is the angel like crystal is a lullaby of light and love and leaping to higher consciousness this is one of those stones that simply oozes spirituality and healing with shades as soft as angel wings or the pale dawn sky streaked with a thousand promises the angelite stone brings its blue color its ethereal energy and its messages from the other side straight to your heart i love that mm. it's just beautiful isn't it a lullaby of, of light and love. Nice. It's messages from the other side straight to your heart. Mm. I love it. It's so gorgeous. Mm. So, I don't know, you could, You might be thinking about, I don't, I, not just this, but bereavement jewellery. It's a really yeah. nice idea. Yeah. yeah. Um, or uh, maybe you're thinking yourself, if you uh, with somebody that may be in the heavens above, you know, many people believe this keeps you connected because it has that wonderful angelic-like appearance. Anyway, fourteen pounds and ninety-nine pence only. There were only seventy of these, and these are big-sized stones. Um, remember, we still have got an amazing closeout deal to bring you on pearls, and these are arguably one of the best strands that we've ever brought here at Jewelry Maker. Where have, you where have you found this? You're loving Angelite so much today, and you always do. We've managed to find one more strand. Literally run to the vault, managed to make this possible during, since, since the deal of the day began and now. Oh gosh! If you make those little angel like guardian angel, this is this is uh, wings or the other bodies. This is the like this is the perfect shape, isn't it? Oh, even in soft focus, Claire. Look at that. Yeah. That's, that's, oh gosh. Each one is more and more beautiful, isn't it? Yeah. It's such a good shape. Yeah. Look how gorgeously they look. They they all go together. Look at the quality of the blue that you're getting. It is the finale of your angel light now. I know I said that adjust, but we found another strand for you. Even though these are larger sizes, there's no rhyme or reason other than the fact that we can see you're loving it. Shall we take this under ten pounds? For the look at the carrot weight, two hundred and thirty carats of your pears, but they could. I like the idea. Drops, wings. Yeah. Because those those you know angels are so um, so popular, aren't they? You can you can either create you know maybe just have one with pearl or shell pearl above it as as, as the head. You make your own wings. It just works with yeah. pearls, doesn't it? Yeah. Angelite and pearls together, I just think are heavenly. Absolutely heavenly together. They do. They We're going to take yeah, it under ten good. pounds. Have I got enough of these to go around? No, that's the thing. No, what, what's the quantity? 85. No, then. Um, you've seen sellouts already throughout the course of this morning's show. Angelite is always one of those massive in demands. Uh, straight away, I I've said it verbally now, we have to honour it. It's going under £10. Liz, Jean, Anne, uh, Diane, Gloucestershire, Christine, Yvette, Derbyshire. You've done it. Sit back and enjoy. How beautifully does this go with, with, with pearls? Mm. It's stunning, it's like, isn't it? Like clouds in the sky. Hello, Florida. Hello, Pennsylvania. Hello, Sandra, Linda, Sheila, Beverly, Teresa, Marie, and Susan, Powis, Carol, Janice, all around the UK, all around the world mm. getting involved, which is quite wonderful. Lovely to have your company this evening, this morning, whatever time of day it is with you. Um, we're all wilting over here in the UK, aren't we? It's the hottest day uh, of the year. But I tell you what, it's cool inside. Glacial blues of angel light. Mm. 
9.99. I don't want to separate them, although I know no, I should. They do look lovely. They look amazing, mm. don't they? Look absolutely amazing together. So if you've got pearls within your stash, a very welcome addition. Remember, there's still so much more to bring you in today's show. You've got absolutely awesome star buys coming up with Claire um, and your lovely signet rings, which I'm very excited about. Yes. We might well have a new gemstone launch. I know you've bought, we've brought you different varieties of chalcedony, but not quite like the ones that you are about to see. You've got your massive closeout deal, manager special deal on some, one of the finest strands of pearls that we've ever brought to air. So there's still so much to see. But right now, make sure you check out your bar Baskets. Angelite, we'll quickly do a recap on what this gemstone uh, actually is because I'm very aware that people will uh, tune in on a regular basis. So this is a gemstone that was discovered in Peru in 1987. Uh, also known as anhydrite or angel stone. It's a glacial blue or lilac blue colored soft stone uh, that has a white center and snow white flecks with occasional brown or rusty inclusions. Ideally, you don't want those, uh, mm. those rusty mm. inclusions. A relatively recently, uh, recent discovered uh, in the mineral and gem world, angelite was discovered in 1987 in Peru. The name anhydrite comes from the Greek anhydrus, meaning without water, a reference to angelite being a gypsum um, that has completely lost all hydration, becoming a stone that is without water. Well done, every single one of you. Absolutely amazing. Congratulations um, on your angelite. This also, like a, that was like a showcase. It was beautiful. Yeah, it was. Really what a light. Beautiful. Let's just redo it. Look yeah. at this. How beautiful is that? You always go crazy for angelite. It is, it's, it, 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 it's a massive, massive favourite. Um, of all of ours, I think. Uh, you know, have a little look back on the website, see if any of those are still available. Really compliments gemstones like pearls, mm. kunzite yesterday. Mm. Really lovely. Now, coming up after the break, we have the closeout deal. Let me give you a sneaky peek because those of you that maybe have been looking for the most perfect pearl opportunity, then I believe I might have it for you here. Now, this is closed on our screens in the past for £999. Today, we have special permission to take this to a manager's special closeout deal. Of course, they are limited. These are totally and utterly natural. But as I said a few moments ago, this is also one of the mm. best pearl strands that we have ever brought to air. Look at that. Oh, gosh. There are 15 of these available. <gasps> Never been lower than £999. Today, uh, we're going to make history. Make sure you're with me. Imagine that knotted. Imagine that with... This is why I've, I'm on my soapbox at the moment for needing 18 karat gold. Mm. That, because that quality. Um, it's coming up. 15 collectors will get hold of this. A manager special saving. We've also got Edison Pearls to bring you. And we've got the launch of your beautiful apple green chalcedony. Plus then Claire's amazing masterclass. Don't go anywhere. Lovely jewellery makers will be back after this. <laughs> jewellery maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. 
If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Jewelry Maker presents the Great British Summer. As the heat wave hits, the British public are making the most of it while it's still here. Here's Carol, buying an ice cream from a local vendor playing games at the fair and frolicking about in the sun. But Carol has forgotten that Jewelry Maker celebrates Christmas in July, a chance for customers to get their supplies in ready for their Christmas designs and gifts. So Carol can take a bite of that ice cream and hello to that Christmas jumper as we present Christmas in July. Oh, Carol, you scamp. Here at Jewelry Maker, we're always looking ways to make your shopping experience better. That's why on certain items, we've got split pay, where you can spread the cost over two, three or four months at no extra cost to you. So you can buy your way with split pay. Jewelry Makers, this Wednesday at 10 a.m. to celebrate Christmas in July, I get to bring you a very, very special gemstone. I get to bring you Sakota Emerald. Now look, I've worked with this gemstone since about 2006 and it has always been one of the most prolific and sought after emeralds from the Bahia state in Brazil. Because originally in Brazil, up until the 1980s, the Carniba mine was the mine that everybody utilized, that everybody wanted to get their hands on. But move back 12 years and this discovery at the Sakota mine was groundbreaking. And this Wednesday at 10 a.m., I get to bring it back for you guys for one special show, one special hour, unbelievable prices, beautiful greens, and most importantly, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to give you the finest quality that we can bring. show it's been so far mm, it has isn't it really beautiful the lineup of gemstones mm. are literally ah oh, second to none and we're still not done we still have what an hour and 40 minutes remaining to bring you some more incredible deals including what could potentially i don't ever remember seeing calcedony like this before there's lots of different varieties of calcedony of course Let's say maybe a tentative variety launch. This is apple green chalcedony. It's stunning, isn't it? Look, it's okay. beautiful. I'm really drawn to, I love that Which one. one? This one here. Yeah, it's amazing. Absolutely love I'm it. I'm drawn to this one. Yeah. Oh, they're pretty, yes, aren't they? Yeah. All natural. Naturally occurring. They are like layers of the earth. Look at this one here. Chalcedony in its natural form. All coming up in, um, a, let's say, a variety launch, shall we? Because I don't, I, look at that. I mean, Gosh, they yes, are and just they, amazing. Yeah, they, yeah. They're absolutely amazing. So imagine these with things like your angelite, with your jadeite. Mm. Beautiful. You can see the whole quantity of the showcase here. It's, a, it's basically across five strands. Five strands. You've got your, oh, look at that one. Is that the one you would admire? That is lovely as well, isn't it? Yeah. 
all coming up. This is the entire quantity of the parcel that we have for you, from your rounds to sort of more irregular shapes, to your top drill drops, to your smooth uh, rondelles, um, to again, another sort of irregular tumblers. The, uh, these are all coming up in the um, within this hour, actually. We'll do it within this hour at some point. Now, right now, though, we will, uh, like any jewellery house, if you went to, uh, um, I don't know, let's say, let's say uh, the jewellery quarter up the road. If you walked to the jewellery quarter and walked in any of those, uh, those jewellers and said, I want to buy, I want to buy a diamond and I want to pay a tenner. Whether they've got it in stock or not, they could get you one. They could get you one for £10. Wouldn't be of the best quality, of course, but you can, you can buy a diamond for a tenner. If you went into one of those jewellers and you said, I want to buy a diamond for 10 million, you could get a diamond for 10 million. Obviously, there are different degrees of quality and also massive dis degrees in rarity. So just to bring it back to what we're talking about right now, this is that that degree of rarity and quality. This is one of the five, this is, in my, in my opinion, one of two of the best pearl opportunities that we've ever brought here at Jewelry Maker, ever, 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 ever. We can bring you beautiful pearls for a 10 pound, 15 pounds, 20 pounds. We can do that and they're beautiful pearls. But this is that pinnacle grade. What makes this so exciting is that everything that you see on your screens right now is completely natural. These are what are being referred to within the industry as the impossible pearl. And for those of you that maybe do, are thinking, okay, why? Why are they impossible? Uh, they're called the, the impossible pearl. Firstly, look at, the, look at the five virtues. The five virtues of pearls like the four C's to your diamonds, and they talk about size. Well, these are absolutely ginormous. Anything over 10 millimetres is like the equivalent one carat diamond. And you've got an entire strand. Then they start talking about colour. Now, never mind bleached and dyed pearls. These are naturally coloured. Then we start talking about the nacre. Whether it's smooth, whether it has beautiful ripples, they're massively embraced these days. It's all about things like fireball and baroque pearls. You've got those gentle ripple formations. Then we start talking about shape. I look at these and I think they are, I wouldn't call them perfect rounds, but they're definitely near. And the last but by no means least is the most important of all your virtues, and that is luster. How reflective, how mirror-like. Look at the pearls. I don't think I've seen any. I mean, they you're always wowed coated, by it, but this, they? yeah, this, yeah. They look coated. Look as they edge round. It looks like literally precious metal. Yes, yeah. As they edge it round does. on the yeah. recording, they look like they're some kind of 18 karat gold mm. spheres. Look here. How amazing is that? But I want to add a virtue to the five virtues if I can. Because one thing that should be mentioned is metallic. Remember this stat, lots of you know it already. I say it almost all the time when I see a strand of this grade. From a harvest of 10,000 cultured pearls, less than 10 will be naturally metallic. And you've got an entire strand. So you're talking, I don't know, 20, 30,000 pearls have been harvested to get that one strand without considering the rarity of the color, without considering the rarity of the size and the shape. But let's talk about the impossible pearl some more. Pearls can be uh, cultivated in not just your, your oyster shells or um, like the gold lip oyster or, or, or the black lip oyster that does your Tahitian. They can be cultured in many different uh, uh, species. This is a clamshell that just so happens to have hidden away a very rare purple pearl. It was found completely, com just an everyday clam, found a little purple pearl. But one reason why I show you this photograph, and I'll be honest, it's not the, nice, it's not the most pleasant picture, is it? But a pearl will form in the muscle, if you like, of the, of the clam in this case. 
normally, and that's why you get that whitish colour. But from a rare anomaly of nature, for whatever reason, this, this mollusk has managed to push the pearl to the circumference. Now, where's the colour on this mollusk? It's on the circumference, and that's why it has tra transformed to that beautiful purple colour. It's not dye. It's not bleach. That's why they're called the impossible pearl, because it is rare for that. It, you think how close that was to rolling out. How close that was not a pearl in a shell. Yeah. It was on the point of being expelled, wasn't it? With all of that beautiful colour. And this is getting the limelight everywhere. The GIA are writing about it. The T Tucson are writing about it. All the biggest designers want naturally coloured pearls. And we went to our supplier and said coloured pearls, natural coloured pearls. We want some more of these. Our customers absolutely love them. And quite simply, the, these were their words. Now, yes, that's a papaya. It doesn't matter whether it's papaya, purple, pink, whichever. Um, it's all about the natural colour. To replace pearls like this, and this is their email, by the way, uh, to replace pearls like this in the current climate isn't impossible, but it is very expensive. Strands of this grade are likely to retail for around 10,000 US dollars today. Today, strands. Next year, you could be looking at double that with the way the farms have been affected, and that's obviously talking about pandemic. There isn't many strands right now in the world, and it is, as it is more valuable to sell these as, uh, as singles at this size. We won't be able to offer anything like this for maybe five years, and even then, it wouldn't be financially viable. In a roundabout way, don't you think that's our supplier saying... Um, no, you might not be able to afford it or no, I'm not selling them to you because I'll make more money selling them individually. Um, this is obviously prior to Hong Kong being announced that it was not operating. We are taking these to Hong Kong, not just for the Asian market. There is a huge demand from the West after the biggest jewelry house in New York started buying these two. Everybody wants these, and by these they're talking natural, uh, natural pearls. Um, they, uh, at this present moment, it was from one pearl source, and they uh, can't provide them. This lot is finer than any I've seen on the market for size, symmetry, and shape. Yeah, I mean, absolutely. But it is all about colour. Whether they're fireball, whether they're baroque, whether they're round, colour is what is in the limelight. Don't have to take my word for it. Have a little look. This is at Tucson. This is a special invite show. I didn't go. I didn't get that invite, but Jake and, uh, and Dave did. Um, and you've got some really historical pieces of jewellery that were literally guarded. Um, so, for example, the red necklace, that's coral. That was Sophia Lorenz. But look at number nine. That is naturally coloured pearls. Not as metallic, I have to say, as what you're, you're, you're going to get the opportunity for. They're showcasing natural coloured pearls, and it says it here. That pearl necklace, cultured Chinese freshwater pearls from the Rainbow Collection. There we go. 2019, natural colours. It's not just me, as I said. It's not just in Tucson. That's a piece that was sold at Tucson. Here is the GIA themselves writing about natural coloured pearls. And you can see their large signs they talk about. Pearls immediately drew to our attention. Talked about the province of the location. Over a period of three and a half years to form pearls of this scale. Look at the, look at the, the, They start, though, talking about how strong pinkish purple near round pearls. It's all about that colour. Here is, closer to home, one of the most luxurious and highly uh, respected pearl traders here in the UK. This is Yoko of London, and they do a very limited collection of natural freshwater pearls. This is the Novus necklace, price on application. Now, if you want to know what that price is, it's £22,500. The value is not in the gold. The value is in the pearls. 
So now all of a sudden we realize that even if I was to hold this amazing opportunity at 999, which is where it's closed previously, that would be amazing, wouldn't it? What about just a couple, maybe in a pair of earrings? 8,000 pounds, 8,000 pounds. So, uh, and what I always think when looking at these, what takes the center stage? Is it the sapphires and the diamonds or is it the pearls? It's the pearls. The sapphires and the diamonds go at the back of the earlobe. That speaks volumes, doesn't mm. it? Eight grand, mm. eight grand for two pearls. That's why our supplier was saying it's no long longer financially viable for me to bring you strands like this. I'm better off selling them individually. Mm. I've got 15 available and they are coming to you at a closeout deal. These have been on our, on our screens for 999 pounds and they have never been any lower. But today, that's precisely what we have permission to do. Launch with Dave, 999 pounds. Imagine this, I'll say it again, and I really must get off this soapbox. This is why I advocate that we should have 18 karat gold clasps. Because yeah, it warrants Claire, it, doesn't it? Yeah, Absolutely. yeah to yeah. be honest, yeah. I, there's nothing wrong with silver. There really isn't. There really isn't. But if you're looking for, from a valuation perspective, if you were to take this to be valued, you are undervaluing it, putting it with silver. Does that make sense? Mm the quality and all the thousands of pearls that I've brought to air over the years, this is the, within the top two that I've ever seen. Would you agree, guys? Without a doubt. Would you agree, Claire? Yeah, yeah. It's, it, again, it, it's in the same way with the, the, the Bangor, it's memorable, isn't it? The memorable yeah. strand uh -uh. really stops you in your tracks. I've started buying pearls from more, you know, the naturally coloured pearls from Jewelry Maker. And if you're wondering, well, when are you actually going to show us the, you know, I intend to get them valued and I intend to sell them. Listen, it's difficult times at the moment, isn't it? But at the moment, I'm still looking, I'm trying mm. to source the 18 karat gold mm. class. That's yeah. what's, that's what's yeah. causing the delay. This is the kind of thing that I would literally not, with an 18 karat gold clasp, and I would literally walk down to Hatton Garden, especially when I say we have permission today to bring this to you at a closeout manager's special deal. We would never reduce the price on this without asking. No. It's, it, 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 it's, we're not just talking about 10 or 20% here, 50 pounds even. We're talking about a big hundreds, a triple figure Gosh. saving. There are 15 of these available. Rainbow overtones, well done, well done, well done. You're not just, see why we should have metallic? Every single one of those are metallic in that color. When we say rainbow, what's better than a pearl, a, a, a beautiful pearl? It's a pearl with multiple colors of overtones. You've got there, um, you've got purples, you've got pinks, you've got papayas, you've mm. got pistachios, you've got them all in each of these. Imagine the rarity. Remember three to five years to form one of these. And even then it's not a guarantee that you are going to get that level of quality. Now consider how rare it is to get that entire, entire strand and for them to complement one another. Yes, now can smart. we appreciate yeah, yeah. why they are, strands like this are referred to as the impossible pearl. We have never taken this opportunity lower than what we're about to show you. £999, £250 on split pay, 0% interest over four months. That's, uh, that's incredible. This is, this is legacy. This, is, this, this surpasses Yoko of London's pearl necklace. Mm. Because go, but if you look at that photograph, look at, t fully take this in. Fully take in these rainbow colours. Now make a comparison. Yeah, it's beautiful. That's beautiful. Purple, pink, 31 of them on a strand. 
Sell them individually, you're going to make a massive profit. That's why what, what our supplier is saying. But would you agree, it for, in my eyes, it surpasses the Yoko of London one because they don't have multiple colours. Yeah, they don't have I, yeah. the metallic beauty. It's, and it's in the interest, isn't it, as well? Like, that is, that is to me, yeah, it's beautiful. It's classic. I, I, I don't know, with the, these ones, is a, it, it's something holds you more, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. it's, it's something very, very, very different. It's like a magical strand. Of all, of all the pearls we've ever done, we've just taken two hundred pounds off that amazing price tag. Two hundred pounds. Re the reality is, you could, if you were to walk, if you were to finish this, complete it, put knots, and then a high-end clasp on there. I don't think it's un unrealistic. To, 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 to see, I don't know, the £8,000 price tag. That's not unrealistic at all. That's the, that's the reason why I'm purchasing this stones, because I, want, I can see profit in it. Absolutely. £799, a £200 saving. Can we replace this opportunity? Well, unlikely, they say. The impossible pills, they, they say. We might be able to do it, but it's no longer financially viable for our suppliers to offer us rand. But that's still not even your price tag. Do we take all that information and go, oh, okay, well, perhaps we should up the price then. Maybe that's what we should do. It would make logical sense. I totally get that. It would make sense, but that's not what we're about. We've got 15 opportunities. We are more about the whole ethos of this, uh, of Gemporia, was about getting that level of luxury into the homes of our wonderful viewers. Please, though, can you make me a promise? If you get this home, please, will you have it valued? Even if you don't complete it, even if you don't attach a class, comes with the box as well. Take this to a highly skilled... A, a, a luxury jewelers, not just the high street jewelers. No disrespect to them; they don't realise the uh, you know, the value of what you're, what you've just got right now. That's not your price. It's closed on our screens at nine hundred and ninety-nine. If you value my personal recommendation, you'd just be dialing super quick. There's thirty-one. Perfect, natural rainbow overtone metallic pearls being delivered to you literally like so literally like so get this home have it valued why do i say have it valued not just for your own ego it's not evaluation is great for the ego it is great for the ego but it's also important for your insurance that's why you have it valued, really. That's the reality, because we, we know we're not going to be able to replace it, even if we were to stop at 999. We can't replace these opportunities anymore. £649 or £162.25 on your split pay. I've sold pearls back when I was in my 20s, far inferior, still beautiful, far inferior um, than, uh, the, the, than what you're getting today. And they had that five figure price tag. These are absolutely oh ginormous. And they sing against the skin. Thank you to those of you reminding me to hold them up to the neckline. Look at the quality that you're getting. Look at how proud they stand against the decolletage. Full of those rainbow colours. £649 was a special manager's special deal. This is exactly the same strand, by the way, just under differing lighting conditions. That's uh, because I, I can see the difference on your screens as well right now. Um, it's just here in the studio. If you look above me, there's floodlights, literally floodlights. If you go into any luxury jewellers, they don't have floodlights. They have really beautiful, twinkly, little delicate lights mm. that showcase and complement the gemstones. Um, yeah, so this is the reality of what you're seeing. Oh, my goodness. Ross, you know, you, 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 I know the conversation that we had with Wayne. Are you absolutely sure? Are 
I thought we were stopping here. There are seven left in the vault. That's, yeah. Janet, I can see you there. If you've longed for this. Today. Oh, my goodness me. That's amazing. Oh, I've only just bought some pearls as well. And now I want to buy another strand of pearls. I really do. Because this is, oh, I'm going to say it. I'm going to say it out loud. If you want this to be half price, this is irreplaceable at this opportunity. That's why I say get it valued because you should be insuring it. Don't tell to your insurer that this is the price that you paid because they are legally obligated to value it for that amount. <clears throat> That's not the value. The value, you might as well add zeros to the end of that number. If you want this at half price, I'm going to give you 60 seconds. Never been lower than a thousand pounds, 999. Today, you will get this for half that price, but there are seven available in the world. One, it, I, I've, worked, I've worked with pearls. It was actually one of my, uh, one of my roles when I was in the, uh, in the jewelers. I looked after the pearl cabinet. Um, this surpasses all of that quality, all of those strands. It does. And, uh, and I've sold pearl necklaces to certain footballers. I've, I've had pearls looked after pearls that are literally five figured amounts it used to fill me with dread doing that and, <laughs> and I didn't and none of them none of them equated to what we're looking at right now in terms of the beauty and the rarity none of them There's we nothing are like those no. is there nothing like them these are the well, like one of two my two of my favorite strands one I bought that was 799 pounds I haven't done anything with it yet and this this mm. is my top two. Those mm. are my top two strands that I can think of. Most memorable pearl strands ever. Mm. Today, and only today, we have half that price tag. I get that that is still a considered purchase, but not comparable to what you're getting home today. Use your split pay, £124.75. Again, get it valued. The reason why I say get it valued, not just to give yourself a gigantic pat on the back. Don't mention 499 to that valuer, remember. They don't need to know that information. Um, as soon as you divulge it, they're legally obligated to value it for that. Um, but you get it valued for your insurance purposes because we know that we cannot we can't replace a strand like this at 499 mm. pounds you heard it from the, our suppliers literally that's their words that she copy and pasted into um into a powerpoint joan good luck samantha good luck cumbria good luck county atrium good luck somerset good luck i can see you all there use your 30-day money back guarantee get this home fall in love with these pearls which i know you will it's just a look at the colors claire mm. it is it's absolutely mesmerizing orange orange pearls it's stunningly beautiful it's, it's, it, like you say it's that luster isn't it it looks like it looks like it's gold on it if everybody it does look like a, like a, like a 24 karat mm. gold now yeah if if four of you check out a further seven people will miss out if this yeah, yeah. If this if this is something that you've always longed and dreamt, uh, and dreamt about, th th it's today. It has to be today because they're not going to hang around. At, at, at four hundred ninety nine, that's half the original price from what was nine hundred ninety nine, and that's still a mega deal. It's never been any lower than that. We could have taken a hundred pounds, and that would still be mega. R remember, go back, go back to the words of our, of our supplier. To re replace pills like this in the current climate isn't impossible, but it is very expensive. Strands of this grade are likely to retail for around 10,000 US dollars today. What do you think it's going to be tomorrow or in a year? The final one. <coughs> Excuse me. Well done, London. Well done to you, Surrey. Well done to you, new customer. Well done to you, West Midlands. Well done to you, Lanarkshire. Well done to you, Belfast. Um, well done to you, Yorkshire. I can see you there as well. I've still got so many. I don't want to say your names just in case. It's uh... <coughs> go on. Can I have a look? Is that? Of course Thank you can. They're amazing, aren't they? Yeah. I'll keep you updated. <sighs> if you have any questions, do feel free to message us. Um, you've got. We've got about 15 minutes. 
until we bring your uh, bring your uh, your your masterclass, which is very exciting. We've also got an amazing closeout deal for you, and we've got a competition to do, uh, but not before we talk about um, a, a gemstone variety launch. And I say that because I've never seen anything like this. But let's talk about chalcedony. What is chalcedony? Um, uh, well, it, it's it's, it's a, a gemstone which often gets confused because there's different varieties of your chalcedony. Um, belongs to a species, here we go. Um, this is off our, off our Gemporia Learning Library. It's, it's available there. Uh, chalcedony gemstone belongs to a species of quartz group of minerals. Chalcedony is a gemological term applied to all varieties of quartz in uh, a, a crypto crystalline form. Um, it can occur in a wide range of colors, patterns, and sizes. Um, it is known to set up stand, uh, set the standards uh, high when it comes to the hardness of the jewelry gemstone. The word chalcedony is derived from the Latin word chalcedonius. Have I said that? Chalcedonius? Uh, which is believed to be derived from chalcedon. Uh, though its composition, this stone can be typically identified from uh, other minerals. It has a superior hardness and is a compact uh, to dense form of silica. Chalcedony is a wonderfully unusual material in appearance with a, a wealth of appealing popular variations such as agates, aventurine, carnelians and onyx. In ancient times, this family of beautiful gems was highly prized for its use in adornment and a visual seal. So they used to use this literally to, uh, to seal things like your, uh, your letters. Uh, often found in sedimentary and volcanic environments, the gemstone is, co is a compact silica. We've covered that. It takes a long uh, period of time for the formation of chalcedony stone to occur. The process involves a slow uh, deposition of minerals into the pockets of another type of rock, <coughs> such as granite. Areas that are prone to host volcanic activity have the most abundant chalcedonic deposits. High quality chalcedony stones can be found all around the globe. Um, um, there's just some areas that are better than others. And then this literally just tells you about the locations, basically, and the translucency and the different colors that you can get. Uh, it it's between six and a half to seven on the most scale. But I wanted to scroll down a little, just, 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 just to jump to the next paragraph. In general, it is valued according to the standard of the gemstone quality, size, cut, quality, type. The color, clarity, and treatment of the stone will also affect its price significantly. The ethereal blue variety of this stone is incredibly popular uh, in contemporary society and has become a favorite gem um, of carvers and jewelry designers. Other prized examples include apple green chrysoprase which i know you've had also it's a variety of chalcedony and immediately it made me think oh, here we go which feature gorgeously striped patterns as well you can see the different varieties this immediately that's paragraph immediately made me think about this this launch because i was like so I've got rivers a chrysoprase running through this chalcedony and it's all natural all natural i don't i've never seen anything quite like it today and the whole showcase is made up of five strands. Five strands. Imagine how complimentary these are going to be alongside your pearls. What about they green lovely. angel light? Yeah, they, and they look lovely with the angel light we had, didn't they? they yeah. You know, and, and I also think, and you know, with, with lots of your pastel stones, they would work beautifully. Oh, well. yeah. We're going to start with the rondelles. Look at this for formation. It, it, it's absolutely gorgeous. Look at that. All, you know, we get blown away. We get really excited by, you know, and I love all these stones too, Botswana agates and bumblebee jaspers and uh, um, I'm trying to think of different varieties of jaspers out there. Look at, look at the markings that mm. you're getting here. Things like your blue lace agates. Look at the markings that you're getting with your apple, apple green chalcedony. Aren't they stunning? I think, Ross, you're starting with the most popular strand. Can you see those beautiful flashes of almost like peachy colours? I think Ross is starting with the with the most well will be the most popular strand. Do you think yeah, Claire? Yeah, and then you just go down, and then it, you you see more of the more of the stone. Now I'm looking at that that one there. Look at, oh, they're lovely little stories, aren't they? Yeah, yeah, little stories within a page. 
all naturally occurring. I think you're going to, if you love this parcel, I think you're going to want to get involved. You're going to need this shape to go alongside the other shapes. Yes, yeah. Oh, look at that. Look at that marking. They are Actually, beautiful. And then, the, and then the one above there, the darker. Yeah, they're incredible, aren't they? I'm visualising almost rivers of chrysoprase literally uh, running through over millions of years under the very specific geological and gemological requirements. Look at, I love that one. To create mm. this amazing Mother Nature made gemstone. At 39.99, we're not closing there. There is a hundred or less of each of these. A, ver a gemstone variety that I don't think we've ever seen before at 20 pounds only. Visually, look how beautiful that is. Mm. And there's so much interest, isn't there, in the... And I mean, absolutely, especially the ones that, you know, towards the middle, they are they're great sizes, aren't they? Yeah. Really, really great sizes for, for rondelles. I love this strand. I absolutely love this strand. We've, we do a lot of... In fact, what day have we got slider bracelets on the weekend? Friday. Got the most perfect slider bracelets coming up on Friday that you could literally just put a section. Yeah. Because this is the kind of gem that I would want to see. And 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 one on a on a cord as well. I think yeah. that's a nice um the, the type of gemstone, the markings and um yeah. you know that size, yeah. Look at this. Oh yeah, so when you're seeing it like that, yeah. You could possibly even oh you could possibly even ream it, maybe. Have a go. See if you can set gemstones, further gemstones within this one. Peachy colours running through. Mm. Should we take it down even further? Get a new variety of gemstones into your stashes, into your collections. I, I might be wrong. Listen, if I am wrong, I do apologise. But I don't recall ever seeing apple green chalcedony like this. I've seen lots of different chalcedonies in my time. Not, I don't... No, I would have said this was maybe a, a type of opal, possibly. Mm. Yeah, I'd have gone with maybe uh, some variety of opal, but no, Cal said me, 14 pounds and 99 pence. Hiya, Jill. Uh, oh, wow, these Cal Sedneys are so pretty. Just gorgeous. What about pink jade with it? Oh, that's a lovely mm, idea. Nice, Jill, yeah. It's a yeah. lovely idea. Yeah. Yeah, if ever you get the chance to have a, a, to pink, uh, pink jade. Uh, yeah, beautiful. Abs and pearls. I think it would be absolutely gorgeous with your pearls. Mm. Yeah, be very nice. Or how about green chalcedony with more green chalcedony? This is the most popular on pre-order. I get it. I do get it. Look at the difference. Oh. They're, they're incredible, aren't they? Just have the difference of how it's been cut. That's wonderful. It's almost like that, you know, like a marbling effect, isn't it? And all, all natural. Look how pure that mm. white colour is. Mm. You can still get hold of the rondelles. Um, we're just mindful of time. Look at that. Again, it's that pure white colour. And, and I mean, you know, any, any of these strands, you know, like I say, so I think it's, it's Saturday. I've got... Um, We've got base metal gallery wire. And, you know, I'm deserting and you on Saturday. I know, yeah. Sorry. I know. It's OK, I forgive you. It's yeah. Willow's birthday. Yeah, that's allowed. Yeah. But the gallery would be incredible. Oh, it would be amazing. And yeah. they are like little works of art. Right? Yes, you know, yeah. You and you want to frame, frame them. them. Yeah, frame them, don't you? Totally natural. Never seen anything like it before. With your jadeites, I think this would look absolutely beautiful, like your apple blossom uh, green jadeites. £14.99. pence. Remember, um, it, it, there we go, the, the, the actual uh, patterning within your, uh, within your chalcedony, the variety, the colour, etc., significantly affects the price. And yet here we are, surely, surely, I'll be honest, this is so new to me, I know very, very, very little about the prices that it can command elsewhere. But I, want, I shouldn't imagine £14.99 is a price that many of us um uh many of us we've looked at lots of like marlas oh, and long line that. necklaces haven't we you know with tassels you know that to me would be uh, you know the the perfect shape to have above the tassel because then you'd have the movement wouldn't you so you'd be yeah. seeing all the way around it so you'd see all those markings and just having having one on its own it, it tends to make you study that one doesn't it totally that you, you fully appreciate there is a there is one issue though actually choosing which one which one you'd go for <laughs> yeah yeah 
I really like this one and I really like that yes, one. Yes, yeah. I've got two favourites on this strand. I love that big one because it's so pure. And I also like this one, which almost got like a ripple effect across the surface. Yeah, yeah. They are like pieces of art, you know? But yeah, then look at that. Look at the waves on to go to a that's, gallery. That's like waves, isn't it? Oh, Turn it on yes. its side. It's like, yeah. Oh, yeah. That one? Yeah. Like you've gone, you know, seeing the... the that's like a on. zebra. Yeah, I can see that. And this one's like a little, like a little sunset just here. Like a tree above the zebra. Yes. How beautiful. You get lost in them. We, mm. I, I don't know. I haven't been to an art gallery recently. I think I went to the V&A, which is not cheap to get in, is it? It's not cheap, let's be honest, to go into those museums and those galleries. You don't need to. You've got Mother Nature's yeah. gallery just before you at £14.99. I've got, remember, I've only got, what is it? One, two, three, four, five strands. That's it. And they're either 100 in quantity or less. So um, if you see one that you love, then make sure that you do, uh, you do check it out. Pauline, Beverly, Renfusha, Penny, hello to you, Brenda, new customer, Helen, Nicolette. Uh, Lincolnshire's got three, Maeve, Sheila, Pauline, Isle of Sky, Susan, Alison, keep dialing through. Now, there's two tumbles. We're strapped for time, okay. Which, when you say small, okay. We're going to bring the other strands at another time just because we've got a master class and I've got some amazing demos. Okay. Let's go. Let's jump into the tumbles. They're cool, aren't they? Oh, look. Mm. That looks like a sweet. Look at that. Mm. These would be great in your slider bracelets as well, wouldn't they? Perfect. Yeah. Which you've got on Friday. Amazing slider bracelets coming up, snake slider bracelets. Just one of those. Just one of those. How tactile levels and areas of your translucency. Now, am I doing this now? Oh, okay. In a second. When it comes to chalcedony, there's lots of different varieties, which is amazing. They're all fascinating occurrences um, of Mother Nature. But look at that. What is it that created that area of translucency? What is it that created that area of, uh, of opacity oh, well, yeah. and those beautiful colours? Mm. Because this is our last auction of your apple chalcedony. We've got two more strands that we'll launch on another day. Should we do a little bit of a, a, should we do a special unplanned price? Please know that when we do bring you the other strands, they're not going to be at that price. This is completely unplanned. Just because we've got an hour left in show, we've still got lots to squeeze in. Are you ready? There is double figure quantity, brand new variety of, uh, of chalcedony that we've never seen before. It's beautiful. It's absolutely stunning. Wow. Nine pounds and 99 pence only. They're gorgeous. These would be amazing gurus to your marlins. Mm. This one on some shepherd hooks would be stunning. They're fascinating, aren't they? <sighs> love them, love them, love them. Look at that. You can get lost in gemstones like this. It's not reconstituted, it's not created. It's all mother nature. And every single one has a story to tell. Just awesome. Oh, I like that one. It's cool, isn't it? I can see a sandy beach. Yeah, the, yeah, dunes and little pools. Oh, like a river with An some estuary. big rocks, Is yeah. Like this oh, one. and I like that one. <gasps> it's amazing, isn't it? So wow. gorgeous. Look at this one. <gasps> Look how different that one is. That one's got a really... Oh, oh and yes. <gasps> Still not done. What are you doing, Ross? Uh, okay, he says... Knee jolt reaction this was. He goes, you know what? There's a bigger quantity of this one. I beg your pardon. I thought it was a double figure quantity. Okay. Knee, this is knee jolt though, you know, Ross. Um, well, it's a re he's been reactive, isn't he? 
No reason, though, because there's lots of people there. Please know, though, that the other um, apple green calcedony strands will not go to the price that we're about to do. It's purely because we've got a bigger quantity and also we've, we've got to leave the other two strands there because um, we've got our masterclass to bring you as well. Single figure price tag, not even stopping there. Stoppering? Stoppering. Not even stopping. Oh, morning, Mariette. Hello, Mariette. Yeah, hello, darling. Hello. hello to Penny. Hello to uh, Durham, Judith, Elizabeth. Hello to Perth and Kinross, Jill, Anne. Hello to Flincher. Hello to Sheila. Hello to Helen. Hello to Sorry. Hello to Alison. Hello to Julie. Everybody's paying that final low. Oh, slow, isn't it? Very good. Ross has gone rogue again. He has. Look at him. <laughs> little celebratory dance. <laughs> <laughs> what an opportunity, though, to get a taster of this gemstone. I know, but an, uh, but an absolutely gorgeous, it's gorgeous It's so pretty. Gemstone. What about this as something like, you know, you can get the paler colours of labradorite. Yeah, I was thinking Labradorite, yes, yeah, Ooh. yeah, with the rondelles, I was thinking I that. Definitely I definitely think yeah, there's some pearls. Like the grey type, Ooh. yeah. Um, what about pearls, Labradorite, or Jadeite, it's all that. Listen, I'm going to leave it with you because um, there is a big quantity of them. It is still very much uh, live, that auction opportunity. Yeah. So now during the break, during the break, uh, we've got a few anagrams for you. Um, three. Three anagrams for you to figure out. Now, and we will announce the winner. We've got to announce yesterday's winner. Um, there's three anagrams, not five. I don't know why it says that on this slide. But anyway, three anagrams that you need to figure out. So it's the festive word scramble. Uh, to win £25 credit to your account, a winner will be chosen at random and we will announce it within this show. Apologies, we totally forgot yesterday. Apologies. Um, here we go. So do you want to see them? Yeah, let's Christmas see them. Christmas themes anagrams. I'm so rubbish at these. Uh, I've got it. Oh, I have got it. Oh, no, I haven't. Is it two separate words? Are they all mixed up though, aren't they? Okay. Okay, first one, write down the letters. Or take a photo on your phone. Esca. Lunes. <laughs> the next one. Yeah, I've got it. You're really good at these, though, aren't oh, you? Oh, no, I'm yeah, rubbish. I've got it. I've got it. Yeah, I got that one. Okay, take a photograph. Next one. Simotlit. <laughs> take a photograph, and we need you to text in with your account number. One, uh, one person will be selected at random and we will announce yesterday's winner as well. Apologies. Um, and you'll receive £25 credited to your jewellery maker account. Yeah. We'll oh, yeah. Have a go. And we'll announce the winner at the end of the show. Absolutely. I'm rubbish. You're good at those, aren't you? Well, I'm not, I was okay at those. I'm, I'm not usually, but yeah. I'm oh, yeah. Rubbish. And have a go because, yeah. I pull, the really, I pull a really stupid face when I'm doing those. Can't <laughs> anyway. Come back. That's my demo face. Because we've got an amazing masterclass uh, yeah. coming your way. Some beautiful signet rings with Claire McDonald after this. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. 
If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Jewelry Maker presents the Great British Summer. As the heat wave hits, the British public are making the most of it. Why it is still here? Here's Carol, buying an ice cream from a local vendor. Playing games at the fair. And frolicking about in the sun. But Carol has forgotten that Jewelry Maker celebrates Christmas in July. A chance for customers to get their supplies in ready for their Christmas designs and gifts. So Carol can say goodbye to that ice cream and hello to that Christmas jumper as we present Christmas in July. Oh, Carol, you scamp. Jewelry Makers, this Wednesday at 10 a.m. to celebrate Christmas in July, I get to bring you a very, very special gemstone. I get to bring you Sakota Emerald. Now look, I've worked with this gemstone since about 2006, and it has always been one of the most prolific and sought after emeralds from the Bahia state in Brazil. Because originally in Brazil, up until the 1980s, the Carniba mine was the mine that everybody utilized, that everybody wanted to get their hands on. But move back 12 years, and this discovery at the Sakota mine was groundbreaking. And this Wednesday at 10 a.m., I get to bring it back for you guys for one special show, one special hour, unbelievable prices, beautiful greens, and most importantly, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to give you the finest quality that we can bring. Jewelry makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. absolutely love the pieces that you have created. Oh, I love these kits. Absolutely love them. I think it's a, such a clever, um, uh, uh, I guess, well, I, don't know, I don't know, component, but it's just a really, really clever design. Yeah, but um, you do your twist design. on it, though. You do, you will, as per usual. I remember you coming up. The first, it was you. It was you that said to me, Elle, this is something I want to try. And it's when I was helping out kit team, a, what, a couple of years ago? Maybe a year ago? And you said to me, Elle, I want to try this. I want to take a pre-existing mount. Oh, yes. And I, I, I think I, think I was in my garden or something. When I, we talked yeah. about it on the and phone. I, yeah, well, yeah. And I was like, yes. okay, let's do it. I was, yes. helping, I was literally helping Kit Team out. Yes, I remember. And it worked. And look at what's, look at what's, what, what's now. Oh, look at those, Claire. They're stunning, aren't they? Absolutely stunning. They're all available on pre-order. Now, if I've never done soldering before. Yeah. So I would, I would say with these, are, again, because if we think about it as that component and we're looking at the so much, so yes, you do your signet rings with them, mm. but if you, if you didn't want to, so I, I, you can see, so I've soldered them and we'll go through that. So it's complete ring shank. If you don't want to solder, 
what you could do is you could just uh, uh, we can shape the and form the form it around a ring mandrel, and you could have like a, um, an adjustable, extendable <coughs> band because they're so beautifully finished. Yeah, they are. So, so you know, you could have you know, if you look at those rings where um, it's adjustable size. So even if you don't want to solder, you know, you might you might have to um, uh, you know work um, uh, if you, you you can't necessarily put the accents on. Um, but then you can just just glue the glue the stone into place. So don't feel you have to solder with these. Oh. Here's the first kit, but have a little look on the website, all the W's at jewelrymaker.com, because there are different shapes as you've seen with Claire, mm. some of Claire's jewelry. I'm starting with a square which fits, which you've got the perfect tie design. A tie it's design lovely, calibration. isn't it? Really lovely, and you know, signet signet rings are. I mean, they're so. I mean, they're, they're a classic, aren't they? Oh, but absolutely. But they are so big at the moment. I, I, so I, so big. I think most of us. Well, certainly, I, I remember my dad always wore a signet ring. It was yeah, to him yeah, his eighteenth yeah. or tenth birthday. Yeah. Look at that. So you've got a perfectly calibrated, just a you know, simple tiger's eye to go in what is a huge amount of sterling silver. Um, shop ahead and you can see the different sizes that we have for you. You've also got the signet rings without any gemstones. So if you oh, wanted lovely. to um, just have it in the precious metal. We've got hearts, we've got ovals, we've got, um, yeah, further, uh, show, they're available on pre-order. So have a little look or chat to our call centre. It's a massive amount of sterling silver. I love this idea of actually taking um, the signet ring and actually using it incorporating it then into your slider style bracelets you're a genius Claire thank you very much thank you I think, I, think it's because, you. Because, so I was looking at <laughs> you are you're a clever egg you are because you know what every every time we always have a laugh at a joke but Claire you you're a professional glass blower <laughs> Oh, wow. That's what you did yeah. degree in. Yeah. She's also a gas engineer. Yeah. I know. And you can create pieces of jewellery like this. You're pretty clever, Egg, you are. Not a very good cook. Oh, well, I can do that part. Yeah. Not that, no. Can't be good at everything, can you? Are you ready and for glass this? Glass is very, very useful. <laughs> day to day life. <laughs> it's fun, though, I bet. £14.99. See, that's so good, isn't it? So, so good. I mean, if you were to buy, the, if you were to see this, a one of a kind, sterling silver and tiger's eye um, bracelet in, in, in any boutique shop, it's not going to be £15, is it? No, definitely, no, definitely not. not. No, no. And I just, I love the fact that with that, so with these blanks, you know, it's, it, you know, that you're going to get, you get a big size out of it if you, um, well, we can have a look, at, you know, we can have a look and um, see what size it ends up. And how have, you, have you done these little bits? Where have you got these little bits? So the little from? bits, so I had little, I think you might have some little accents coming up. So they're just solderable, um, little solderable bees. And so what you can do with those is you can position, um, you can position the bees. So we've got the bees coming up. I think, I think you have got bees, yeah. We've got bees. Yeah. So you can, can, we, can, can we shop ahead with the bees? Yeah. So, they're available um, on pre-order. So what you can what you can do with a mixture of those is um, so you can see maybe more on the more on the ring because if I bring that one in mm. um, so you can see there how I've positioned the the B so it's slightly so it's coming over the stone as well oh. so when you solder it um, depending on where and and you know don't get me wrong you have a, you can have a couple of goes at this um, you can see so I had to adjust mine a couple of times but and then you almost like fold it over so. It, it's doing so it's, it's that decorative look and then it's a well, it's, it's like a fancy prong really, well, yeah it's it? added security yes. isn't it amazing yeah. Yeah. yeah amazing amazing the bees are coming up you can shop ahead and pre-order those solderable bees solderable bees love that which is going to work across all of these beautiful designs um yeah just adding they're lovely as well have you got beautiful this? kits, aren't they? Amazing kits. Really beautiful. Amazing kits. If you've never, ever, ever done soldering before, it is. It, it, well, you need very little components. Very, very little components. And something like this. So, you know, have a, I'd have a go with this because, um, you know, a lot of the bulk of, the, of it has been, has been done for you, really. So, um, you know, you haven't got to... You haven't got to think about um, making the ring shank yourself. You know, you know that the stone is going to fit. It's got a lovely little ledge, so if you do need to sort of like file a little bit off, mm. um, but yeah, they, they, you know, it's a. I think they're really, really lovely. Really beautiful. Yeah, I mean, this very, fits. very clever. 
Well, the one, it's the one you're looking at, sorry. It's actually opal, white opal. So you've got the sterling silver, and I'm bringing that to you right now, and white opal, which is obviously creating that piece that we were just admiring. White opal. It's gorgeous stone, isn't it? Absolutely stunning. So if you're inspired by this piece, is it that piece? No, it's that piece. That piece just there. The stars are also available on pre-order, so you can have a little have a little uh, uh, peruse on the website, all the demos at jewelrymaker.com. Um, yeah, there's a section for you to pre-order. If you're having any difficulty, then speak to our call center and they will uh, they will add it to your order. Um, it, it gets you the oval. I really like that one. It's nice. I'm just I'm just looking at that and thinking you could you could almost do a lovely pendant as well, couldn't you? Going with, yeah. the, um, with the if you've got maybe the uh, angelite that. That would look nicely there with the, the white opal, the stars. Amazing. So to get hold of your mm. opal, your sterling silver oval signet. Holding my breath here. Oh, how's that, how, how's that even lower? Because if you were to retail it, Claire. Yeah. Surely forty pounds. Yes, I would say so for a, signet, a gemstone signet ring. Yeah, yeah at least, yeah. and that's me being very conservative. I think. What are you doing, Ross? Okay, on the next three kits with gemstones, and they are gemstones. We're going to take them <gasps> under ten pounds. So you can make this ring. Obviously, you've got to add your stars, which are also available. You can get the actual opal and signet ring for under ten pounds. Goodness That's... me! And that gives you the option. You can, you know, you make a ring. You can make that the the connector bit in the slider bracelet. You can make it, um, you know, a pendant in there. There's lots and lots you can do. Oh, we've also got lapis lazuli and also blue goldstone to bring you. Um, which you can shop ahead and pre-order on also, all going under £10. Amazing. There we go. We said it. We said it out loud. Shop ahead. Basically, we're very mindful of the time, obviously, and we want to bring you all of these amazing kits. So literally putting it out there, This, this the, the, ne the next three kits, under £10. <sighs> under £10. That's a huge amount of sterling silver. It is, yeah. And, just, and the fact that it's shaped, though, it's, a, it's, it's the weight of it, but it's, it's all shaped. You know, these are casts that, that you have to do, you, you know, you don't have to do as much to them. You know, to, to, for us to create something like that would t take a, a long time. Well, yeah, because surely this bit's tricky. Yeah. That bit, that's the, the tricky bit. And that is solid 925 it sterling is, silver. Yeah, yeah, you can see how well they're made, yeah. I mean, if look you, at that. Argos do signet rings, don't they? Little signet rings. About twenty-four pounds ninety-nine. Nowhere near as much sterling silver though as you're getting in here. And it doesn't have to be. If you don't solder, you said earlier on, just literally do a wrap yeah, around. Yeah. Um, when we first launched these, that's what you did. Yes, it is. Yeah, yeah. So if you look back on um, uh, on YouTube, yeah. That's what that's Willow wears. Is it one of your wrap arounds? Aww. She absolutely loves it. Yeah, oh, we made along bugs. together, didn't we? Yeah. A little make along together. She absolutely loves it. So it's it can almost grow with them if you're thinking for uh, for young for the younger generation. Um, here we go. This is white opal. So furthermore, if you know somebody that is uh, an October baby, you can still get hold of the lapis lazuli under ten pounds, and you can get hold of the blue gold stone, um, also available nine ninety nine to get hold of the oval um, with which makes this one here with. Uh, the white opal, which is just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful, Claire. Do make sure you shop ahead um, on all the kits. I don't even know, Ross, how we're gonna how we're gonna get through everything today. How are we gonna uh, and of course, any questions that you have for Claire, would you like me to dive into the demo? Let's get the next two kits and then uh, and then we'll dive into the demonstration. Let's do the lapis lazuli next. Did you get the lapis, Claire? I don't think I did, no. Oh. You know where it's going, though, don't you? It's a lovely pounds. colour, isn't it? You don't see the shape of lapis very often, do we? That's nice. Oh, it's a beautiful mm. colour. Bryce is on your screens. So you know where it's going to? There it is. There's the lapis lazuli. There's the oval. Perfectly calibrated. So you just pop it in? Yeah. So I use um, 
some of them, uh, so use a little bit of glue and then you can see, so with some of the stars uh, and the bee, I push, push that over as well. I love these. I can visualise a bee with, oh, the star for lapis lazuli, that makes sense. Yes, yeah, oh, that'd that's be nice, very, yeah. Very, is, it, is it Van Gogh I'm thinking of? Yes, on? yeah. Is it Vincent Van Gogh? Yeah. Yeah, if you had the star alongside the lapis lazuli, I think that would, it would definitely, definitely work. Nine pounds and 99 pence. Um, it's an eight by six lapis lazuli cabochon. That, well, it's not, technically it's not a cabochon because it's actually like a flat oval, which I really it's, like. It's a, it's a nice, this is a nice, I'd say if you've not maybe set, set many stones, because you're just going to, you're going to make sure that obviously it sets in the, um, uh -huh. into the, onto that lip and then a um, little bit of glue. So this is your a nice shape. Yeah, and it's less likely to scratch either uh, as well because it has that flat yeah. surface. So oh, this is your um, beautiful midnight blue. That's great, isn't, isn't it? Isn't that? Now oh. this needs the stars. <laughs> it needs the stars. Oh, don't you think you can get hold of those sterling silver Wonderful. stars um, off the uh, uh, pre-order shop ahead? How many do you get of the stars, by the way? A pack of three. Same with, the, same with the little bumblebees. You've got your beautiful, beautiful midnight blue gold stone here for £9.99 pence only. Perfectly calibrated to go within your signet rings. Um, any questions, again, do message in. We would love to hear from you. Take it away, okay, Claire McDonald. Thank you. <laughs> Which would you like? I'm just gonna, can I pinch one of these as well? Yes. Is that right? Thank you. Okay, so what, what we're going to do... Do you want the gold stone as well? Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. So my starting point, I'm, I'm going to I'm going to show um, some of it, uh, some old solder, some old talk through. Okay. Okay. So the first thing um, we're doing because you've got quite a lot of um, silver there, is um, so I annealed this. So just torch on it, no soldering, just to get it so it's nice sort of um, like cherry red. Let it cool down, and then we can start to um, we can start to um, to uh, form it okay so let's have a look at it and then I can talk through and show you if you don't want to do any soldering uh, we can stop at that point and then we'll, we'll continue on okay so let's have a look how I'm going to start and do some of this so I'm going to hold on here on my ring mandrel I'm going to start and just let's start to get the, the nice shape so if you wanted to do for example the um, uh, the um, the bangle. Obviously, you're not going to take it to, to this point. So, if you're going to do the bangle, you would just leave it flat, and then I use my forming pliers uh, right at the very end. But because we're going to do a ring with this one, so we are going to form round. Okay. So I'm going to turn it round. Do I do the same on here? Okay. So I'm just gonna keep going. <laughs> Hold still. Oh, is that my is that my um <laughs> is that my planking scab? No. Oh. Don't, don't pick your scabs. <laughs> <laughs> I, was thinking, I was thinking I could feel it. I thought. Oh, is that is that from planking? Ah. <laughs> 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 Do you know what I was shamed into when I had to plank on the? Uh... <laughs> oh, sorry. Here I am. <laughs> when I did, when I planked on air, and I thought that was appalling. So yes, yeah, so I have been. Uh... I think that's my fault, wasn't it? Yeah. Well, it wasn't. You didn't say you have to plank on air. No. Well, I asked you to. But you did. Okay. So if we wanted to, um, if we wanted to just leave it. So I should have moved that out of the way a bit. Hopefully, hopefully you can see. If you want to so start to form it, you'd obviously uh, choose your choose your size, and if you want to just leave it as um, so that it's extendable, it's going to look something like that. So you can see if you if you kept it at the size, this is going to allow you to make a really actually you know let's have a look at how big this would be. We'd take it to so something like that. What are we looking there? So you're looking at about. Uh, a W, so you can see that is there. So you, look, you know, it's going to go up. It goes up to uh, quite a big size. So I'm just going to bring it back up, 
and I'm going to sort of go back and, and just make it so that we get it a little bit smaller. So I'm going to work my way down and let's keep going. Okay. So you, you would take a bit, bit longer uh, than I have there. So what, what I'm going to pop that down for a second. I would then use my, um, then use my uh, a saw, and you can spend much longer than I have there if we look at that. So you would just sit in, let's take your time, and let's give that a bit more of a, so it's going, and round, get a nice round edge there. So you do all that, get your much neater, your ring, finish there. So now I'm going to just, let me just get my pliers, sorry. Okay. So I'm going to take my time now. I would actually use my saw, but I'm going to use my flush cutters for speed here so that we can get on and solder this bit. So I'm going to go flush side this side, keep all these little bits. And come this side. And let's pop that on there to keep those little bits over there. I'm just going to file this down a little bit so I've got a much neater join. So let's open these up a bit. I don't want to take too much off. I'm just taking little amounts there. Because remember, what we want is when we're going to solder... We want to have a good read, like fitting that jigsaw together. We don't want any gaps in between. So let's get rid of, you can see just tiny, tiny filings just on my finger here. And let's bring this in. So we want to make sure that this is going to fit nicely there. So if I just pop my finger in there, we want to see that there's no, no gaps. So I'm just going to Clean that off just a little bit. Let's get that so just a tiny amount because we, I have I've, so I'd introduce heat when I'd annealed it. So I'm just going to clean that. I want to get it nice and clean so that it doesn't stop the solder from flowing. Okay, let's have a look all the way around. So sort of almost like with the jump ring, like back and forth. So that type of um, effect to get it so that when you open it back up that sort of spring shut and that we get a good good connection there and at this point we can re we can reshape this after we've um after we've soldered it so i'm going to have a look at that so i'm going to pop that down so again you'd be thinking about think about the um <clears throat> The amount of, of times that we, we're going to be soldering it. If we were just soldering it and you're just going to have it as a plain, um, the plain signet uh, ring, we can just have one lot of solder and that's fine. If you want to think about and you're going to add in the, the bees or the stars, you want to think about the different, um, the different layers of, of soldering. So uh, I'd start with my hard with this one. So what we'll do is I'll just open this, take out some of my solder so I do want to just have a little bit of have a little bit of flux on here so I'll just bring that round so that's why I wanted to just clean it up just a little bit and let's get some of that in there okay so let's bring that in now I'm going to take um, some of my I'm going to take a good amount so that hopefully we get to, we can get to see it go. Obviously, the more solder you, or the larger size that you put in, the more potentially you might have to clean up. It's just getting, always getting a balance so that it's nice that you can get to see when it goes. Oh, so that. I'm going to try and get that in there. So that will hopefully, okay, so let's have a look at that. So this is the bit that we're going to be looking at. Clear that out of the way. So if I put that down, let's have a look. So this is, if I position it like that, can we see? Yep. Yeah. Okay, so let's get some, let's have a look at that. So we can get a bit of heat in. And this is just using a fairly standard heat. Uh, yes, yeah, my blowtorch, yeah. 
yet. So let's keep looking at that seam there and we're going to try and get a bit of heat all the way around the piece but then concentrate on the area that, that we want to get. So let's keep going. The best thing ever, ready? There we are. So now I yeah. can already see. So did you see it went sort of more one side than the other? So if I introduce heat on the other side, that should draw draw the heat, that, that heat capillary should draw it over um, into, into the other side. The what, heat sorry? Heat capillary? Yes, yeah, like a capillary action, isn't it, of, of heat? Told you she was So that. I'm going to just take that over and we're going to pop that in there. Have a look now. So yeah, you can you can already see. So you know what I'm saying about how much solder we'd have. Um, if you have a look at, at this side, so let's have a can you see across here. Mm -hmm. So yeah, you can see it's slightly shinier. So let's start. So that would then go into the pickle, but we can already see. So if I if we pretend we put it in the pickle, but let's have a look how this is going to start to buff up. And this is where you want to take your time. Have a look so we can start to see how that is going there. Can you see? So we can start. So what we don't want there is we don't want a seam. Let's have a look here. See how that is going. Yeah, so that's it. That needs a, you know, we're going to, we'd spend more, but that's just been a, a couple of buffs, a couple of seconds of getting that so that that is cleaned up but you can see how that is starting to, to go you would then do exactly the same well a lot of that would have gone once it comes out of the pickle that's sort of the um the discoloration there you can then go and work in with um if you've got some of your round files go in i don't want to introduce too uh many scratches but we could go in with our curved needle file and get get rid of a little bit of that solder so you would you would work um, like that. Now we can already see we need so it's 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 not exactly around. We've got we've got sort of like a bump here. So we can then go back, and we can go back again, and we can start to get so it's a bit more, and it's round. You would clean all of this up. Now at this point, when you're happy with the the, the shape of it, and you've polished a lot of this bit, this would be where we would then. So you can already see how this is starting to, so that was not long enough. I'm trying to show you all the processes. So you would then go through, but you can see already it's a much rounder shape by just going on with your, onto your ring mandrel, either your hide hammer or your, um, your nylon hammer, and you're just going to work, work your way around to get it. So you're also thinking going this way around. And then I would also, we want to think about how you can see it's a bit wobbly that way. So we can put it onto our block, give it a bit of a tap. So you're looking at it as, as a, a, a you know, 3, 3D object. Then, so when you've cleaned up all of this, and again, so if we have a, because it looks, I mean, silver's amazing, and then when you, you know, you introduce a little bit of, 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 of buffing, polishing, and you can really see how, it's, you know, it's starting to come up really, really beautifully. Especially so what, if you've got that Dremel tool earlier yeah, on. Yeah, well, perfect, because then you would use, you know, like the, 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 um, the mops that you've got on that rouge that's there. Rouge. But this just gives you an idea of, you know, how, how beautifully it's going to come up. So I would, while you can access everything, you get all of these bits nice and cleaned up. Start to see how this is going. Then if you're going to put on the bees or the stars. Well, we'll do the bees now, shall yeah, we? Yeah, lovely. You do get, yes, you do they are lovely. Really, really Aren't lovely. Aren't they, Jess? Especially yeah. with gems. I, I love the idea of using them alongside the uh, tiger's eye. Yeah, it looks good, doesn't it? Like <clears throat> so you get three of them. They're very detailed little guys. Look. Beautiful amounts of detail in the bumblebees. You can even see his little antennae. The detail is incredible, isn't it? And his little fuzzy butts. Let me just turn them over so that's so you can see they're flat on the underside because obviously you need them to you need them to be flat to go onto the rings, don't you? Um, you yeah. get all three. You won't believe how low these are going. <coughs> For one, Ross says this is mad. They could be little bats. I think they're ever so sweet. 
Oh, that's ever so good. You have a look at her. If, have a look. If you put them on um, plain wire, you know, have a look at how, you know, the stacker bee, those stacker rings with bees on mm. are so popular. That's a brilliant price. How beautiful. So wait, I mean, I know they're, they're, they're you know, they're one component to be added, but I could, I, I could make these. You've got enough bees to make the, the, the bracelet and also the matching ring. Because you get three. So if you get two of your kits, one of your bumblebees, you can make both of those pieces. How amazing is that? Super cute. Nice, aren't they? So, no, is it? So the kits is how much? £15. So £30 for two. And then three bees, £35. I can make both those pieces, Claire. That's incredible, isn't it's it? It's amazing. You'd expect it to be, well, at least triple figures, or I certainly would anyway. And that, that B shape is, is very, very good because you've got, you've got the wings, haven't you? So you could angle it so that it's a wing coming across the stone. You could angle it like I have with the ring there. So it's the main, the body and the mm. wings. You can see on the, on the bracelet, it's, sort of, it's, it's the head. There's lots of points there that you can then um, manipulate and push down that will cover little bits of the stone. You could almost angle, yeah, like, like I said, have them in flight, couldn't you? Yes. So yeah. could, you, could I push the little wings up? Yeah, yeah, close, there's like nothing to stop you. Around. Yeah, you absolutely you could. You could, um, uh, if you've got, you know, like what they're called, the, um, you know, the way, you, uh, the doming blocks, you can, you can curve them like that. That'd be lovely. On the verge of selling out, should we do the, should we do the stars quickly? Look, mm, there you go. Little kissy bees now. Little kissy bees. Look at them. Let's do the stars. I love what, the, what you've done with these because they're actually like a prong now, aren't they? Yes, yeah, yeah. And, and, and also, if you wanted to, Sorry. because of the, how many you get in there, you could make it so it's like decorative shoulders. So you could you see where the one is on the shoulder. You could just turn that, um, have the other yeah. one um, on the other side. There you go. Look. Oh, I love the one with two. So sweet. Four pounds and 99 pence for your solderable accents. It's genius and it takes a signet ring to something let's be honest that is quite plain would we agree i don't know signet rings are yeah but yeah but yeah. takes it to something really unique yeah yeah really unique you know you know your bespoke jewelry 4.99 and it's the positioning which i, I think that's amazing is it on the, which one i can't quite see but one of these rings you've used the prong of the star to help yeah to hold it in and support it a bit so it just sort of like comes over comes over the stone because I also think it's a nice they're such that you know they're really really nicely made and I do think it looks nice when you, you know you can see that against the the stone so can you see yeah so on that one on the darker stone yeah I've sort of just curved it although it was flat yeah. um yeah just like pushed it over pushed I, it over the stone I love that love it how many do we have of those there was a hundred um the bees have pretty much sold out half the stock of these um has already gone so make sure you do check them out i've got one more to bring you until we before we, before we dive back into your signet ring demo um and this is all about the flowers this is a lovely one i didn't get this one this is really pretty <sighs> it's nice oh, it's isn't like it? all little, the detail in there like little forget me not yeah how sweet that is all that sterling silver so you get one, but it's a big stone. Didn't you make a um, like a stacker style ring out of this? I feel I've 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 had that one before. Um, yes, and I have just done a plain stacker ring. Yeah, it's, it, you don't need to overcomplicate it. No, do you? not at all. I not feel like I feel like I've done. seen you yes. make a ring out of this. Yeah. Two ninety nine. Two pounds ninety nine. <laughs> and you could also put, um, if you didn't want to do rings with them, just use solder um, a jump ring on, and that's a really pretty, it's a sweet pendant, isn't it? Oh, yeah. And the okay. same with the bees and the stars. Well, you know what to do. Make sure you check out your baskets on these jewelry makers. Um, how many do I have of the flowers? 150 of the flowers. What do you mean? You, oh, okay, we're going to go lower. As if there's there much further, there isn't much wiggle room left, is there? Let's do it. If we can, we will, says, uh, says Roscoe. It's a no-brainer then now, isn't it? It's just a, it's a cheeky little add-it to your order. Yeah. That's, it is 925 sterling silver, and yet you're getting it for £1.99. Wow. 
that would look very nice with didn't did you have a plane did you have a plain one i did yeah that i mean one of those where if you've got a nice big base a it nice would look big lovely a on. nice big base yeah <laughs> i've got a big base <laughs> oh me too <laughs> all right <laughs> something like that Claire. <laughs> I'm yeah, sure you would position it no, far really more lovely. artistically than me. That's really lovely. And then if you've got that tool as well, you could, um, you could do an initial or something. Love you? it. Back to you, my darling. OK, so um, so what I was doing, I had a little buff then. I'm just trying the stone. So if we have a look. So think, always thing to think about when... Um, you know, you, you've got your two components. Is every, every step that you can, really, is to just keep... Because uh, we've changed the shape of it. So we just need to just go back and we're just going to just check that both components um, uh, fit. So I just want to check that that's going back in there, which it is. Now, if it didn't, uh, all we need to do is I'll just take that out. If we look at the, where it's going to sit. So we've, we've got a lot of um, a good chunky amount of, of uh, silver there and we can get rid of some of that so if you've got some of your um, maybe your, your files or um, different Dremel attachments uh, you, you can get in there or just a little file and just you're going to take away uh, or maybe some burrs or something take away a little bit of that metal until that, that you know it sits it sits back in so always you know go back and check um, if you've got your two components that they do that they do fit with each other so what I'd be thinking about now is I'd be thinking you'd be cleaning this up um, a lot more. And then it's looking at, so if we look at, say, maybe something like this with the, the bees. So if I pop that on, let me move that out of the way in just a minute. So as with that, you know, all, as with the soldering again, now what's the lovely thing on here is you have got that, that nice, sort of like quite a, a chunky flat section there. So it's going to make good contact um, with the side because, again, you've got those quite nice chunky shoulders as well on the signet ring. So you'd be looking at this. You could use your, uh, your permanent marker uh, to set it up as well. So what I did with mine is if you've got your... So if we set it up like this... And this is a, this is a bit, I think, that probably takes the, takes the most time. So... You just take your time, you could mark it out. You could measure and mark it out. So let's have a look. We want it to sort of come in. Let's have a look how this is gonna look. So we wanna look from the, the front. So we could measure, you'd be measuring sort of, I guess, here and here and at those points, if you wanted it to have it so that it's very even. Um, or you could have it to the side as well. So that when we turn it like this, we roughly know, because obviously we can't see what's on this side here. We've turned it to the, to the side and we can line up this point here. So if you wanted to have, and you would have enough, because like I say, it's quite, it, it's a good, uh, all of these uh, little accents are a nice thickness. So. What you could do with this is, so then you would solder it here. Now, remember, we've had hard solder on that seam. So you might want to go with a medium here. You could, uh, if you wanted to, you could use a little bit of solder on there, heat it so that it's just a bit like a, um, uh, you've done a first layer of, uh, of soldering. Then pick that, clean it up, pop it in your pickle, then pop it in, then heat it. So you haven't really got to worry about getting one of your little um your pallions to uh to balance what happens so. if you don't if you don't clean it up and pickle it will it not you won't get good because you get a better contact between you think of any like dirt or or, or grease or it's gonna it, or it's gonna potentially interrupt okay. how well it's gonna it's gonna flow so although it's really tempting to jump to the next stage next stage and then finish the piece you know just just don't. take your time and just clean up in between and, and you will that will save you an awful an awful lot of time um so a couple of different ways you've also got lots of really good anchor points to hold on to uh, with these bees as well and then you'd be positioning this on here you could also there's enough room on that shoulder to um to be going like that too um again 
clean up, so you do all your soldering wherever your position was going to be. The last thing that you would do once you've polished all of that silver, so if you need to reshape it again, clean it up really, really nicely so it would come out looking that, that type of silver. And at that point, when you're happy with it, that's when you would finally go in. And I use a little bit of glue. And you just pop your stone in. And you can see how beautifully that's gone in. There, so just a little bit of glue, be patient, and then, yeah, there's your... There's how your lovely suffering. that is. It's a lovely plane, isn't it? I mean, it's a... It's gorgeous, Claire. Great. Look at that. And so in some places, you would pay literally hundreds of pounds for that. Mm, yeah. And you Signet pay... rings are, are massive, aren't they? Yeah. And it is destined to be one of those pieces, you know, like, like I said, my dad had a signet ring that he was, I think he was given when he was 21 mm, by his mum and dad. Fine, yeah. And he always wore it. Yeah. Never took it off. Never ever took it off. How amazing. So yeah, Thank lovely, you so lovely jewellery. Really beautiful. You're welcome. Really beautiful. And Enjoy again, those. They're uh, lovely. Across uh, for, for gents and ladies. Mm. Love it, love it, love it. Isn't she awesome, everyone? Make sure you check out your baskets on your kits. I've got two more auctions to bring you between now and the top of the uh, top of the show now i've got a close out deal with sterling silver and beautiful gemstones a multitude of gemstones but right now i'm going to bring you an entire bundle of aventurine now you know we said earlier on in the show um we were talking about the fact that in china they uh, you know jade is jade it's not necessarily they don't differentiate between sort of your nephrite and your jadeite now i'm not saying that this is jade but in some places they would describe it as jade purely on the color now it's not i would not i would never sit here and say look at this jade it's not it is a venturing but it's a beautiful genuine gemstone all the same that has those similarities. I do actually understand why people mention the gemstone, as long as they're not saying it's that gemstone. Aventurine has tiny, tiny, tiny in internal inclusions, much like your labradorite, much like your moonstone, which brings you a magical effect called aventurescence. It's like tiny, tiny little copper platelets that, protect, that literally play with the light internally. Green aventurine, yeah. I mean, if this were a bundle of imperial jade, you would be talking millions. Of course, millions of pounds. It is not that gemstone. But visually, I mean, it's for me, we haven't seen daylight as of yet this morning, but I can imagine it looks something like that. Mm. It's yeah, summertime. Yeah. Agreed. I'm going to have a shock yeah. with the heat, am I? I just get worried in this heat, that's all. I get really worried. Oh, over a thousand carats are from your 12 down to your four millimeters. So, you know, we fell completely head over heels in love with the angel light like, yes. earlier on. Yeah. Now imagine that piece in green aventurine, mm -hmm. which is totally natural. There's no enhancement to this whatsoever. Um, you get you get all five strands. All five strands. Ten pounds for beautiful aventurine, totally natural in its colour. It's such a distinctive green, I think. It's really soft. It's almost like a, a floral green, if that makes sense. You can imagine um, these, yeah, springy green. You can almost, almost imagine it in your, um, in your summer bouquets or your spring bouquets. There's no enhancement to this whatsoever. This is all Mother Nature's doing. Now, you haven't got to choose between the strands because you do get the, all of them as well. So it's not going to be brought to you sort of separate auctions like we did as your deal of the day. That's currently £10 per strand for beautiful, natural aventurine. Would you prefer this beautiful, natural, genuine gemstone at five pounds, over a hundred, you mean over a thousand? Over a thousand carats of natural adventure. Would you prefer it at five pounds each? Hmm. There's 12 mils in there. This has never been on a screen, so it's brand new. This would look lovely with the angelite, wouldn't it? It would, yeah. And the fact, because you've got all the graduations as well, haven't you? So it would look really good. I love it. I absolutely love it. 
It's going there. In 25 seconds, we are going to drop that price. I will announce the winner of the competition as well. Today's and yesterday's. Oh, yes. That's exciting, isn't it? £25 being credited to a couple of your accounts. Mm. That means you can buy this, because you just said, Ross, that it's going to be £5 per strand. You could get this entire bundle. It's more than a bundle. This entire parcel of natural green aventurine. £24.99. Did you just say Merry Christmas? I did, yeah. Merry Christmas. Stop it. Although you do look really cute in your T-shirt. <laughs> you do. £24.99. I adore Aventurine. I think it is one of those gemstones that, you know, it, 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 it doesn't get the limelight. Because let's be honest, Jadeite takes it. Jadeite takes it. It does. It's like, I'm rarer, yes, and I'm really beautiful, and I've got all the history. <laughs> That's what it does, which is lovely, and I adore Jadeite too. I really, really do. However, sometimes I just feel a bit sorry for Aventurine. Okay, I know, it's more yes, abundant, yeah, it is. Mean, yeah. Still natural, it's got beautiful translucency, which is what we always talk about with Jadeite. Mm. Sometimes I just feel a little bit sorry for it. And it's absolutely gorgeous. Five pounds per strand. Shall we announce the winner of the competition? Yeah. <gasps> Let's do it, because we, we did a competition yesterday, totally forgot to announce the winner, apologise. And we did a competition today. So, so the winner of yesterday's competition, which was, I can't even remember. Yeah, but what was the competition? It was a quiz, that's it. The easiest questions ever. Um, but the winner, and chosen at random, receiving £25 being credited to their jewellery maker account is Judith... Oh. From Hertfordshire. Yay! Yes, well done, Judith. You don't need to do anything because we've got your customer number. We will credit to your accounts. Now, today's... Do we do it now? Let's do today's. So, receiving, again, £25 credit to their jewellery maker account is... Alan. From Cheshire. Yay! Well done, Alan. Merry Christmas, both. to you. The Merry Christmas. Were Santa Claus. Yeah. Mistletoe, Jingle Bells. Yeah, I think this is one of the only ones I got in that time frame. I'm useless at those. Should we do a closeout deal? I think we should. Should we this do a finale? Lovely. Bow out. Yes. Yeah. Should we do something really naughty? Yeah. That is all sterling silver. Do you fancy being naughty? I do. Mm. I do. Why not? It's not only sterling silver, it's a massive amount of sterling silver. And you've got all of your beautiful, genuine gemstones, natural of which. Two grams of 925 sterling silver. Guess what? Bow out deal for us this, uh, this afternoon, oh. Claire. 17.99 is our normal uh, price point, which is mega. You'd surely pay that for the huggy earrings. Should we take this? Should I just say it, Ross? Under 10. We don't have to ask Ross twice. He's done it already. He's on it. Wow. You'd buy that. You'd oh, pay... lovely jump rings as well. It's a really nice size. <clears throat> you were, you, you were, you were um, playing with the jump rings. I was, right? yeah, I was. I was. I was using them as spacers. That's a really good... Um... You could solder those on there just because yeah, you've got they'd be stars. A, these are a really good size... Um... These are lovely. And they're closed, aren't they? Yeah, I think they are. Closed sterling silver jump rings. Look. There you go, you get a nice little selection of those. You're getting your little mini head pins, which I think are so adorable. Look at those. Adorable. You've got a pair of beautiful 925 sterling silver huggy earrings, and you're getting some absolutely beautiful, I know it doesn't say it on your graphics, but they're satellite beads, right? And you get those a pair of each. So they're interchangeable. Ooh. Oh, yeah, that's for the graphics. <laughs> I'm very slow on the uptake today. <laughs> they're earrings. Oh. <laughs> I'll tell you what, Ooh, these are. Over. I get what it means now. This is really good, isn't it? For that. Um... Oh, I love those um, those clo closings there. Me too. Sorry, it's only just dawned on me the fact that you can literally swap <laughs> them around, and that's the whole concept that they're in state. I think I think we've done very well for um, what little sleep I think we've probably had in to, that heat. To be fair, there are moments of unprofessionalism, but it's fine. You expect that of Claire and I, don't you? <laughs> um, Claire, thank you so much. Oh, I've had a um, lovely morning. Always do. Always, thank always you. do. You're back on the weekend, aren't I you? I am. I'm back on um, back on Saturday. Yes. Wonderful. Now yeah. I'm back with you 
on Friday morning where you've got an amazing show. <clears throat> Just absolutely an incredible brand new pearl, which oh. is natural color. Beautiful topaz literally going up towards it. I've also got, do I announce it now? Yeah, we've got Blue John Fluorite coming up as mm. well on um, on Friday's your deal of the day. Have a wonderful afternoon. Stay safe, everybody. Yeah, Stay take cool. Care. See you soon.